This stream contains fast flashing images that may affect viewers who are susceptible to photosensitive epilepsy or other photosensitivities. Viewer discretion is advised. Today, the stakes couldn't be higher. Masters Madrid is on the line. You win here, start packing, folks. Hello and welcome to day nine of VCT America's kickoff. Coming at you live from the Riot Games Arena in sunny Los Angeles, California. Of course, I'm Golden Boy here, currently yelling over some pictures of Sadak looking awesome as always. And I am joined by an esteemed cast of characters here today. We are joined by Ender, we got Mimi, and we have Van Vanity joining the desk today. How are you doing, man? Glad to have you here. I'm good, I'm good. How are you? Uh, you know, just living life, having a good time, excited for the games. I mean, we got two excellent matches on the horizon. You excited? Of course. Okay. Sad Hux, master class incoming. Oh, 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 okay, brother. Well, we're going to get that in a little one. bit. We're going to get that in a little bit. He's jumping the gun. I love it, though. There's a lot to talk about here, but let's go ahead and dive into the play-ins because we had three teams that were fighting for that last one slot in the playoff eight. bracket. And thankfully, I happen to have two of the people who commentated the last game right next to me, and they did such a serious good job while commentating that game. Oh, did we now? <laughs> <laughs> you were so serious. I man. wasn't sure I was going to get invited back this week, I'll be honest. Uh, but, I mean, no, the, like, the games were, were really exciting right off the bat. That, um, obviously, we had like the MRBR, and because they weren't able to, to come up with wins against Sentinels, it meant that this first map uh, between G2 and Sen decided everything. And after that, we had the fun, we had the turtles, we had the frogs, we had all the good stuff. A lot of silliness to be had, but it was an impressive run uh, by Sentinels to make it this far. They've had to play so many games, so yeah. many matches to make it to this point. And also, while they're doing so, they're debuting new stuff, yeah. new ideas, and I'm really excited to see what they can bring now in this final weekend. It was so sick to see them switch over to this, you know, gecko comp over on the sunset when they were one of the teams that were first debuting a lot of the ideas with like yeah. Breach, Fade, Raze, all of those agents. So then coming in after playing more maps than everyone else combined and having a brand new look on a map like that was great. Yeah, yeah. It's actually going to be quite exciting to see what they do. What did you, what did you make of them? I mean, I think they look incredible. I think okay. definitely the best sun has looked since probably Iceland days, right? Like, yeah, I don't probably. think they've ever looked this yeah. Cohesive as a team. There's never been really a streamer chat. Uh, it's, it's always just been you guys job, like, in a the room, team. Yeah, yeah. talking with each other. Everything, so. But what about and the nothing more. <laughs> How do they stack up against <laughs> that? <laughs> 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 that? <laughs> oh, man. Well, listen, there's a lot to break down here, but let's for now take a look at our playoff bracket. Where are we currently? Because we already have a few of the teams across the different regions. All right, what's up? What's up? Now it's our turn. Happy watch party day. Versus loud, and then. NRG versus Sentinels. I mean, Dragon yeah, Rage 1002, we they were through the prime. You know, what Sentinels and what we could be seeing with them, but we got two spicy pick, ones today, dude. These games are incredible. I mean, what's exciting is we already got all the upsets out of the way with the MEA. So, so no that means that now we got all the upsets out of the way for these final spots in Madrid. Yeah, and of course, folks, we want you guys to join us there in Madrid. Eight teams, four leagues. I lost four comp two. games yesterday. Welcome to the club, dude. So grab out your phone right now, scan the darn thing. Get yourself a ticket if you're out in Europe. Or Who do you wear compression in sleeve? States, uh, generally, yeah. There in Madrid, cheering on your it reduces teams, the friction EMEA, of my Pacific, arm on the table, China, which I like. Matter. We want you to join us. Make sure you get out there and do that. We'll have that pop up throughout the show as well so that you can join us in Madrid. But for now, we're going to take a quick Who's I won a comp game today? Back. Holy Media shit. Good, good job, Pen Flash. Synthor is with five gifted. That's right. It's back, baby. And we'll see you on the other side. Two of them were organ servers, so we got weirdos play there. Is that gonna be enough? Hey, those are my people, dude. Don't you dare call the organ players weird. Those are my people. That's where I met JG. JG and I met on the organ servers. You calling JG weird? We're gonna have a problem here? All right, he's a little weird. We're queuing California Swift plays last night, not Oregon. Curious. Oh, because uh, Zendikar's from California. Dude, we were cooking in Swift plays last night. That was the shortest break. It's Frozen Warrior thing with a six months. 
Let me see. Let me see. We, we were cooking in Swift play last night, dude. Oh my God, we played so many. Welcome back to VCT America's. Okay, well, I was cooking in Swift play. Global head of Valorant Esports. Where is Ten Flashes pop off game? Is it Ice Pop? Dude, look at him go! Look at him go! Season and also we had some big news. Capsules that Lotus game was crazy. Oh yeah, yeah. Been like, and also for you guys behind the scenes, it's been the best. Look, we been, also uh, played to do this, this Breeze game. Yeah. It's finally live. I literally we're dropped 18 in a swift play. <laughs> and the reception has been amazing. You ever see somebody get 18 kills in it? Like you could see this KD in a full ranked really? game. In two weeks, so wow. uh, very excited. Okay, I mean that's definitely new info. Lotus Zendikar and I. Wait, we just carried this whole lobby Zendikar. At least make an attempt, a try. Who's number one? What's the best? I didn't realize you were you know, fifteen and one. Favorites. Oh come on, man! You know but guy. I will tell you, I'll tell you this: uh, we are going to release uh, <laughs> rankings for all of the leagues very soon. So uh, okay, it should spark some fun competition. Oh yeah, and if there's one thing we know that the internet will do is. Did totally Fnatic make it to Madrid? Did hey, hey, Fnatic be awesome. make, make it to so Madrid? I'm going to Google gonna get, it uh, exactly. Maybe some rankings down the line, so you can see like where your favorite teams First Google results. Leo, First so Google results. Because, you know, me and Ender, they've been cooking. I don't make the rules together. around this. I'll be honest with you. Actually, I do make the rules around these parts. Really fair that well. So, uh, why don't you go ahead and join me? We're going to need some more sparks. Let's go in for some, some spark tanks, shall we? Well, I made that rule, and that's why I made it. Wait, what is this? Uh, that is <laughs> a turtle. Now look at Ned. Yeah, that look is a Ned. turtle. Lisa painted me a little porcelain turtle. It kind of looks like that turtle. That's such a good edit. Sideshow, my king! It's just a cup! <laughs> <laughs> you guys stop chanting. This is your fault. You need to have somebody play the bad guy, or it's not funny. I think I think Mimi playing the the bad guy makes that content so much funnier. Salutations, Sparks. Salutations. Salutations. You love games and you love team capsules. Am I right? Yeah. You just yeah. witnessed the greatest match of all time. Get ready for the greatest capsule of I, all time. I'm so sorry to show this to you, chat. But the audio is slightly desynced from the video. Look at their lips. What does this have to do with the capsule? Little bear. We'll get there. Okay. We love animals, GB. It's okay. very slightly desynced. Okay. And um, well, I, I want to open up some ideas for our very own team capsule here, right? But this is a live broadcast. That's desynced, not, not me. It's not me. Now let's see it. And if you like animals in real life, let's check them out in game. That's Can you refresh right. or something? No, but it's show, it's their team broadcast. Team. Uh, no, because it's like, because yeah. it's from the cup thing. No, but that it's their like broadcast. It's a man. It's a uh, question. Don't get me wrong. I am all about this uh, because it's I the mean, same. Yeah. There's much looks. better parts. Is this but a cup or a man? Please settle the debate for us. It, uh, I mean, I, that cup this, or man. It's it's a cup. Well, that's well, the ironic just, anime girl yeah. thing with the see, gifted tier that. three oh, to yeah. Wimmy uh, the well, whimsical. This is an egg. Uh, so no, that's that that's a food well, object. Come on it. Comes from the egg, a chicken. That's fair. There you go. Wimmy it's an animal. And when it hatches into Whimsical. a man, it becomes your little buddy. We've seen increases in joy on players who they have a friend by their side by up to fifty percent. It's a beautiful thing. But trust me, there's more than just a buddy. We have a lot left to show you. We absolutely do. You want more? Is that right? And you know what? The like crowd kind of wanted more too. last week <laughs> as well. And that's where we're bringing the OT chant. The fans couldn't get enough, and you're not going to get enough of this sick new spray we've got to reveal here today i gotta say that actually is kind of I, I, i'm on board with this one it gets you in the right head space, the right energy when you have time what do you want more a than doctor time? told me to stop intensive uh, wrist movements for a few weeks money? overtime okay rip overtime's money for that reason rip Sure. Nah, this dude. Spread, you Your doctor your doesn't know anything. They don't Everyone know the importance of pure mechanical the skill. Energy. Can we get a chant from the three of you? Uh, well, like, Ready. You ask your doctor what rank they are in Valorant. Oh, I want to hear you, Vanity. Vanity. Oh, 
<laughs> Sounds like your doctor's not a grinder. Or if maybe your doctor's just jealous of your ELO and they're trying to surpass you. There's even more than that. There's more. Zoom and Val, thank you for the prime. One Mr. Not Funny, thank you for the two months. Is this a frog? You guys like frogs? Is that a train? What is it? It's, it's a frog, frog, but wait, with a little hat on top. On his head. He's a little cipher hat. Did you just take the frog from and the, and then just it's, copy and paste so it. It's, it's amazing yes. because we already know that people like frogs and they love the frog. From that is sport, true. People do like frogs. Head that is small and how much smaller, Mimi? Are, I mean, it's it's already 39% smaller than previous hats on his head. And market research That's has 39? shown that the younger demographic, which are average viewer age 14 to 72, I think I would cop. I think I would cop. I'm kind of sold. Type of hat on its head yeah. and therefore wants to represent it in game. That's quite the range. 17, wait, 18 to 17. Infinite Tom Kench. What do you mean just infinite Tom Kench? Is, is infinite Tom Kench a thing already? Uh, okay, I mean, wow. Okay, sure, but. Is this something you would, you would love? That's everything you need, right? No, I, mm, no, where, what? Surely it's not a thing. The turtle? The, the turtle? Where is the turtle? Come on, man. Where's the turtle? Uh, the, 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 the turtle? The turtle, where's the turtle? Okay, we can give him the turtle. Yeah, God, the up. fans were yelling. Oh, oh, the classic is pistol is the <laughs> but that's that a is turtle. Nice. Classic. It's, it's a beautiful. turtle. That Green. needs to be in the game. Turtle. You know what's crazy? Is that it's that's gas. To be a joke, but I want it in the Wait, game oh, now. Oh, yeah. oh shit, they were the two months prime. I mean, look, Do you know how much work? You know Riot's gonna drop this. You know Riot's gonna drop this. It has nothing to do with security. Mimi, you're making a fool of yourself. Well, please bring us back to business. Sparks, we would like you to invest one million dollars. I've acquired a new Buddha. Oh, you guys are at the games today, aren't you? Capsule. We're calling it the little guy capsule. No, we're not. <laughs> we, we, we decided to call it the greatest match of all time. The greatest match of all time capsule. There's not even a line on the name of the capsule. It's, uh, okay. It can be whatever you want it to be. Sparks. <sighs> Are you in? Do it for the turtle. Yeah, true. The like turtle the troop players are. I'll tell you this. I think this would they be happy fantastic. about it or mad? <laughs> I think players are gonna love it. <laughs> Go on, Mark Cuban. <laughs> I think because it's not. I think you. A classic for their together. team. I, I think this team is amazing. I think this has the chance and the potential. I'd probably be happy. I'm a tier two be org. Who cares? Bundle of all time in Valorant. I do. You'd probably just be happy. Valuation's a little bit high. Mm. Mm. I'm I'm willing to take one dollar for one hundred percent of the stake in this bundle. That mathematically unless know, you, know, you have a better have. offer, Sharks. <laughs> but I, I you have to keep it. One dollar has the ability to I'll actually tell you what. produce. I hear, How about do you have a better offer? I'll double it. Two dollars for hundred percent. How about this? Counter proposal. Guys, guys, come here. How about we just all go in? All right. I will. Just, I have. I have. I have a way to sweeten the deal. Sweeten the deal. Be, sweeten the deal. Sweeten I will do this. We're gonna do two dollars for 100 percent of the idea plus to compensate you for all the work. Yeah. I'll give you access to the writers' room where we write the script for the season, and you get to choose who goes to Madrid today. <laughs> I think that would be very great. Okay, that's a gas that joke. Cool. That is gas. Let's go. Give you uh, access to the writer's room and you get to choose who goes to Madrid. Well, there you have it, folks. We got ourselves a deal. We're going to go to a quick break. And when we come back, we got EG and Loud. We're going to talk about that in a minute. But first, let's go ahead and listen to the comms of our defending champs in this open mic. Thanks for joining us, buddy. <laughs> Will not be found. We're tied at 10. I'll see. Careful. I'll pitch up, y'all. I'm sticking in, guys. I'm sticking in. Who oh, comes? I'm holding this. Two here, two here. Heard. Bandle in. Yeah. Holding this jack. Hand up. Hand up. Two here. Yeah. Do the molly. Anything out there or not? What's the molly? He's joining no, no, mid right now. I'm breaking it's up. It's different, chat. They do all know oh, each other's down, voices. Down, guys, sorry. Safe talking, safe talking. We're going to all. He just fucking dashed he away. He dashed. Hey. Yeah. Wait, no. He's top side. Top side. Top side? Okay. Oh, he got hit. What was that? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> just wait. Can this is not looking. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, their comms look kind of empty. Yeah, yeah, or okay, do you want to go back yes, 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 yes. It's a probably. Okay, it's yeah. a retake K, then okay, then we won't do it. I'm gonna flash for orange and then we're gonna leave, okay, Derek? Roger, Roger, Derek. All tight, do it now. Leave, leave, jump. Get bomb, get bomb. 1B, 2B. Go for the Molly. Hey, careful, 1B. Guys, I'm, give, I'm giving the right side. Or I'm giving. Walked up at a. Walker B. Yeah. You can rotate, Jonah. Shooting my Molly. Clear tight. Alt, alt. 
Backside ult. I have dart to confirm, Jake. If I'm you want to win. Oh, now, oh, now. Bottom site. He has to swing forward. Fight orange, Jake. Fight orange. I think there's one looking mid. I think the Viper's mid. Viper, Viper mid, yep. Someone was there, fought. So, oh. Oh, Paul, you're out. dead. He's sticking, he's sticking. Viper mid, Viper yeah. Mid, Viper mid. Viper mid, dead. Don't let him come up yet. You have four more seconds. They're far. They're far from neck. He's gonna. He's gonna. One let more mid. Three, three guys. Default. default. Stop default. 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 Under tube. Under tube. Viper. I can jump on default. Fighting nah. Default. Right now. Under maybe. Nah. It's not, it's not planned for him. I'll drop. It's planned for him. Under. under. Go, go top side, Jonah. Go top side. Wait, wait, wait. wait. No! no! Yo, off down mid. Off down mid. They need okay, to stop go. hopping between the teams like that. Because of how they've managed their finances, Leaf is able to carry an op and blades into the last. Three, touch again. Two, one, go wide, Nick. Like, why are we in EG comps right now, but in G2 POV? Like, that's very confusing. He's gonna refight, maybe. Get ready. I'm sticking in, guys. This broadcast POV. Yeah, but they switched between G2 comms and EG comms, which is very confusing. The comms are good, but I don't think they're impressive. They have hot dogs? Oh, bad. Someone jump up there. I'm entering with you guys. I will join. I have no use right. anymore. All right, all right. Go, someone go top tight. I'm not playing for top tight. Go, go. I'm flashing. Get in there. Get in there. Vets. Right go, go, go. I'm entering. Bop. All right, they're in. Can we yeah. flood? Ready? He's back tight. Oh, Maybe Rafter. Maybe Three, Rafter. Three, four. Wall up. He's 1 HP. They have I can't wall. I can't wall. Dead lock all. Chill, chill. Okay, we're in G2 comms now. We're in G2 comms. Come screen. Come screen. I have full gas. I have full gas. I've got gas. Hold my Raptors, guys. Hold my Raptors. We're back to EG. John has it. John has it. Set up for one kill. Yeah, John has it. Is really. At the fall, they hit me. Dead, dead. Your vote. One more backside. Like two proper nouns were just listed, and then a player used it in their comm. Come to me, Mike. Oh, we're back to G2 again. Three, two, one. Yeah, bounce it up for ten. Now we're back to EG. Dude, the. Cap throwing at you. Nice spot. One bullet. Welcome back, everyone, and uh, we just got sold some. Oh, Nuda Buddha has the decent skin bubble, her art. I would say so. That's just me thing. But, Please, yes, hot dog. That's, that's, true. <laughs> that's true. That's true. That's true. But guys, time for serious analysis. Okay, let's get serious. Talk about this game. But to be fair, though, this game's hype as hell, and I think look, if her sign is the so first one shown on the stream, the then she gets her hot team. dog. Uh, well, Sir Arlen, thank you for the tier three. I appreciate you. Versus evil geniuses squaring off against one another, and I'll grant it. Exclamation mark VCT Glizzy if you're confused on how to qualify for a free hot dog at any VCT event that I'm watch partying I have to be watch partying it It's very simple if you have the first Wuhujin related sign shown on broadcast that day and I'm watch partying it Then I will PayPal you up to $20 to reimburse you for a meal that includes a hot dog Although oh we removed the hot dog bit because some Sometimes I don't have one. But like get a hot dog if you can. Both these teams are really we should make this an emote. Please hot dog. Dude. We can just bring back. We can just bring back 2007. Can I has cheeseburger? <laughs> how, how old are you guys? Who gets it? <laughs> this meme is so old. <laughs> We bring it back. We bring it back, but can I has hot dog? My identity is still there. Yeah, except Osboss, to be fair, is worth like four and a half players. So, you know, it, it does even out yeah. in that regard. But, but they're, they're changed to, and we'll talk more about them later. That's but like OG, man. That's like really fire in my laser. You guys know that one, right? Yeah, I mean, for sure. But I, like, it's also just changed their entire style dynamic yeah. as well as a team because you lose a guy like Ospos and all of a sudden now you're playing these ballistic comps. We're talking double smokes and triple flashes on every map. Sadok's come on our show as well and talked about how he just yeah, you guys want give me all the flashes. You guys think your generation is cringe. Oh, I have to, I've got to mute this. 
I'm a fire in my laser. I'm a fire in my laser. Do not download this, key it, and use it in your projects. Do not do that. Man, this one's only six years old. The OG was way older. Now I'm getting recommended the duck song. That's an OG. Yeah, they just got someone else and they let QCK be good at what QCK is yeah. good at, right? And yeah. it looks like he's very comfortable on the Phoenix, the race so far. I haven't seen him on Jet, I don't believe, but he looks very comfortable. Waddle the away, dude. Yeah, yeah. Has a flash, Waddle away, my, my king. They're doing a great job at setting him up, and then Les kills 35 people a map, so what else can you ask for? <laughs> yeah, it sounds like a winning combo. Yeah, I think what makes the it RuneScape so random they, they epic moments was my shit. Spots, so Bro, what was that RuneScape no series really where they followed the, the gods of RuneScape in like a reality show-esque meme style? Like you had Zamorak, Guthix, and Guthix was always like doing head bumps and shit. You guys know what I'm talking about? What was that RuneScape series? I'm surely hitting with at least one viewer right now. <laughs> Yeah, vision strikers, like all the way back then. But they play without that. And the way it changes is it's a much I don't want to see a slower style of game, but in a way it is because they're fighting for smaller pieces of space, I feel like, with those flashes and oftentimes supporting themselves. Wolfie I fights, right? With Wolfie the, the more Save the five month prime. Right? Click KO or a or a Phoenix going around a wall. They're much more self centered in those ideas. Yeah, ASDF movies were our equivalent of shorts. Honestly, ASDF movies did shorts so before shorts were like were a thing now that you think about it right because i think we're, we're just going to continue to learn more about this team right they haven't really this was literally just youtube shorts very compelling uh, and on the no wonder this shit got you know, 70 million views this guy, been the, the, the holding the shield for eg now is yet to be released this guy Christy invented Jordan, youtube uh, shorts who has genuinely i think dude voice in, in in this team that wasn't there previously yeah. under. i've they been seeing this on tiktok oh bullshit Again, not the team. bullshit not the team. somebody <laughs> took these and they <laughs> they repost them on tiktok experiment with deadlock during the off season these guys come on on Icebox, and I was pretty impressed at least. I think Icebox is definitely Deadlock's strongest map, at least from the current rotation. You I guys got to get off that platform. Into the, I think you don't really Uninstall really TikTok. And even if you have it, the Deadlock punishes it really hard because it's really hard to break the trips, yeah. especially if you've never played against it. I think they had a lot of interesting combos with the Deadlock. They uh, put them next to the another launch. video, so it's two were playing at one. <laughs> and I think they did a really good job with it. Yeah, one thing I also really liked is how mobile George Mo is on defense. He's picking yeah. up those songs. Dude, you're actually like, another piece of the map. you're going to be he's 30 really years old attending a party. And you're gonna be unable to hold a conversation for more than ten seconds. <laughs> because you used TikTok when you were younger. To be fair, the ropes give you some kind of element of dive on its own. Your brain's gonna be like, hey there, human. I need more dopamine now. Like they were showing like belt pushes with the deadlock. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you put on your Apple Vision things glasses because we're at that point, and then you just pull up Subway Surfers and you put it right next to the guy. <laughs> so you can keep talking with them, or you put it right on his eyes so you can maintain eye contact. <laughs> One Subway Surfer per eye. Something completely else cooked up. It makes this map, I think, for both squads a very tough one to prep for, really. Well, I'm so glad you talk about the prep and the work because that obviously goes into the IGL, right? The you know the coaches and these guys needed to make these plans happen. Palito they seven, they have the two months. Yeah. Voltius, they were the three months prime. Uh, let's talk about Sadak, man. Uh, I think a lot of people will rightfully say, and I think it goes without saying best in the world in that role but someone in that role doing it right now how is it uh, how do you uh, find inspiration in the way that a player like sadak would approach a game or use it for what is asked game? per round probably the most inspiring what's the difference between asked and cast results over the entire course of the game yeah. i think maybe boasters Close. Close. like it's yeah. just assist uh, champion swan, that's so it assist per round booster, but yeah. i think 
what he's been able to do with so many different players, so many different teams. He just like they always look really good. Does it play, does like, it factor style. in? Like I, I believe cast doesn't just count assists; it'll also it's count like EG does it, right? like if you tag a guy but don't get an assist in game, it still counts it towards your cast. Like leaning into their player strengths versus the agent strength, which I think is something that's yeah. Like is it assist per round or is it assist survived traded? Like it's so annoying. In an interview, right, because AST could be just assists, because that could be short for assist, right? Exactly or it could be assist, survived, traded. Which is it? You have a lot of coaches that are big voices in the team. And it's a very mature way to approach it, too. I think a lot of people would assist per round, implying it can be... Very it's just a cis. Leave it to Riot to somehow make way. this confusing. What I wonder is like, did he want to play these types of comps in the past? <laughs> it means right? Australia. Like, you're right. You're right. It's Australia really per round. The double smokes on every map, the Harbor Viper, all that stuff. And now they're still playing those double smokes every map, but it is with the three flashes behind it. And that is just a crazy Guessing it's this per round because cast is a percentage. Players, yeah, I think you're right. I think they are saying assist per round, but it's just crazy to me. Normally, you do shorthand like that when it's an acronym on the internet. Otherwise, you just write out the word because you don't have to print anything out. Like, it's you could just write assists and, like, it doesn't cost the computer anything more to render that. The reason why they write CAST is because it's, a, it's an acronym, right? CAST stands for kills, assists, survived, traded. So it's just very confusing when they go asked per round because there's already this existing shorthand. And like, why wouldn't you just write assist? <laughs> hey, the marketing team didn't like the look of it. I'm sure they didn't, but the marketing team needs to understand fucking terminology. Yeah, APR. Thank you, Pen Flash. We'll ban, uh, we'll ban bind, please. EG oh, whatever. Allow your map pick. Ascent. Allow picks ascent. Oh, EG yes. <laughs> yes. EG picks defense. I told you. I EG. told you. Teams are going to have an ego about this. Teams are going to see Loud's ascent comp and they're going to go, that sucks. We can beat that. And then they're all just going to get shit on. They're all just going to get, because I think the comp's actually the sauce. It's the sauce. But teams, they, they, the coaches especially are going to have an ego about this because they're going to think that their approach to game theory is correct, not Louds or whatever. Or who knows? Maybe EG are going to pick Kenyoru. But either way, I'm excited. So the default map is going to be Sunset and Loud, you get to pick side. Defense. Loud picks defense. Okay, awesome. Good luck, fun, guys. Look. But yeah, Loud's the team that's been picking the Phoenix Breach. All right, well, comp. there you see the maps. Uh, we got Ascent, we got Icebox. So, Mimi, what'd you make of this? I'm really excited for these first two maps in the pool because I think. You guys know, I just realized I really want Loud to win this series. And I'm going to explain why. So, if we go back. So, here's Loud's Ascent comp Breach, Phoenix, Viper, KO, Omen. Now I'm going to pull up another match from uh, boom EMEA. Not here. Not here. Here. Look at Carmine Corpse comp. And tell me that you don't want to see this. This would be the fucking best match in the world. Bro, the only agent between them is fucking Viper. <laughs> like, Reina Sky on Carmine Corp. Harbor Viper. Dude. Dude. Pull out Cypher. Maybe EG. But Ooh. it's hard to bet against Loud, you know. Okay. Oh, yeah. Paper Rex has a new Ascent Loud, comp, too. You're right. I have to predict Loud to win this. But if there was a team to have a great anti-strat and pull off an upset, it would be EG and Potter. Yeah, I believe that I think <laughs> need to get active. So I like the Cypher on the weekly side of the map. Solved Loud. map. <laughs> solved map. Whichever <laughs> analyst <laughs> called Ascent the solved map, they, we have to meme on them for this. Like, come on. <laughs> it's... 
It's becoming the map with the highest deviation in strategy. <laughs> This is the most creative map. It was Ender. Oh, okay, okay, okay. We can't meme on a two. When you're wrong about something, it's okay. As long as Ender at some point admits that he was wrong, then he's based. Is that gonna be enough? They know where it's definitely not solved. Comps from China's finals today too. Oh, let me look. I'm interested. <laughs> what? Okay, th this comp is sort of reasonable. Cipher Yoru made is really get weird though. <laughs> Like, that cannot be good. Feels really, really good, but let's just show that like we can qualify. <laughs> hey, where's my stream? There we go. Here's my bonus. They do crazy things. They have a great IGL. I think Sadak is one of the best IGLs in the world. Oh yeah, no, agree, Pen Flash. Lots of analysts were parroting the Ascent is solved thing. It's gonna be a fun match no matter what. Hilariously, all of these comps play similar win conditions on the map. So like the macro of the map sort of is kind of solved. Macro of the map is essentially, and this remains true with the new comps. Did y'all see it? Oh, the sign was there? Nuda Buddha got the hot dog? I didn't see it. Not yet. Clip it. So on Ascent, this middle area generally belongs or is slightly favors the attackers and this remains true with whatever comps we see and then additionally there's this feature of the map where post plants you have to play on site or at the most like very close to the site um like if you're playing off site on a you're pretty much the right here but you're you're gonna have people on site in the post plant like you will not go all a main in the post plant and this is different from like icebox where icebox you will play off site everybody so that's why these like retake comps look pretty reasonable because they're they're really good at just covering the map in utility or covering the site in utility and getting people caught in it you weren't first nuda somebody in front row has a banana holy shit nuda buddha got beat nuda i think yours is second on stream here's the clip Yeah, this is on stream right now. Yeah, Nuda Buddha second. He got second. They were up first. They did not appear at the same time, chat. Look, look. Pause. This one's up. This one's up right now. Keep playing. There's Nuda Buddha. That's not the same time. Nuda Buddha is second place. Assuming this chatter wants their hot dog they get it can we declare it's the same clip no 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 now if the first person doesn't claim a hot dog i will reimburse new to buddha it was me i put the sign up late <laughs> I aren't a hot sog. Buddha, Buddha, I think you're you're broken. After winning that championship, mm -hmm. this is now a chance for two or well, one player and one coach to return to the international stage. So there'll be a chance for a couple of those other players, but for the two that stuck around to be able to Pen Flash win the Glizzy in Madrid would be huge for Potter and John. I love that it's a new team. Um, still has the individual. I mean, I've already given him enough money that he could just buy himself a Glizzy at the venue. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> my friend, what are you seeing here? What, what, what are you feeling right I now? I saw 
an interesting agent. Oh, uh, yeah? Wait to see it, but I think I saw it on Jojimo's screen. Could be wrong. Oh, boy, yeah. Well, I mean, leave it up to the boy to go ahead and bust out some wild stuff. Who do you want to see them play into this, this comp? You are mentioning the Cypher earlier. You're going to be paying attention to the game? <laughs> yeah, Pep Flash is going to get his money's worth. I, like in theory, that should I guess that's really fair because well it's Kong. probably going to be like the first and potentially like last time you get to travel internationally for a, a VCT event. How do you deal with this comp when you're on the attack though? It's hard. I think um, I think you need to fight into them. I think a lot of teams, uh, because of the limited footage, don't have the ability to fight into the comps, and I think are into loud very well, and they let them play the set retakes. Yeah, they also abuse you. I tried to make a sign saying hi, pen flash. <laughs> That'd be gas. Instead of saying hi to the big creator watch parties, you just say hi to your friend. They are running back to comp. Loud sticking to that Phoenix idea. I see Breach. Of course you did. You saw Loud's comp. They play Phoenix Breach on this map. Or I think there is also an option. You say kind of setting them off kilter. If they play something similar into the Loud comp, like some kind of multi-flash variant of their own, I think that could be sick They're dangerous. I think the main idea is because Loud in almost all of their attack setups want to... Are you getting a co-stream for Grand Finals? Um, unlikely. You don't want to be stuck in one singular... If Riot Games gets me a booth, yes, you will. But it's looking like we're just going to be in the crowd watching the games and you're going to have to go somewhere else unfortunately the omen smokes they put in mid you're going to be able to severely limit what eg's comp should in theory be able to do Oof. well we get, did get a few interesting lock-ins though cypher is coming in here so we are getting the cypher for eg yeah, which is what you wanted to see happen uh and that's certain and, and like for those who probably weren't coming in at, into this they're based on the odds from the prediction closes Lale. in relation to this composition just like any uh system cypher does a great job on this map, especially against the winners get all the points of the losers the trips, divided amongst the winners based off of what percentage of the winner's pool is your points yeah, I, I think your only options are KO knife and ult round, although if yeah. KO ever has ult, Cypher will just play off yeah. of the site where his trips are set up. Yeah. One thing you do actually have is the Breach Blast, which can be pretty effective. We've seen that on Sunset especially for denying some of those untouchable, you know, uh, uh, trips right against the wall. So maybe there's some options if they can figure out where those trips are being That's not how sports play. gambling works. On this attacking <laughs> side. It actually is. It's just the odds are set. I think similar to like the, defense, they have the odds will literally dynamically adjust in sports gambling like, as more money comes in. It's just they have such a large pool that they can pit you against essentially right. like an equivalent. Is gonna come down to the prep from EG. And we're down and we are ready to go. This is our first match about to be underway. So let's go ahead and make some big noise for your casters. It's Matt Silly and Riv. A very exciting game is upon us. How says the odds? Really for esports gambling? I'm pretty sure they they're set automatically. But at the desk, Mimi was talking about it. What type of preparation EG is gonna bring to the table right now? Because yeah, you do get paid out the odds you bet at for esports gambling with money. I believe the odds adjust dynamically based off of what people are betting. No. It is how much have they cooked? Again, going back to Ascent, where Loud continues to use this comp that almost seems universal across uh, their maps with one or two changes in it, and still can be used effectively against teams. So EG's had a lot. Only really shift is sharp money comes in on one side. Yeah, and here, huge bucks, even a small bet is essentially sharp money. The wall goes out normal for a mid push to pressure there and eg will actually present themselves in mid to start this off. yeah also the sports betting companies they have stuff to gain like those companies have money to gain i don't gain huge bucks if you are wrong on the prediction nor do i take a percentage of the the pot but now superman has that contact against the much slower first round that we're usually seeing teams have been rushing up cat they've been pressuring towards a main a little bit and superman not knowing there was already a push off oh what how does less kill him how, how does less kill him there setting up a push in mid no idea that was happening loud tries to creep through bro a good read by evil genius let me Bob shoot like, like that the, the game would be so much easier by eg in mid 
and Loud's gonna remember that. This mid wall here will continue to keep that pressure. We'll see if Les tries to tinker with it a little bit and give EG something to think about as we, these rounds go on. I'm surprised they're not showing a replay of that from Les's POV. Flooding a. It'll be interesting to see if EG wants to stay in sight, try to stave off this attack of a Phoenix Molly, an aftershock from, from Collinzine, Sadok's knife. It was very hard for Sentinels to do that. Ooh, Superman starts off though, yeah. takes that Molly out right away. You can even see the outlaw coming out of Jogimo. So you're seeing the positioning is quite different from EG as well. Mm -hmm. Out in the open, forced to open a little bit more forward to avoid the utility being thrown out from Loud. And that's something tells at least from how EG is going to be positioned yeah. here as Loud will continue to lose a couple of players, but build this. Observer for looks their, dizzy. Gun round <laughs> number three. Taking space. First, they can. Yeah, I mean, there's multiple for, observers. One for EG. And look at Apoc was all the way out. I'm not sure you can be a uh, hot dog claimed. Oh, so the guy was the first sign reset. wanted it. EG That's tough luck for Nita Buddha. Numbers, they know I have to pay them for their hot dog. Do some damage here. So just wait in this last All right, one sec. Out. Let me reimburse EG them right now. The first few rounds is going to feel Nudabu No, Nudabu is the second the sign. Second it's sign. Really what we're going to have to watch. Somebody beat her. I think Collinzine and the, or rather Sadak and the rest of the team are going to put a lot into this first buy round. You're looking for she tried to she sent in a ticket anyways nuda buddha well you do have two e's lurked up all in the middle you did not Derek was waiting very win the race spawn and it's still watching it so eg's making sure they're not getting backstabbed for now we finally squeak through Derek finally senses it turns around still loses that fight remaining. against the ghost Spike but down, B. is gonna slow things down there's left. only 10 seconds left two e's with no hp drop down and eg it's Lily is buying Nuda a hot dog right now. To see it, it, getting God, Lily's a beast. Everybody from the plant was so important there. If they could just get into sight and get the plant down, they would have been pretty much fine with that. The win obviously would have been a huge boon, but a good hold by EG, not letting any of that happen. Staying very far left. back on defense, giving that respect required. Two is crazy. So I think Tui's is pretty average in the league in terms of like max. I think as a smokes player, he's incredible. Maybe he's about to have a game of his life though. Especially with the low by EG may have. They stay in the same defensive spots though here to anchor A with three players. So I'm down to buy Nuda a pity cuz. So we're going to try to meet it head on right off the bat here on this bonus round. Tight angle being held on the A site. The pivot from loud towards B. Recon dart avoided by less. Allowing for EG to even bring a camera forward above the B door. As we're trying to find it for Liz, this will be a great <laughs> opportunity here to just waste that clock down because if Loud does not want to make a move here. <laughs> he got it! <laughs> but Derek still has his drone. So you might start getting the position to use it here. But as the aftershock comes out, looks like Lao wants to execute in the B site right away. Whoa, this play from Apoth is sick. Looking back and as it comes down, he's no! You had the world! The world! Three on three as Loud is still stuck on the lane, trying to move it. Derek in the back, just trying to waste the clock down, waiting for his teammates to come in. A double jump down. The world! A jungle comes in from behind, though. Two executions okay. Good shots, Jogamo. Smoke is out. One v one towards the spawn. Okay, they should have him. Paranoia. Superman repositions again, and Tui's. He's gonna have to come up big here. Spike is down out in the open in the back of the B site. The other smoke disappears. The gun sticks out. Oh should fuck! Be an easy kill. Oh, he big. knows. No. You had the world. He popped the, the world. The world. It has been him in these situations. He had the whole world. It comes up huge. It was such a good anti-strat too. I don't think they can do this twice. This is a strategy to counter Loud's comp and potentially snowball their defense because Loud's comp can't collect info. They've got no recon. And so he's doing this cheese corner. They're not going to fall for that trick twice. He did like this goofy fucking acre the dog type cage almost. Play with the mind Dude, he, that was so well stratted. That's all you want. You want it to As a coach, pressure. that is the most the frustrating thing to watch. I love this play. Going, the ping's coming through, but that one too far away. Another guy <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Double from the crossfire. All of them. Three of them died to Odin. Odin. 
on different extremities, even getting a ping out on Kalzin, falling back, Apoth. No, this is how you play against Loud's comp. And now it seems as I, I love this. Have been answered here, Ender. EG coaching staff? Here it's Potter, isn't it? Of course it's fucking Potter. Hit by the, paranoid, falling back towards the, uh, the, the way they're playing is perfect. Covering his teammate as EG scores a flawless round. Two Odins and an operator? Imagine losing this round. You would be asking for a loan at that Anybody who doesn't give Potter so at least like half the round. credit for EG's win last year is huffing insane insane copium and the you need to do is you need to be able to catch loud off guard because loud come at you fearless they say that they do everything to play styles to meta <laughs> they got three Odin spam kills down the defensive side there on that buy round JG has mentioned a strat like that tiles one. Yeah, because because <laughs> Catherine the showed it to me and then I showed it to JG. As falls and that's up also it's a very EG. known default strat on this map. Yeah. They slow this one right down. You KO flash, you silver recon behind them, and you spam Odin from uh, Catwalk. See, they've lost Jogamo now, but they continue to run this strategy. Happy with the retake it it, it provides and how they might be able to stop loud if you want to call strats like that exclamation mark under peel where you can play in a 5v5 coordinated group, league with like-minded individuals who are down to so practice and run strats on a set with you this. it's going to be a long flank check here by apot so they have a little bit of time before they're diving into the side you like that pen flash you like that ad placement or what retake look like when you're playing such a default comp on ascent the aldron getting nullified by the null command set by sadak down towards the generator as Derek is trying to see if there's going to be a pinch around from the back. The late lurks were actually very prominent for a Your solo queue teammates might not follow that call. Gelato, but your underpeel but team will. The chairs, wins that fight. We have individual signups if you don't have any friends. And then you'll make friends. Not VCT approved sponsor. Actually, it is because it's just my in house league. Like, and I'm a VCT approved watch party. It's fine. <laughs> I have no friends. So that's me. Oh, great. Right Use the individual the sign up form. We will lot. find you Sada friends. Has always been the one that focuses the ultimate orbs when they get a main control, when they go to B. We got you. Focusing up. Being Come play. Sight and deny your opponents any of their abilities. And it took loud this round. Just a quick step, right? One step faster than they have been a few rounds. And they actually catch an operator with QCK's sheriff. So you can see just by the half second by the millisecond what's kind of changing these rounds and that was a great opening kill by loud to bring that conversion in their favor towards top mid still working the same wall here and it looks like eg's back to a bit of a pistol round stratus derek let's loose oh that's tough looking to just sort around here on the side of loud which way they're going see if they can get any tags still have the operator online for jogmo with blade storm right behind that we're actually playing hopscotch there above yeah. the Hunter's Fury beams and they stayed alive. <laughs> so that actually is great for Loud to continue to hold that pressure <laughs> towards the main. How do you so predict for that an attack for operator on a fucking KO? Like, what do you do about that if you're Jojimo? You just go, well, guess attack. I'm dead. Nonetheless, like, that is not something that you PG. account for. It, they're getting a lot for it's free, so unlikely. Loud is figuring this out, so it may actually punish him. Superman. With that six cents after a ping says probably more than one person there to try for the 1v1 and they back up into B. But that's more info. Derek's ready to just lace anybody that comes through B main now. And that sonar bolt is up. Meanwhile, there was a knife being thrown by Sadat. There you guys go. Pen flash promising that if the underpeel makes enough money that he can do it full time, he will host every region. But Superman could not even catch one. Less was solo on HP here, as nature is going to look for the hero play. The underhand flash runs out, hit by the paranoia. Beautiful read by Tui's and the rest allowed. They'll get a plant here. As Apoth can't <laughs> score. So far, you're looking at this. EG's been so good on the timing. Who do you expect an op on this comp? On Nobody. Draw. You don't expect them to have an attack op with that comp. Now, to be clear, I personally think it's correct to have one. I've already talked about this, where I don't think the agent wielding one matters that much. But in terms of the current standard meta and how you, like, predict the enemy, you don't expect the KO attack op stuck in the pace that loud wants to play it <laughs>
You have to be quick on the reaction for yeah. both of those offers. And That's again, wild. It's really loud winning these Sada duels. Hopping. The fast flicks for the kills, tying the game three to three, putting EG in a difficult position in terms of economy. Only a Bucky and Hannah Vapos solo anchoring the B side. While you have this slack from EG, Blade Storm looking for aggression, potential trap play, the paranoia, the pinch from both ends. Juicy came to his fall. Jogging will continue in the backstab here, but stopped. What? I on both extremities. The shot's missing a bit. A How did this round blow up like that? Oh, Grace Smoke. He's alone, isolating one. Turns around yeah. with a kill onto Les. And it's Kawazin alone at 3 HP. The TP away so he could meet up with Apoc. That's an omen diff Each right there. Great spot for Superman played that they really know. well. They've had to deliver the damage that's been done right now to Kawazin. Pressure on his shoulders. You have to imagine there's no Zami's going to clip right. this one round gonna if they walk in front. Him. Okay, they ulted. Well, if, if they walk there. past and he killed him, Zami would oh clip gosh. that shit and be like, see, you should clear that corner. The fight one after the other, but EG's able to come up with it. A lot of damage being done here and EG's still dipping into the bank account to go for two Odins and the operator incredibly suppressive across the map you almost can't peek once you hear those odins ringing out and then when you do want to peek an angle that's got the operator on it so loud wow that spray transfer was gross right now in spots they don't want to be using utility we saw that happen towards mid sadak was able to get the off peak and that's what it's coming down to just i was telling pen flash about that last night between these two a higher rated players the won't reset one, their the spray odins after a kill out. Because they're so and used they to the trade coming at a high the speed. Is, as they There's no time. This main control, though. Talking about with the contact and the kill. Apoc going backwards. Wow. Fade away. And E Lau cannot even move forward around the bend of garage of the b main the underhand flag for a double being too easy for jogimo he's got that well, dog well, in him well, dude he just peeked out by eg the way they trade these rounds you're like oh man now oh now this bro being they right have now, two EG odin's have it and eg comes back with two rounds and and up. That, it doesn't even look like dude it's actually this is the right way to play because um loud have no recon loud cannot counter this Frowned upon with their call is absolutely feeling himself right now. An incredible 4K. On the I'm worried though. Loud already have three, and so Loud's comp right is disgusting on defense. We are going to get a loud time out to sort out how they can start to organize around two Odins and an operator, right? Well, I'm countered already, but it's four to three. I'm explaining the thought process behind a weakness in loud's comp it has strengths let's avoid the journalism here loud. chat let's avoid the journalism so not giving loud an five three oh you're right you're right full countered five three changes no everything for, for this composition right. and it's also time, one map and aftershocks and whatnot, one data point on is full countered a team like sentinels we're like oh my god there's so much util i don't know what to do uh, you want pistol eg well they don't even have a time to set up imagine they still since by rounds is three three that on the table is that they go a and one of these odins is tree and you just shoot through the smoke and tree right and you still have the sova if derek is there when once you need to get that retake going it, they have a lot of solutions here just by putting the odins in to what loud wants to put on the table all right that three two split loud's going to be over right, even right if it was side. eight to zero okay. right now you can't call Maybe it countered people getting caught in the in the knife and then faking it out loud has you would need the comps to lose multiple times hitting a here on this ascent match Trying to double initiate a pressure towards the A main. You saw the setup from Kawad Zin yeah. here and Sadak trying to push down to see if the opera's gonna be close. Yeah. And while you're working the extremity, something that loud also likes Like this is absolutely now. one of the main weaknesses of this loud comp. This is a lack of recon. So EG when will of course be playing wall, around it. Already drops less. But this That's loud comp has an absurd strength right in the retakes. The, yeah. this, this the retakes are so grossly all the time. If it's up, you have to like they seem unstoppable. No it seems like you can't win any rounds so, on attack against so loud's comp. You see loud having to put different so I'm very interested there. to see EG's attack. Keep that pressure up. Keep EG thinking and hopefully get the numbers it's correct tough. on the A hit here. They hit the leg shot there. Nature is spraying towards that tree, as you mentioned, Eriv, and Tui's already falls. Not really giving a chance once again for Loud to cross in the cycle. <laughs> what are you going to do? 
<laughs> you just peek and there's an op. Or you peek and there's an Odin. Economy expensive against EG, but EG continuing to be one step ahead. This shot missing, but the previous one was quite clean. You can see though, Jog's feeling it. Like to go for quick peeks like that, trying to slide in and out. You know the player is feeling the groove right there. Backs up though, still plays it smart. <laughs> one Odin down, one to go. <laughs> Little guardian work, and Apoth always on the lurk. Exactly. Ooh. Give me a chance here for Apoth to come behind, but he gets and gives all that information, the paranoia even, okay. Time for just the to secure the kill. Yeah. EG trying to slowly, uh, slowly actually trying to find their groove, and we're actually getting it here. And it is the question of what can Loud do. All right, here comes the side hit from Loud. Dealing with so much chip damage if it's not a full member down you are chipped down somehow by this eg composition and these odins or however they're firing through smokes before you start let's see it let's see it there's such an advantage here that they have against loud in these situations again stacking three straight up in the front of a like you said man they're gonna get a guy wine all this time to set up what they need for the straps no they can't just source the alt orbs that they need they're gonna threaten they have a guy wine who lakin thank you for the tier three i guess the threat can be even better because loud doesn't have recon well unless loud doesn't fall for it Jogging mode trying to move in, a one and done pretty much. Manages to escape on time after shock, avoids it. Superman TP on the top. No command comes out. He got really good damage. Now on the top of the brick, Superman is trying to close it down, waiting for a Siemens to come back. The fadeaway kill as he drops and finally gets traded off. A res comes up from Les. TP in the generator for loud as they have the player advantage in the site. Also, oh, they're nice for his one. Good constant flash. Towards the spawn, or should I say the heaven side? As you see it right now being depleted. Spike planted. Deployed as the Owl Drone also deployed from Derek. Looking for that Odin spray. The less stays alive, full health and healthy. As the pit, it will also stay up. Stay pop. Beautiful clutch kill right there. There is that ping, even a recon dart available for Derek. There's that second ping. Recon goes towards the back. A spray towards Dice as Apoc wins that fight. Pit is still up as Les is trying to hold his ground between oh behind his own pit. Oh my god. Running through. Damn. He held down W. Yeah, they're, they're really, really, really playing against um the lack of recon. They play this close crossfire angle. And if you recall from the Fang VOD review on this map recently, I was like, Fang, this is a bad way to play. What if their Sova just recons here or drones you? But guess what uh, Loud can't do? They can't do these things. So the play actually makes a lot of sense. Say they just denied a complete rolling thunder with a paranoia. They rolling thundered to get into the site and Loud stood at a main entrance. They were stopped. That's crazy. EG is reading them like a book right now. Seven to three here from the defensive side. Double load and off back online. Careful. And it's a great call with that paranoia because that paranoia here. also allowed Superman to TP on the top of bricks. And that was right. Check, allowing EG to really hold their ground. Not allowing Loud to cross over. Bob continues to be equipped this time for Dogmo on the first layer of the break. Look, dude, it's the Fang. It's the Zami angle. The Zami angle's good. When you have an op. Loud is and your jet. Those orbs now. They'll take a fight if it comes to them, but EG's gonna just be kind of baiting that out. They've been and the enemy team has no recon. The base allowed now, and now it's all quiet. Forcing Loud to make the move. And you have Jojima's reaction time? <laughs> no. <laughs> Timed out. There are, are most pros have a reaction speed around 180 to 200. Like, no. <laughs> Do not reaction speed cope in my chat. Because you're just, you're wrong. Nature, meanwhile, pulled up his null command, not allowing Loud to add more utility. For their They're not different because of how fast they react. Yeah, <laughs> Looking difficult here for Loud here. to regain the space back in the A site. Tension comes down to this play on tree. Tui's walking forward as the wall comes down on the attack. Catching Nature off guard, but Nature able to survive. Allowing Jogimo to push Ooh. forward. Finally gets traded out. There's Ten no time, dude. Hit by Les. Superman with the third in the round. Wow. 
And EG is definitely looking clean now. He took a couple of rounds to warm up. You're definitely seeing a lot of clean now, shots. Pros will react to things faster than you in Valorant, Incredible. but it's not because of the reaction speed. It's because of anticipation. Is putting on the like, I will react week, to a Sova recon that lands on this cannon and break it protocols. much faster than you will because I'm ready for it, because I'm used to seeing it. And the aggression from Jogamo, again, we said Jogamo switches to Shorty and reacts to the Phoenix ult so quickly because he expects it. Not because he's genetically superior to you in terms of reaction speed. He's not. You can achieve the same speed. Of their spawn to gain position. I mean, what what can Loud do for this last round, right? They they've tried to work mid a few times. They find Superman and Jogamo some. They try to work Cat. They find the Odin always of nature. It seems like mid wants to be a bit of a look this time. But they is they're gonna go back to A. Walk the spike across here. Nature's in a bad spot here. Hit by the flash, but able to throw a molly down. Juicy keys around the corner. Yeah. What's Jogamo holding? They gave timing uh, pizza. EG is going to be thrilled with this half, but it should have been even more. You guys remember APOS logs round? EG looked really good on defense. These are quick rounds in for EG, but... At the end of the day, it's always these trades where they come out on top. Absolutely ridiculous play coming out of EG on that first round. Let's see if they can bring the momentum onto the attack side. And that said, we'll have to see. I was told to bet on loud. Who told you to bet on... Zendikar, maybe this is why you're losing points. But so far, again, it's all this position that we've been talking about for EG, the aggression that comes out you, from You're side taking other people's advice Look now. Being able to push out from I miss the old Zendikar. The bets on feels in the car. The always the right well in the car. But at least Loud is still all smiles. Yeah, the, the way that Loud was not able to work the composition is a huge change, which shows you we got what we expected out of EEG and that they came to counter. And now let's toss it to Ender, where he's got some stuff to stay. I never won watch screen. party best, what you mean? Oh, so you're switching it up? Let's preview Loud's next half of defense using a game they've already played versus Central. You just slowly Loud's accrue wealth by voting Dowse on lunch games, so don't you? The attackers can use on Ascent. First of all, you've got the solo <laughs> selfish flashers of Phoenix and Ko. You've got the Omen one ways, that's three. Then this poor little guy right here, Viper, needs some help. So you've got a fault line to be able to put him on the line. And Breach can move around the map, and especially for- all right, we're, Showing us Loud's defensive so default right now. Round, they end up holding that fault line for just a little bit. I like Loud that. Need to step forward for information. There, they use the fault line, peek on with it, and look to break the Killjoy turret. But the entire idea is about putting down this Viper's pit for stall. But what do Loud do when they are faced with some aggression? They fast rotate into the site. Let's zoom in on that one because everyone is flooding out through CT. At the same time, Omen steps up in Tay. Reminder: to get information, they must move forward. That's exactly what they do on A in the majority of their rounds. The other interesting thing about how I would like to play this B site on is that monitor in screen? past iterations of this team, last year... Time for a lesson. There's two types of touch screens, and these big TV ones usually use the worst type to interact with. The ones on your phones have a bunch of, like, capacitive or, like, um... It's, like, these little bits that can route electricity and when you touch the screen they like essentially activate like it closes a circuit the cheaper type to make is there's like three layers and you literally will be bending this top layer to contact the these two layers together those types of screens, you need to use force to press. If you've ever used one of those like food ordering screens at like a Wendy's or something, sorry for the brand name, um, you have to push real hard. And it's because it's using that type of touch screen where you're literally causing a, a small um, bend in the screen to cause a contact. Oh my God. Almost trying to get that. They're a lot 
Um, they're a lot more consistent in terms of like you don't have to repair them as often, and they can survive a lot more touches. But they're way fucking more annoying to use. You have to you have to whack them. The other two has fallen down, leaving out Derek alone on a three versus one. And again, catching players off yeah. guard. But when you miss those shots, it's easy for Loud to punish. Really cool, like you said, going for a quick trap. But the the hard ones you have to push. That's why you can use gloves on those, because it just takes pressure. On your phone, you can't use gloves unless you have special gloves, where the fingertips of your gloves can uh conduct electricity. That's why you can't use your touch screen with like. As normal gloves or whatever on the other extremities so whatever surface is touching the first type like we'll of touch screen has to be able to conduct electricity a little bit of detection common zine playing that tree area so you can get fault lines on towards either side of the map yeah a back and forth zero point there oh my gosh vance yeah, just trying to move forward here to build on some alt points. how does that right click get, get one two smalls Meanwhile, everybody else from allowed closing in when <laughs> Les won his duel against Apoth towards B main. Damn, he juggled the bulldog all the way out. That happened. One on cat spin off, the other one flanking from A main nature. Capitalizing on one kill. But no plan. Lad's happy with that. For their second round. Loud pretty clean there, only losing a few easy weapons to pick back up. So that's going to be really nice for the economy as they start off here. And I think one of the things we see a lot from Loud is that once they get on the defensive side, they just have such incredible decision making in the moment that makes you, you really can't think they can win a situation. They pull around, they back up, wait for a flank. Their patience is incredible. And I think that's what makes them so strong is they know how much time they have to work with. Awesome little one, one way on the light there. All right, this is the round. This is the round to watch. Yeah, loud, loud knows exactly how much time they have to work with. Loud are playing a completely different defensive default. So dangerous. Here we get into round 15. Just the two, three split. Trying to get some pop flashes. Deserve the timeout, who? Apologies for my laziness. Damn, I have. There's a lot of areas. I've Stockholmed you guys. Holy shit. Especially if. When's the rebel you're gonna start? Another wall from Loud. Who's that timeout was uncalled for? A simple too. Google search. Cover a bit of really? Main, also make them weave into that A section of main to make it hard. Um, I copy here, pasted so Monk's question into Google Lail, and it was the, the first result. It's gonna be tougher to get him out. Word for word. Mark, look at the activation of Loud pushing out on the extremities, looking for a potential late flank once again. KJ Man logo. Thank you for the two three. They'd get instantly smited if they did that. True. I do bribe the moderators. And by bribe, I mean pay them. As Apoth push forwards towards B main, giving a chance now for EG to pick up a spike, flood back within B, and go. What rebellion? Spike. Also, what time do you go sleep at night? Really nice oh, gee, that's where you. I have a uh, secret nighttime EG warrior. No His name is Axplay. He did mess with mid a lot of this game and give loud active and Valorant discussion. We'll see the retake. 16 hours a day. One for one. Nice, beautiful double swing that comes out Keeping his eyes peeled Superman for any for possible for retribution. This is a secret Easter egg. Uh, when I hit 2,000 subs, I'm getting Axplay a new PC. A secret Easter egg sub goal reward. And pen flash. Oh! What a spray transfer. Jogamo almost getting another 4K there. Stepping forward. Ready to take the fight too loud as they try to flood in. That was almost three of them towards switch there as they were covering each other. Loud lost a retake. It was EG round three. It's the their bonus and they in, killed in, three, in the back which is loud, a good is bonus. Quite a hard thing to do. They trade hard. They're very good anchoring each other's frags. Still EG hype for EG? No. Loud skin here. You get hype round when four, you win your anti bonus sides, with really less than three deaths. Look at except for nature and Sadak here. When you experience three or more deaths on your anti-bonus, you are sad. It's a bad conversion. And another look from Loud. We've seen this wall before, able to cover cat and lane side of B and stop that mid pressure a little bit that EG was just taking. And they walk out for contact. That's unlucky. Never expected it. Jogamo got denied right away and there was no trade it's actually unlucky. Out, at least from nature. Here's the footsteps of players running away inside market to B. 
But losing Jogimo early is going to hurt EG right now. QCK playing on the other side of Cat. Here's a weapon being dropped and picked up here. Sometimes timing is skill. In fact, most of the time, timing is skill. That time, timing was luck. That's one, a one, in, one in ten. And so many EG's ready to take so many 1v1s. 1v main, 1A main. Two members, however, trading in mid, but... You just see how confident they are to push all extremities right now with this mid crush happening. Nature flashing out I want a hot dog now, chat. It's dark. not fair. I give away hot dogs spawn. and it makes me That's crave hot really dogs. Well, there you go. It finally comes left. out from M2. Out from Superman. And now we'll pivot EG now to try to work towards this B site. But wow. the runways this time is on the staircase of the B site. Works out quite well. Apoth couldn't get the lurk in. Surely just buy a hot dog, left. huge. It's really not giving any chances for EG to move through yet they're still committing to it you feel bad out. about buying Last a hot dog in the back of the b site and that should be the name of the game save the last two if you can they've already lost nature like if i could walk out and go grab a dog for like three bucks that's one thing but paying a delivery fee for like a hot dog like at that point get something honestly we were saying that eg's confident they're push i was saying they're confident they're pushing the sides they're ready to take 1v1s you feel me like loud recognizes that a bit as well eg's hot right now you don't just peek corners against the team that's flowing like this so loud backs up into the site what if you get two hot dogs well i would get multiple zone and then they start collapsing on eg which is not what EG has been presented with the first few rounds. Loud's been getting up in their face, losing the trades. EG has a better time getting into sight, and they don't have to use it. All right, Robin Wobbin, heads or tails? If you get it right, I'll get a hot EG dog. EG could not find the answer. I'm putting it in like your the, hands. The script kind of flipped a bit here yeah. because it's now Loud bringing the fight to EG on defense, where EG Heads. was really trying to go for the setup plays. Again, looking for that. <laughs> All, All right, Robin Wobbin. Yeah. Fate slowly after losing John has Mo, decided that I will get a hot ones, dog. Thank but you. Not really trying to do those funnies of sliding out two hot dogs swings, going for the trades after all why not to those EG why shouldn't i get against G2, two potter mentions that through her timeouts towards the end like really try to work together gas each other up be confident play to win don't play to lose get those vibes don't be bums exactly they're bums <laughs> as nature would say the loud fans ready to see a few rounds come back in their favor here they do have sadox null command the beautiful retake for a site there less just one yes off this an is a business meal thank control. you for asking if we remember how much eg used that on defense to control the map and understand where loud was going we'll see if loud i got fries to too some main control to turn the map around all right we're in apoth's gonna be on that side a four one split from eg and yeah they will they start to pressure, even playing anti-flash in there. Kalanzine is ready with less. Oh my word. Usually on these timeouts, they're trying to make plays. So is Where are you getting the hot dogs going, from? The VCT concession BB stand. Site, because Apoth that's the only on, brand drop, safe answer during this watch party. Dino Source, thank you for the tier three. Controlling this just pay for my hot dogs appreciate you and this really allows loud and to then so kind of solidify their members in a site you get the peak mid from Colin Zine so they don't get the lurk that EG has had a few rounds before and they have all pretty much a retake utility way. now so they'll molly paranoia and allow the blade storm to come that's out not the standard nade lineup, lineup but it lands in the standard the place it just takes longer so to land EG i like that right now is to gain the space uh, i like the superman with the hero i like the timing of that lineup for this uh site pop but i don't think i think it's a mistake i'll explain oh well i mean those shots are, are the fucking truth though Derek also gets a trade off on the Superman, but here comes Superman's a beast. The flank from QCK. The 1v1 towards the back, and Jogimo is ready for it. Now we have a three versus one. Two E's alone. Spotting that nature up towards that dice. Only the blade storm left the light dropped. And it's a sheriff from Derek. A 1v1 against Two E's here. Recon dart. Two E's is going to make noise, so Derek's going to re-pivot now towards the back of the generator. Swings out and gets tagged a bit by the Vandal. The drop out Seven from in. Two Dude, what a shot! What a shot! How crispy has this guy been since Show us the replay. We're seeing a replay of that, right? Said, you know, I really didn't think I'd be playing for a team, and then I was playing some games at 6 a.m., and I got a message, so I had a cup of coffee and tried it out. Well, it worked. <laughs> it worked. 
Potter very happy she made that message that DM to Derek to get him on EG right Damn. There. We see one of the results. Feeling. Damn! There's that happiness. Yep, there is that happiness. Eleven to six. To All right, I don't like the there. nave because loud <laughs> with this comp, their A the protocol forward, is the always retake. Right now, they they right always now, play retake. So I think we can greed that, that KO nave a bit is longer. In fact, I use no lineup. Once we start so planting, throw the nade to cancel rounds. the flood. Back in their favor. I think that timing would be more effective. Less ultimate could control B main, but. Don't know if they want to use it just yet because EG has been so confident at just taking another site when they have the chance. Drone but it makes sense because the, the nade hey, G timing this generally is fabulous. I think just a against loud. Now that's Superman moving forward and they're looking for a trap play into tree, but Superman's going to get caught as he swings out. <laughs> Caster bless baby, but gets traded out by two ease. There's that execution back towards the tree. The hunter's fury to try to flush out towards the A-main, but Sadak was waiting towards the back of the spawn. Yeah. Advantage still for loud. What a push here from Tui. Would have been bad this for Tui to really throw a random smoke there since he has gun advantage. Yes, exactly. Protected. Chaos favors the disadvantage, so right, Aperture? Of his push, but still could the the rules should make sense. It's clicking in your head. I see it. Let's see how big a smoke there would be bad be. because yeah. Derek has a sheriff. Now they have to make the move, and as they move slowly here, time is so generally them, you want to try and convert so that with a dry duel, because the dry duel oh, should oh, favor oh, your oh stronger God. weapon. Towards the spawn, a TP out towards B. This fake was sold. Smoking bomb okay. bad? What do you mean? Derek was on the bomb. So that would be giving Derek a smoke. Get away, but that means that's another for site. Apoth is going to be able to get last vans. Wait, but now he's pinned towards the B site while everybody else from Loud has pivoted exactly towards the A side. Beautiful hat here. That's going to help the two players remaining in the A site for EG. Nature and Derek. Have Bro, Potter together. might just be the best coach in the world. Running for support. There's the gas shot coming out, and it's only Nature alone now as Derek is hiding for cover. Under but the EG's entire side. roster but changes, and they look Apoth, this strong. One for one. Derek in another opportunity to clutch this time on a two versus one. The tap on that spike first looks for that spray. Now the smoke dissipates. The Bro, they literally pokeballed. Derek just got caught in the pokeball. Tui's, I love Tui's really utility cool usage. I always give him props. Awesome use of utility by loud to Tui's just can pokeballed and stuck to fuse. Health. They use the fragmentation grenade and a little bit extra damage with He's that such a shock, beast. and they make sure nobody can be hiding underneath. Great use of utility to retake. Yeah, hopefully we're gonna see right I here, always glaze his smokes, Uto. You know why? I've played against two E's. <laughs> he's not that good. Like in the gunfights, <laughs> he's not that good. Yeah. Which means his util is incredible. Like it's incredible. It's for them it was to play it safe for EG and playing it safe this time around as well. Apop trying to walk over through this smoke gets tapped down to I'm not saying HP. he's bad in the gunfights, but he's nothing special. Back, you know, he's playing, not like he's not like last. It's just gonna be one inside dog. Okay. Bucky entry. A lure buy from EG looking to get converted as Apop is pushing forward. That 11 HP works. Oh, he doesn't expect on the right. Rolling thunder out. Derek with the off angle. Double cap push. But Les manages to still get that kill on to Derek. One HP remaining. Is the NA so playoffs finals also bunch, today? With this Bucky. Jack, do He's you have any last words? Because contact. I am so confident well, that that is Googleable that I know Les, I'm going to time you out Jogimo after this round. There is that peak, and Jogimo swings out for the kill. EG are now at map point. Absolutely blistering speed from Nash EG point. on that last round. We'll see you in an hour. Was I was just checking. Up. Wait. Oh, timeout. Perfect. Lots I used the bathroom. Call, time I'll be right back. Again here as backs are I'm sorry, Jack. The, the rules are the rules. Final point. And yeah, just how quick they're behind enemy lines is throwing loud for a loop. And that is not something we're used to seeing. You do not get behind loud enemy lines very easily here. And EG, really, really solid with how they're running strategies. And loud cannot seem to catch up with this point. Five rounds to get themselves to an OT here. Maybe if they uh, invest in the OT spray, possibility becomes greater. 1%, remember, for 100% for a dollar. That's that's a steal. It is. It is. It's 
crazy valuation though they were wrong but this um, is their last time out for sure here for loud <laughs> yeah. on this map five chances for eg to close this off here and you definitely saw off you know these lower buys that eg keep converting this game against loud puts them in a very difficult position once we move back in the game you'll see there's not much money left on the board here yeah. for loud to work with so right, i'm back i'm back i'm back the most crucial timeout for allowed to try to close this because remember this is the last time out so not only you have to fight for ot you're going to have to try to win ot ladder in trouble none of these look at their money chances left maybe work can be don't worry you didn't miss anything here i i figured that i went there in the timeout the defense, maybe that's my strat to play. two aces there to set up on the a side too it looks like we're pivoting differently now. It's Both like I'm working towards a tree. Yeah, it's like Loud hasn't even been able to use lesses. Oh, really? They're just wondering what round it would be good and how would it affect EG? Because it doesn't really seem like it will. Right? EG just goes to the other site again so fast. So, so orchestrated. It would be tough to use it if you're not already making the retake happen. So let's see here. What can nature call for the last round on ascent against this Loud composition? They're still staying with the spike down to just get as much util out, drain this initiator retake. They're realizing that Loud's getting back in by having that freedom of utility that they can dump into the site just as if they were hitting from the attack side. So EG saying, give us all you got, and then we'll re-hit the Wow, they are They're so, so thorough of the fucking shotgun. They're like, I dare you to play shotgun in the smoke. As Derek grabs that orb, Apoc now moving for the outlaw, connecting onto less. The lurk play coming out. He bought attack outlaw. Underhand flashes. <laughs> Apoc is trying to tap on that spike. Sees now that the judge is towards the B site. That might be the opener now for okay. EG to execute an A. Paranoia and a knife. They realize now that the site's open. No lucky shots for QCK. Thirty seconds left. Going for that clean plan now for A main. Yeah fully in sight so still retake here gonna happen from loud zero point gives them an idea but a lot of this lower hell utility is already being used run it back now Derek okay Derek. cancels to run it back even gets a kill on top of that swinging back and forth okay a little bit of our solo queue show in there Derek. The Smoke being thrown, jog him on that easy oh, pay it out EG, pay out eg we're going to icebox from evil geniuses incredible stuff that they're able to bring to the table here and having to, to fix quite a few things in the protocol area they did from last week if we remember uh, during the during the cast what a map versus loud a message came up in that chat like box you can you literally just have to credit potter now it's a counter i would not even counter the comp no i wouldn't say like oh the comp countered loud bro they're countering loud's players like seeing how careful they are with util against sadok's judge they didn't know sadok had a judge like fact they didn't have a hundred percent certainty but for all intents and purposes they knew sadok had a judge because potter told him that he would and they trust potter it's actually coach gap Now nah, you're overthinking it, Panda. Definitely not that complicated. You okay? No. I live with a broken phone. I can't trade in. Okay, and he just bought the outlaw to punish Light Shield by his. What's that? Because Loud Bro on Eco. With AI on them. A new phone. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Wait, I'm on Verizon. Can I still get it? Yeah. I gotta trade this in, right? New and existing customers can trade in any Samsung phone for a new Galaxy S24 Plus. Any Black Samsung phone? And you get a... Wow. Only on Verizon. What a good deal. Thanks, Verizon. Red Bull gives you wings. Watch EG pull out Deadlock on Icebox. I wouldn't call it pulling out when they've already done it. Jojimo plays Deadlock on Icebox. He's done it twice. You say it like it's some crazy read, but they're gonna. They're gonna pick Deadlock on Icebox because that's their comp. Like, Jajima's gonna play Deadlock. It would be surprising if he didn't.
Pooj, we huff and hopium for Sentinels versus NRG. Fuck it. Yeah, Sentinels win. You know what? Bet. That we are. I'm in that mood. I don't know how. I don't think it's possible. But you know what? I'm in. Pooj, I thought you were a Sen hater. I'm a bad Sen hater. And I'm just living up to that title. I'm a bad Sen hater. Here I am being bad at it. Mudded Oak, they have the 11 month prime. Yeah, they deleted the cringe tweet. They also agreed it was bad. What more can I ask for? Sentinel's got no shot against NRG. Oh no, I agree. I agree. I think NRG are going to mop the floor. But like if anybody could do it. <laughs> it, would, it would totally be tens, right? He drops a 40 bomb on Omen. Everybody claps. How loud lose on Ascent? Does EG have the secret sauce? I don't think they had any secret sauce. EG just... They came ready to play against Loud in particular. It was very clear. I don't think anything that EG did was... Secret. I think those were the intuitive counters to the comp. But they pulled it off... Very thoroughly. Like they were just robots executing Potter's master plan. Very clean power from EG. Zelsus is simply too goofy to lose. I believe in them. NRG doesn't have the goofball factor. <laughs> you, you realize... I. I would like to agree with that take, but NRG Valorant have got to put out the stupidest Valorant content of any org. <laughs> They're the goofiest org by like a lot. NRG lets out big secrets while eating spicy wings. Demon One hired a Fiverr coach and pretended to be silver. I don't know, man. Energy's pretty goofy. Did you see Shaq tweeted out their bundle? Wait, Shaq. He did not. <laughs> what universe are we living in? so excited <laughs> this matchup against loud specifically because both of you guys have shown such amazing innovation with your compositions and hit it into this first why is really Shaq tweeting this how satisfied with, were you with how things panned out and are you at all worried that I'm getting off Twitter that's enough of that their sleep or your interesting comp on Icebox you look at Twitter you know, for too for long sure and you'll you'll you'll, you'll you'll open it up again off stream no thanks this week actually um but Vince is such a He's such a stud. He, he, he Loki EML, thank you for the two month prime. Chat has a stake in NRG. That makes sense. So Mr. Goet, thank you for the prime. Things, but, um, but we he invested back so in 2016. Damn. Damn. This is not 1080p. It's blurry. Um, there's a lot of scary things about it for sure. But once we went over exactly um, what our win cons were going to be, it just it, it felt really How much? The first map stake do i need to buy in nrg for shack to tweet announcement tweets for my live vod reviews so shack can tweet like hey guys check out woohoo jenny's doing some more vod reviews yeah his vod reviews are a slam dunk I mean, he's clearly proven he has a price because there's no world that the dude actually cares about the NRG Valorant bundle. So he definitely has a price. 
They played two matches. I don't remember the other one. Yeah, I'm drawing. Memory? A That's a tough one. Leviathan. Leviathan. Yeah, yeah and they, they definitely looked uh, a lot worse. I, I think mean. the Cypher played a factor in it. I don't think it was the yeah. only thing that changed. I think giving footage for this comp to other teams is going to be something that EG did a great job using. They definitely used the resources they had available, and then the Cypher just is like the ice. Hey, guys. Yeah, I mean, this Shaq is here. It has no dive. It has to be Do you wish you could execute it's coordinated it's plays like this? Really important. But you, you can't pull them off in solo queue because you're, you're hard stuck platinum too? Because normally you can put it up put it down whenever you want it. Check out the underpeel! Exclamation mark underpeel. Where you can play real Valorant without all of the grind to getting to Radiant. Besides, most Radiants don't come anyways. Signups are open for the next month. Individual signups available and we will find friends for you. Or bring your own team. You want more info? Exclamation mark underpeel. The players were popping off individually as well. Popping off. A popping off. No. Issue. You know, you're not going to give that popping. to me. I get one uh, a week, no. you know. Who stop attacking me? <laughs> Bro, you can't say plat two, man. I feel targeted. This is the average rank of my audience. You guys are above average. How's that feel? Average rank is like gold. Gold one. We're 400 RR higher. Fuck yeah. Quite a bit. In that whole instance, it was fast. Straight to the point, and we're back. That's what lads gonna do on Icebox. So Ooh. Always keep them guessing. You take five huge viewers, you verse five random Valorant players, and we're winning a majority of the time. It's Ender here to break it all down. What you got, buddy? I've had baby. Oh, let me tell you, I love <laughs> tapping. But my main question is, how do EG play a fluid, aggressive defense with a million Sentinels and no duelist? And they showed it to us versus EG. Now, let's Ooh. start off with Ooh, more analysis. It all comes down to Jogamo on this deadlock. Most rounds, he is dropping very early sensors in B main and then rotating yep. off that space, usually to drop his wall delayed into mid, but sometimes like this round, dropping it over on the A. Site. Yep. This round, those sensors are very far forward, and we're deep in the round. It's 30 yep. seconds. G2 thought they were doing something, rotating back into B off this, because they saw Deadlock over an A. EG mm -hmm. showed them that, and they run True. into these sensors. Now just 20 seconds on the clock. Players are rotating over. Don't look it's at his lips. They're easy. definitely but synced up to the audio. rounds later, G2 know the way they counter this is they need to deal with those sensors early on in a round, right? So they get in here with the jet. And they're like, oh, the sensors are here. Oh, I bet I bet the deadlock is over on the A site. No, it's deeper sensors. We've got a player ready to swing off of that. It is beautiful. And G2 falls straight into the trap. Now, one more thing, if we sneak back there, that they're keeping fresh is the Killjoy setup. So here in mid, pretty common these days to see this turret that peers into the window inside tube and the alarm bot underneath for, 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 for full mid control. There. As in a huge Hold community there, tournament and gets another myself. coach's community, but I'm already looking round, to set that up with Dopey. I'm looking to set up a segment with dope eye like once a week where we pick five subs five who subs five dope eye subs we pick a map we you guys play on that map we vod review that and then you play once more on the map again and we'll do that like once a week so the idea is like we'll pick a set of five players similar rank uh who main the correct agents on a map like i'm not going to draft three fucking duelist mains and we'll like pick a good comp then we'll vod review like what we could have done better i'll teach you some like lineups and whatnot or whatever and then you'll run it back immediately same players every week no no, no it'll be like a raffle Knife as well as a do something like that before yeah you remember what we did during the icebox guide it'll be like that but like consistent and on like we'll do like a different map each week and we'll do like tack pauses and everything in the second game so after we like coach you and do VOD review of the first game the second game we'll each have two tack pauses like dope and i so we can call timeouts and talk to you they absolutely are and we saw eg they were up to the task with their counter strat on that one let's see what loud has they're going back to last year with harbor viper this is the comp that they were here we go here we go innovators of it but it's gonna have to beat eg when they are one map away deadlock is back that is crazy to say because this is a team 
World champs last year, completely dismantled. Only one player and a coach left. And now we're back away from another. I'll also say it, deadlock mains. What's that? She's not replacing the Sentinel? <laughs> you bring me a deadlock VOD and it's solo Sentinel, I'm closing it. By early on in rounds, dealing with a lot of this Sentinel utility. And also watching out for some of the double flash traps that are getting thrown against them. Because she's not a Sentinel. This is QCK's first jet map. I think he's gonna have to step Real. up. I think he had a really Ooh. poor performance on Ascent, and what a perfect map to do on Icebox Jet. It's a great day. I honestly didn't even think about that because that's a, that's gonna be a tall order for him to have to overcome here. It's been a while since he's played that role, so very much pressure is on Loud here. The last year champions of the Americas League up against a new look EG, and only one map. What other ag them. agents aren't actually their role? Sage. This, Sage. This is gonna make it to a third map. We're gonna send it right back over to Vansillian Rift for the call. Nah, Chamber's a Sentinel. Chamber fills the role. Like, if you have no Sentinel and you pick Chamber, that's fine. Roll is Sage, then just none? Yeah, pretty much. Like, I don't think I would ever advocate for you to learn Sage or Deadlock in solo queue. Because they're just, they're fringe edge case picks that are mostly just good in the pro scene under very certain criteria. And so you wouldn't be able to guarantee that criteria every time you pop that map. Like when you pop Icebox, you can't guarantee you'll have a Sentinel. If you're a Sentinel main, you should just learn Killjoy at that point. Let's see how it happens here. Already have a high tide coming up to dash across here from QCK. Locked up. As you actually heard from Ender, we never really see any deadlock setups towards his B side. It starts off instantly towards A. So it slowed down the pace for Loud. RJ, they for the 2 3. Up towards the A tower. Double flank coming up from EG. Slowly being watched by Less. Oh, Boom. Yeah, contacts. All three instantly won by Loud from both extremities. Flankers That's a good choice of episode for that Radiant Buddy, Less. It's up to Jockeymo and Nature on a 5 versus 2. Isolated on different parts of the A site. A triple swing towards the spawn. And it'll make it difficult here for Jockeymo to come back and try to clutch a 1v3. An underpeel sub, who do you think? I love the swarm. I think RJ sub just to play in the underpeel. Clutch this one up against 3 as he gets just smattered with a bunch of utility. But this was a really cool chaos round from Loud. Sadak goes across oh, the road. Oh, save the tier three. What is Sadak known for on round one. Sadak loves to get all orbs. Well, he's gonna get his anyways. He is the he is the the crosshair breaker that goes across rope. Everybody's flying in, but the wall from Harbor actually covers the majority of everything they're doing. So that rope travel isn't as dangerous. The rest of the team's flooding the bottom of the site, and EG was just no, sir. Well, Pen Flash, RJ just said no, and they were a previous tier three sub. As you can see, they've got the six month roll. I don't know. Moving through a little bit of a low buy here, but EG will be ready to meet loud. I like the harbor pickup as well versus deadlock. Like you're kind of trying to rewrite history, just to something like one of those favor yourself. You can just cove somebody or cove yourself a little bit of protection. Try play flash in the air, spike down, triple swing, one denied. Bishop, did you read all the guidelines? Before having a question, because if you didn't, you're you're gonna get cooked. There's a lot. Walls on walls here for loud. Yes, I did. Well, then, yeah, go ask an underpeel leagues. His as the main take wall, right? Less continues to put his wall on B. You're remaining for constant. All right. I mean, it was just it's just two rounds. EG are gonna turn it on. Good to go with Harbor. And look, they can even just really work past this viper wall it causes them hardly any issue and by the time that viper wall has been up the last few rounds we're seeing that they're already inside the site so really they're just getting back for post plant positions round three Bad. does it again not even have to be an operator this time and that's the thing the moving up with the harbor walls over there a great way over to scale there. up towards the map and great that utility from Targimo, but again it's eg playing that fourth position and catch how big is the script gonna be do that wouldn't that make a gas april fools video i hosted a tournament but it actually was scripted a lot more difficult here for loud to try to get that plant into b site 
and then moving forward off angle oh. red by QCK and then you just have like the three. most crazy <laughs> shit happen it's up to the Duke two controllers of less and twoies one in the nice arm now confirming the plan this is so high effort that I can like meme that I would do it because wow. you, you'd need to basically get like tier two teams Zylo they were the tier three you need good enough players to sell it. Huge. not looking good for eg their comp should be defensive sided with double senti feels comfortable against this really interesting take to get up to the uh the deadlock utility they just death ball it they find what could be their problem and they all take care of it together pushing forward cute little wide swing by qck to pick one up before great shots by jojimo too there on the full round but yeah Really nice control here by Loud. Patient walk up B. They take sight, plant, fundamentals all around here. We're seeing how this harbor comp. Their luck is into Senti, so it's really just single Senti. She's a defensive site. sided agent, my guy. All right. I don't need you being pedantic with me. A lot of ground on A here. A -Pop has already gained an Look at their comp. They have no duelist. And they're going to be able to rotate across the site now. EG's ready for this site hit. Feel like loud is gonna do one of their weights they've gone to a twice then loud hits b right and now it looks like they might even fake it more and they're ready for a pop as they rotate why isn't a. this last guy signed yet he's such a beast has so many or so much utility rather to yeah cross back towards the mid the mid rounding forcing eg on these rotates i mean you know on this lore by that you have on the defensive side they're gonna have to work the map a little bit Over more aggressively there. and quickly as a pop gets caught they're also relying on Gecko for plant. plant. A lot of teams have been doing that on this map. In this region, especially. I don't agree with it, but... I mean, wow. you saw in a rotate for me, G. They still, planted. even though Apoc I'm less has been the best Sentinel inside. player since Nats really chilled out. There was actually still players from Loud moving I agree. Less yeah. is probably the be of those as well. the best Sentinel player right now. Out against Loud's mid rounding. They're trying to get ahead of Loud right now. I think with the pace Loud is playing, you have to consider you're forcing your opponent's hand, right? Especially when Apoc gets a free push like that, and and they're all the way towards B. Do they have to wait for that? He's execution? ridiculously consistent. Alpha A. I think from loud. I, I would I would have really put him right up there with less if Fnatic qualified right. for Madrid. Jogmo's ultimate online operator as well for this deadlock, and they're gonna try to get positioning to use this beautiful drone destroyed. Up on the defense on a deadlock, punished right away by QCK as Derek's on the top of pipes being hit. By the Yelp out from Dewey's, slowing things down by throwing a mosh pit towards the right side of Damn, Derek shot the dart the off nature, nature there. The generator, looking for more information as the I've been there, Nature. I've been nice there. Combination, though. Looks like they heard nature pivot back Literally, like the generator. other day, I tried taking that Molly. And I died. Jack Keith eats stuff. Maybe. Pack your AS1 thing with tier 3. There's other names that could be the best nice Sentinels, right? But I don't do could be. They're still able to pick up the round on I'm results one. oriented They're when it comes to um in the face of QCK there. like player performance. Yeah. Little tricks like that did not stop Apoc from holding. And three kills from the same position like this too is actually kind of crazy. Continuing to reposition and just nail those shots. Nature is pumped up. Exactly. You probably if Loud loses to EG right now, Les doesn't become the best Senti player. Agreed. It'd be one of the best. Instantly puts up a wall and that's gonna force uh, the clock down here against That's team performance, not player performance. It's a team game. So it looks like they're trying to tackle more parts it's of the team game. Now. And I thought this is this is what might happen. 
Do they take out the wall? Do they put a bunch of people on it and then make Like at the end of the day, a large majority of what leads to a win or a loss in this game is how clean the team can communicate with one another and how quickly they can react to changes as a team. With that in mind, it's pretty fucking pointless to discuss who's like mechanically better or whatever. So in my head, the best player in a role is the player that can play their role in a team that wins. So yeah, you gotta win. Team game. Like Tui's, mechanically, I've said it, is not impressive. And yet I still say he's one of the best controllers in the league. Why? Because his util usage is phenomenal. I don't know. And because his team wins. Man, how would ice would it be to have, actually have a Sova somewhere for EG in this composition? All these walls and coves and things that Tui's is putting up is just allowing Loud to run amok in the site. They're able to trade each other. They're getting the angles they want as they run in. You know, Joshua's you get getting so many first picks, well and it, the fact it that it's not so mattering you know is crazy. On the move when you start to execute. <laughs> Quick escape there, but Jogmo still picks up the frag as they clean up the viper's pit and yeah loud my hot dogs are six minutes away chat this game they're forcing again forcing eg's hand on these retakes how fast eg have to rotate and the deadlock is not Pause, giving uh, eg as much ground on the map as it did before it's not stumping their opponent so what can they do now where do we where else do we see deadlock being used because it seems like loud has a bit of answer for it we've seen jogamo go a but prime messy and, and i'm B, timing right? you out it's kind of a no-brainer to throw the wall down when it can completely block everything and you are going to get some valorant uh, and down soccer round preventing a loud aren't rush. the same but loud has been hitting a on the rush how can they prevent that is the question well eg slowly recognizing here now that working those extremities is definitely the play mm -hmm. here for loud and this four position i mean even valorant today and valorant in episode two aren't the same game back in episode two one player could carry a team because duelists were so strong but now it's it's such a well-balanced team game it's really loud governing the in pro play yeah go look at vct reykjavik 2021 yo yo 10s literally solo carried sentinels to a trophy go look at the stats and go watch some of the games where do they go he, the, he, he carried them so far from them probably just see this orb from last once again go through they have the alarm bot back so extremity watch from loud double push here probably triple yeah they drop no a. maps they have a hero vandal to work with as well they just want to gain that map control by the tower and they have thrash too they can but they've nerfed the duelist role so much since then rightfully so to make it more of a team game yee nuggets thank you for tier three dg now has to worry about that rush coming through and they're not gonna have to worry about much same with yay in optic his stats on chamber are crazy to this day they'll always be crazy because there's no agent that can do what chamber used to be able to do anymore so getting stats like that's impossible now and that's the defenders the attempt that they're trying to do with the stink bite net not allow for eg to get these kills against loud loud continues to push forward towards the spawn and looking pretty flawless so far a high tide so difficult to deal against and there's that cove too forcing yourself to stick out here and flash you did the analysis right it's like nine of the sort of top 10 best performances for in vct history where people playing chamber or like pre-nerf jet gets the information contains everybody towards the b main wow but from beginning to the end it was loud. Like the agents were over tuned we haven't seen it in a long time teams pushing forward playing snowman trying to get through speed the site, is paro thing the five month prime being able to block off the right side and the entry from spawn jet in berlin oh got it deeper loud can prevent eg from setting up that retake even longer then they finally back into the site still have the viper wall to fall back on and they're just causing so much trouble deeper and charging was playing like such a beast it does not matter on the strats really working out for loud operator here from jog where did water malone go good question maybe water malone is lurking right now three players focus there it's already being pinged out by loud i think they heard the off shot so they know the off is back in the hands of jogimo silent supporter window of kitchen 
At least Superman solo alone on this B side, still being pinged out here. Wall still there. One cascade over towards A. That's why you kind of see A pop ready for anything around the corner, but Loud is at B. That was a fast run over from Tui's after they just gave a bit of util on the right side. Expect all the walls to be coming up here. If we huh. get Tui's wall across Loud's that Viper side, wall doesn't yeah, even cover top side at all. I guess they just use the Arbor wall. Jogimo is like... He's trying to pull his team to a round. We might do it this round. As Derek is trying to find that information, they can't find anything because the last two players are loud. Held back towards green. Now another tap on the spike, locked down, keeping them at bay. Even allowing potentially loud to focus back on the A sign and having less on the lurk until the double swing comes out. There we go. There we go. Towards B. And they run it. Just trying to create a different angle here to break across here. It has to be slow too. It's got money. Yeah. I shouldn't have to too bad. To go for the, the plant. Ten seconds Forcing left. the EG players out if you could actually kill a few players in the process. That cost two before you still say Mike because Lass so scary. Lass was alive. Lass was alive. I rate Lass really high. Tied up six six. They would be very very happy. They still have that operator to go back into the hands of Jogamo holding down yellow. Over Bro, Sadok is getting. So He's getting the street, man. Too. It really seemed like Loud had a stranglehold on the game and what EG was trying to do with the two bot fraggers in this game have down. one kill <laughs> combined. On your screen right there. You know what's funny is Jog, when he plays at Deadlock and he gets interviewed, he's like, it's to set up my That's team, it's to set up everybody. It's crazy. It better. And these guys out here are just fragging with an operator. Through walls. Every time, through walls every time he can get the chance. Spend IGL diff. Here's the cascade we saw last round, but now mini map a random. I missed it, but well. likely mini map. High low from the side allowed as they jump into the site and they push out EG. Yeah, he plus get delayed for a bit. So the nano swarms Jeez. coming out too. Lockdown available on the attack for the full time from Sadak. So EG does not want to give him a chance to do it. Now the Molly in the net. Did a lot of damage there on Damn. the Damn. dropping less in the process. Leaving Sadak okay, EG, alone. great retake. Reeling them in. Looks like one was cocooned there as Sadak gets picked off and EG are slowly coming back in the first map. Really? Kuro, Allen, they the four month prime. On that fight. It seemed it seemed like Loud continued to push through. That was a, a wait a, a sec. They still have um Kale. For Loud. Once they get that plant, it was post plant. But as they were planning, EG decided to step in and step oh, away. Oh well, and there we go. The timing difference there that caught caught Loud off guard. It also. is so I, Thomas. These Thank you like, for I the prime. The has on him because out in ranks, deadlocks aren't hitting alts like that. <laughs> crazy man, it's crazy. Apoth two also having a fantastic series so far here as those two are on top of the board a fantastic event have you guys seen that, that bind yeah, deadlock old lineup interviews that like bounces off a lamp for evil geniuses that you throw it from like here like apoth and swoopman to actually step it on bounces the off the a Americas lamp and I mean, somewhere like here colors, uh, and it launches and down and, a very and it hits opponent. like all and of front side the winners of america's <laughs> last year and you're able to fight toe-to-toe -to -toe against them as well it's definitely allowing that confidence to come up here for players like apoth as you saw those shots come through and it's very cool to see that you know apoth nature and like superman as you were as you were mentioning them have just been brought on to the vcct vct stage you know yep. seasoned players across challengers across other leagues in in the tier two scene but to be able to step onto the stage like this and slot right in. Did well. Jonas find that? He I don't know. Still looks as powerful as ever. I did not see it originally and in a Jonas clip. This one back to a tie with the momentum they have. Loud. See what they decide to change. Uh, Snow find it. Has been a few A hits here. It seems like the A hit is. Yeah, here it is. Here it is. Yeah, yeah. Like they're standing up here. My bad. <laughs> it's so big. Somewhere, but they've realized less. Isn't Shout out to Gibbon. Not having to worry too much of if Loud was going to play extremity. Hey, show me my an initial hit. Game. I think Loud could do a little bit with that fake. Oh my word. Both of them got lucky there. <laughs> but hey, Pop, what? Oh, again. Catching less off guard, but still losing the head to head. Like, how does Les get that kill? Yeah. What is it head. like to play the but game to pivot back towards the B -side in his head, dude? Way towards that area. You and lockdown run. will potentially be used, and indeed it does. Superman pretty much in a one and done position. Nothing to really allow for him to fall back. He'll swing, but Loud is ready for it. And as I say, that comes out with the kill. 
And he'll finally get detained and stopped. Right there. He tried. Default Mosh. Oh, the timing just off there for Jogamo as they start heading towards the site. This lurk is going to be so big from less in the end, and he's low. As long as he doesn't make noise. He's lurking around the corner and does get the kill into nature. Never mind. Three round from loud. But honestly, like, sort of lucky. They exposed the Jajima's operator. And Jajima had an uncharacteristic miss. It does happen. Expecting a push from Evil Geniuses, too, for less to be away from the team that long. We were just saying they're not kind of leaving a pressure player on the side of the map. And while less didn't act as a pressure Dude. player, he uh, so far in EG's comp, I don't like the deadlock pick uh, i think it's goofy they just use figured out at all happy on the retake happy on b hits so far a has been where the post plant now falls towards eg this ultimate towards b as well is kind of get an idea that jogmo can come back over on deadlock right on top of screens gets information to flash in the air apoth in nature what? capitalizing on two kills no command available as well if they get pressure too much gecko plus ko over so seems crazy to me so that's good enough. yeah so i really dislike remaining. no having no sage cool no harbor uh, i'm not a fan just has to work the map. i personally don't think that's a viable yeah, way to play this map but a lot of Decent na of teams in particular lot, have been just picking harbor and going yeah this is enough and they just use gecko to plant Pushing too aggressively for EG. Sorry, they picked Gecko, not Harbor. <laughs> I got dizzy. They've just been picking Gecko, saying that's enough. And they just use Wingman to plant. Oh, my hot dogs are here. Trying to bait out some players by making a lot of noise. Carrying spike. What do you think of so many teams dropping the Sova, though? I mean, they're making room. But I like the Sova, personally. Alright, alright. Hot dogs. Give me a sec. Jeez. A little bit of hype creator there for, for him and the team. That's got to feel half. good. Great round there from Evil Geniuses. They have, what, been on pipes and in the face of Loud every time they go A uh, to fight as soon as they can. Nature from the bottom, A pop from the top, and you would think Players that Loud game. has that area of maze of pipes on lockdown. You have a Soba, you're going to drone, you have a Sonar Bolt, you can throw up there, but EG is still time working ahead of the game, act. much like they did on Ascent to prevent Loud's utility from even mattering. That's how fast Sounds EG's pushing up for these fights. This way. time Just EG sets back. Move. We got a few alts around the board here as the Reckoning is going to be thrown towards A as a ruse. The move is towards B. But oh, damn. Push here EG's biting up. hard. Footsteps, but was looking towards the air. Almost got caught. Oh, my gosh. But couldn't capitalize on the kill and the surprise that he had against Kawadzin. And at the same time, Sadat gets that pick. The null command that was being used towards the game side that was baited out for that. Oh dear. Not looking for that timing. Derek was painting out the same thing. So that's just running that clock down. I, mean, I got my hot dogs, chat. That's going to be annoying to deal against me. Well, this is a battle. It is too late. Because look at that. The rest of them are just hanging out towards the B side. And yeah, fries. Thing, Sadak. Yeah, literally holding a team hostage right there towards A. Sadak just masterminding for a little bit. And now it's going to be the site take. Everybody's safe with the control that they have. And again, as a team here, you don't have to worry that much about the deadlock utility if you're working the map well. Okay, Pop. Yeah, even the upshot missed, but Apoth is there to fight. 36 seconds left on the clock as the lockdown comes down, and all of Loud instantly running across towards the east side this time. The hell? The defensive utility to delay. So EG has to try to get a timing, and as Apoth comes through, we go. the orb that was actually a cove that was be allowing. I mean, the double right. orb to allow Loud to cross right. over towards the A site. Wait. He needs a kill right now for Apoth. He does get a ping at least onto one player. There is that first kill. Tuis, meanwhile, training it back onto Jockey on the oh. other side. Derek with the wall bang. Wait. On Tuis. A two versus one. Let's okay, Les is the scariest guy to be alive here. Down towards the screen. They have no information for EG. So you see them just moving around, making a lot of noise, covering every single angle. And Les is in a good spot for a 1v1. And as he swings out, there's that first one in the back of dice. A pop on the top of the pipes. He's so Misses dangerous. Delay. With that snake bite. I love Less going up. Moving towards I love going up. Tower. A pop is guessing around towards the back in those footsteps. It's going to be heard all along by Les. Yep. Great spot here for Les to get the kill as A pop repels up.
A Red Bull clutch as Loud finishes the half with eight. I think going up a is like big last round from Loud. That's one, one of the, the most consistent ways to convert to those clutches. I think a lot of what we get out of Loud is they're defaulting a lot. They want to feel the team out, and they're not quite giving us an idea of what the playbook looks like. They are Loud's like, all right, reckoning a, we're gonna start just spreading the map out to make sure that if we get caught by the util on B. They're worried about if we're hitting A and can't work off of everything. So Loud putting a lot of stuff on the table there. EG could not finish their food. Loud come up big with an 8-4 first half. Well, now at least let's toss it over to Dude, Spinks, so who's good. hanging out with their co-streamers right here in the Riot Games Arena. It's Grim and Shiro. Thank you very much, as always, Van Smix sitting here at the Riot Games Arena. What the? Sitting with Shiro as well as Grim. It is fantastic to have you guys here. And uh, I can't help but notice that you are quite the artist. Yeah, just a little Gojo drawing. <laughs> I'm trying to curse NRGN loud. Sorry, guys. <laughs> okay, okay. It, it seems like your curse worked on map number one, but maybe, okay. maybe something's missing for map number two. Uh, I really think EG is going to bring this back. Uh, half two. I told Grim they'd be 2 0 -well, EG. And 2 uh, 0 -well Grim looks like, how did I end up here? I would All look right, the we same. I'm hearing the predictions coming over from the side of this sick, dude. I heard you before this half wrapped. I heard you say, mm, 5 7. I I'd like a 5 7, but it was a 4 8. Yeah. What are your thoughts? Um, You know, I think I think Jojmo is cooking. He's like a little snowball effect here if he keeps going. Uh, I think he's really strong. I wish the stuns were used more, but uh, yeah, I think they have a really good counterplay there. But uh, they still got it. They still got it. I think he just got this. And I think a lot of people, you know, at, at this point, when you, you get think food on VCT Sage, between map camps, not no. Sage, and we no. know you love Sage. So, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, uh, Sage I would is be in a really so bad, bad Chad. I mean, I think um, when Deadlock's getting picked more than Sage, there's a clear issue. Uh, hey, you but, know how um, you get nervous yeah, playing maybe, on stream? You know, if you're just singing on no, sunset, no, no, I don't know. Maybe I draw my fucking lime or something. <laughs> Please, something, bro. Jesus, I mean, maybe. Hey, we'll see. Riot, please. I can't talk please. to a human in okay, person okay. like that. Last question. On we already know what the predictions are coming over from the side of Shiro. I be the end of my final career. Question for you: Who are you predicting is going to take this one? What's the? Let me eat my hot dogs in peace. And who is going to win with Energy Sentinel? Okay, so I'd hope, I'd hope EG wins like 13-10, but I think it's going to be, I think it's going to be loud 13-8, and the next map EG's got it. We'll see if that's indeed the case. I say that's understandable. We're gonna head back as the game is ready. So Vans and Riv, it's all yours. How the dog foods? They're delicious. We need the exactly again, what I man. expected from a hot dog. Back, where everybody's missing the crazy walls. Come on, Riot. I still see my rank games that I hated. <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're back in. Watching VCT makes you feel like a pro. I proceed to go double negative in houses. Ain't that the fucking it truth, like dude? EG wants to tempt. Who might be pushing B main Ooh. here now? Attempt did not work. They're trying to push through that harbor wall. It's just giving so much coverage to the first two entryways into B. And QCK takes big advantage. Now I'll watch myself EG. play like Jet. Find a way. I'll be like, that was so easy. Holy shit, I mid round. Let's do it on Raze now. So this should still be a good hit. Then I'll pick Raze. And I'll throw yeah, five abilities that all suck. Generator. Mm -hmm. just I'll for say nothing. And then I'll blame my team. For the, wall to come down. Right the, the quintuple thing. Blunder. Nato Storm couldn't get broken up there towards the A tower, so that allows Sadat to get the kill with that frenzy. Plant now coming down for wingmen. But already it's a three player disadvantage for EG. Yeah. Derek and Nature holding the back of the A site. Here's the flood retake out from Loud. That's what we know Loud for. Very, very good with the utility on the retake. The worst part is, I'll realize that. Then the missile. next ranked day, I'll be like, time to do it differently. Everything. They have nothing to throw at us. Dump the util out back into the site. The fans are happy to see that pistol round come through. It's the same shit. And loud. Very close to bringing us to a next map with the momentum that they have created here. Marshall for QCK. They're going to keep the long shots on B going for him. Evil Genius. One day trap. Like they might I'm going to wake up. Shark and it'll be better. Stinger second. The 1% improvements will add up. Just enough money to want to dip and the reps. Funds. We'll add up with full armor here. Just watch. Jogmo feeling good there. Watch me fly, chat. What do they do? They're gonna attempt the map first before they hit together, or are they just gonna kind of two death ball this? Yeah. Well, something AG's good at is allowing APOT to get lurks. And to, for them to get lurks, they have to be a little bit more aggressive. So, I wonder if they're gonna try to add that pressure towards that B site to start. I did see an attempt of a 2 2 split, but with that high tide coming up from loud on that A side and not allowing the turret to get information on the A side for EG. You just have to reset.
playing these low buys so seriously. And they haven't yet showed what weapons they have. They still have it. They finally do. The what? actually catches the teammates. What? It comes out somehow so that cannot win these shots. The flank what? behind of Kaozi from the what? ball traded out by Fight Superman. Planted. Plant comes down. No what is this round? The wingman. So it's a two that v4. Cody Stinger has two kills, bro. That could turn costly for loud. I was watching As Cody the other day. Trying to win it back. He ADS with Stinger side. at like 40 meters. The lurk out from Triple Ava. headshot. Wins that against less. It's up to QCK. Where that outlaw picks up a Stinger. Like, that's not natural. It's going head to head against Apoth around the corner, and Apoth is just a drive-by. Walking across calmly Incredible. with the headshot. Incredible. Great force from EG. Really the force buy actually right. converted for EG. Right. I mean, Loud was even on their low buy. Not expecting that. Kind of bringing their own medicine. EG was too loud. Loud's the one that's always saying, fear us. Expect anything. We're never going to play it normal. As a Neon player, my favorite comes to Stinger. No, Does dude. EG Cody will buy it and use it like a fucking Marshall. Force buy here it makes no sense. One, Apop comes up huge. And Sadak there does easily over 150 damage. It's like he'd rather have it over the Marshall. Of EG and it does not connect with you know, the long range fight. Unfortunately, giving that space that EG needed. Fortunately for them, a push again. Loud is very, very active on this defensive side. EG's ready for it though. No util in hand, waiting yeah. with weapons. QCK's low on HP. Bucky's close. Now the swing out Jogimo. Oh, oh. That gap has been closed. Kawazin gets that a headshot, but at least not. An opportunity here for Lau to pick up that Locked rifle left it. behind. Derek protecting it with his life. Upgrades it now. And all of Lau falls back and they want to play the power of numbers. Way far back. Lau totally regroups on this one. Just actually, Les is still hanging out by himself. But do you see what EG is thinking? Knowing Lau can still pull something out of their hat that drops every weapon EG's holding right now. So fully respecting this move up. A good delay by the wall coming in from Harbor. Tui's always in a spot to be able to get that down. Interitus, you're overthinking it. it. First of all, don't coach Penflash on how to do production. We got a team for that. Second of all, we can do replays. And this will prompt loud One guy. Make that rotation for exits and Just like this. Yeah, and initially when they started... Anyways, I'm going to actually show you the round. You do not need a dedicated production team to run a simple replay system. Just to make sure and confirm as they're scaling up... Run a more complicated one, you do. But you don't need a complicated replay system for an in-house league. There's three players from Loud greeting Derek as he falls. Advantage still comes out for Loud, and this is going to be the difficult task. Play against the amount of walls that Loud has on a retake. High tide comes out. Nature swings through. Still has a flash. Gets picked behind as he tries to look for some cover. I will replay this. The end of this round. But the who's replay? No production team. Round win. Let's head over to the instant replay. Loud. See? And look, there's my banana. You gotta be kidding me. How is this going back and forth right where's now? My, where's my production team? Loud's retakes overall I don't need have, one. have been amazing. And EG there is trying to wait Loud out. Play it patiently. See if they'll use more util. It took EG with the buy to play out the replay. So long to get up long. Round and over. Unfortunately, when they use their like util, the fuse. It was kind of free and I can just go back and so look. The round hasn't started yet. Loud tries to get back in other than maybe the Dizzy. How did I time it so well? EG's wow. From finding a result here. Still, the plant went down, so we'll see EG with some Proof money. Proof by. And loud goes back to a pretty default. Contradiction. Here, just a rotation. QED. With the operator now, so holding the hard angles. Let's see if EG really winds the time down. Here at 89, thank you for the prime. Double flash too, just to try to get control of green. You can see how difficult it is for EG to gain control of green. Exactly. To start the rounds because of this high tide from Dewey. Yeah, if you want to edit the clip, mid game, you need a producer, which is what Riot does. You can grab it. Their clips have freeze frames. Do it again. All the way through. A yellow. Ooh. An alert though. Maybe did not expect the oh, that's bullshit. Still spraying with the bulldog. Capitalizes on the kill onto Apoth. So the fundamentals for EG trying to go for the split towards the B side did not pay off, but they still have players alive here towards oh, the B side. God. How's he get away with that? Hunter's Fury coming out here to try to retake the site. It's coming out from Kawazin. Does get the ping onto Derek. Players are low. Snake bites being thrown Do they know Derek the sucked yellow because of the mollies? But they're pretty much out of util. What? Holding back towards yellow. You piece.
Now as everything gets stopped from the thrash, the swing comes what was that? but the fight's still won by loud. Wingman coming out on the left side, but there you go as he starts swinging back. Okay, out. we didn't really There's miss it. Too many players of loud to deal against. Gets one for his troubles. Oh, what's up with that? All right, I'm running to the bathroom. Oh my I finished God. my hot dogs. You Give me a sec. Loud is kind of standing out in the open there. They're so close. They're coming forward. This harbor utility just allows Loud to encroach a little bit more and then a little bit more and find the kill they want from an angle the wall's creating and then a little bit more, a little further into the site. There's so much safety in approaching these retakes on B with the harbor. It just seems like EG has swarmed when they do see that harbor wall go down. We're going to get an EG timeout now as they need to stop the bleeding. 11 to 5 right now for Loud as we're on Icebox. That's the beauty of you know, the coaching staff and also Sadak of how much they're able to study off the tape that they have against EG, almost like what EG did to yeah, Loud on Ascent. This might be a situation where oh, there's a timeout. they're going to trade off bet. Uh, their map picks here uh, against yeah. each other because as you're looking at how EG has been so good on a defensive side on uh, on their game, in their game against G2, they got actually punished on their defensive side here. And on the attack, they were good for these amount of flanks that came through the splits, the late lurks. And all that's Damn, Potter's got here. so much to say. Maybe sometimes the shots weren't the cleanest there from Sadak, but he's always ready in this position on the top of B heaven, yeah. back towards Orange. They know that there's always going to be something happening. Feared 98, thanks for the prime. Rosar, yes, thank you for the prime. Protocols for EG to take control of yellow. But Hatchy man underscore J, thank you for the three so month prime. Timeout, they have to switch something around where maybe most of that pressure has yeah. to come in the B site more than the scaling towards the B yellow. Scripted, who knew there was going to be a timeout? <laughs> I did happens. not. And get a good retake onto the site. An easy defuse there. Easy is easier said than done. The marshal though, Jogmo is going to try to still get some long range. Potter saying fanatic came back because lot of this map now it's our turn. All right. <laughs> so we've seen EG with a pretty similar. Fanatic built start. this comeback in a in cave the, with a bunch of scraps. Whether or not they have three here at B to kind of attack Loud's push that they've seen a few rounds. Potter, we're not we're not yeah, fanatic. Operator for Marshall shot, and they'll know that op is now rotating around the map, so they have to be careful. Peeking on contact is dangerous now. EG's just trying to keep the loud players positioned towards the A side. The land, the up already rotated towards A, and drops A path. It's going to make it a little bit more difficult for Nature to sell this fake. So EG looks to work together. Two players falling back now for a mid pivot to A, while the little fake is this time towards the B site. They know that there's at least two players from loud towards A right now from EG's point of view. Yeah, Jogmo is saying, "Look at me, make a noise over here at B. I've destroyed your alarm bot. Now you have Works to care." Yeah, but they don't they don't really Josh care about what's fearless. going on at B. They're kind of reading this mid play right now and giving up sight. Loud going back into a bit more of a formation of a retake. I'm nearly falling also, asleep, bro. What time zone are you in? Be the actual play. Jogamo, Captain Blue 42, thank you for the 10 month Superman Prime. Dissect the entirety of Loud's retake. Left. It comes down to that one. Superman trying to potentially get a pick into Boiler. It gets pinged out, so they know that Wes was there. Sadak pivoting over to help. Maybe JP, they have a five month Prime. There it is. A good pick. There's no fake. There's not enough time. Yeah, they're getting the plan. Players on the A side is still there for Loud. At least we get a plant down for EG. I wonder why the audience Use isn't cheering for Lil Bro. Punish one down by the dice. Is it just like one EG guy every now and then cheers for Lil Bro and it gets the whole audience going? Potential setups here for a dizzy double flash. There's the underhand, but the timing's better for loud. Is it because new to Buddha's there? On their retake. That wall. And we're in ready for that one and we're looking to be in a very good spot to just defuse it. Even the cove to secure. Oh, the defuse for now. At least it's halfway. Is new to Buddha not halfway. cheer for Lil Bro? Oh my gosh, Loud just dictating the retakes with that harbor wall on top of the viper wall. It's like they can create little thunder domes to fight in. And if you're in it, you're the probably cheer meta has shifted. Time. They move on True, I guess it's all about the turtles now. Approach on to B site when they're retaking. 12 to 5 here, Loud. San Maya, thank you for the prime. To ascend in the lineup. And it does not seem like they're as affected here by the deadlock as they did their own countering uh, for their homework. <laughs> That's a neck Jeez. shot. Popping off on the harbor too. Three members right now allowed up on 18 frags. Just about really big teamwork. Bro, is chilling. He is chilling. He is chilling. Members of loud are being able to stop. POV, a. you're playing a strategy game, huh? We're going five and thirteen and dominating. Interesting walls. 
stopping the mid push so they can just go towards focus to A. They leave that flank to Sadak, and they feel like EG is going to hit here now as EG is tempting the side. How are they going to use this deadlock and ultimate? Throwing this wall is still very similar to Bounce it Raptors? Look, they don't have info. Oh, you're go. Contacts, but still won by EG. Bowser Rafters. Well, I guess it works. She caught one now. The Kalazine's playing the off angle at the bottom of pipes tonight right away. There's only going to be hey. one player left. As the women gets the plant. planted. Kalise wins that one, but... Silver Shock should be able to break the snowman, Robin Wappen. I don't see why not. Especially with the wall blocking his path. Placing swarm grenade. To move back in the A site. <laughs> You ever just bounce and do it and make music? Makes that little boing boing noise. Sometimes you gotta keep yourself on the up and up when you're playing, and that's how you do it. Bounce into the wall. Obviously, nothing gonna happen here for Sadak. He is trying to get some exit frags on the way out. Nothing gonna happen. Never mind. Never mind. I'm thinking of the post plants here. There's some. There's some mollies making a hot. Ah, uh, yeah. tough. So you can never count out Sadak, actually. You think the last time they played split, he's just jumping off the balcony, getting a 3K to end the map. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Never doubt the Sadak. Even Mimi says. And despite Sadak going for these hero plays... JPK is going to test it. Wait, you mean you don't have lineups for it yet? It seems as though that type of play that he's trying to do as the IGL is for the long game. Continue to keep that economy low here for EG, even if they won that last round. So that when it comes down to enough ults, enough money, EG potentially may have nothing left. I mean, look at their buy currently. Three small yeah, They got four ults on EG, though. They're kind of chilling. CG, same protocol now towards the front of this B site. Actually, activating a little bit more quickly. Knife came out towards yellow, got shot right away, so they have to be wary of potentially the ops still being posted in this area. Even avoided, huh? But Kizuki did not land that shot. Nice to hard peek a little bit harder now. Util is definitely going to be pushing QCK off a little easier. EG and Jogmo know that, but they're not going to use Util as they get out, though. QCK Tough. still comes up with a big kill on Superman. So there's EG's no having the problem that Loud had on Ascent. They, have they can't collect space, recon. Space with thrash. Don't think and Loud's be stopping. Back right away here, but they're trying. And Jogmo's got great space. Even though the thrash not get anybody, so does Apoth. The the knows that was on the top of that I, I don't so think you ever expect Apoth here, but the um the Kizuki turret. Pulse plant yeah. situation alert now activated. Ooh. Spotted by Apot, but the count alert comes Let's back to Sadak. And he's got to be all alone. After his teammate falls, reckoning being pulled out. Net being thrown <laughs> for Jogimo as he gets the surprise kill. Sensor triggered. That's one of the things you see deadlock actually. Belly, yes, Belial, Harlequin, thanks for the tier one. And it's rare, thanks for the four month the prime. the moment is really tight. When you're forced to run, you're forced to move. You don't really get a chance to have as much space with deadlock on the map and you see a, the effect of it right there dsa snowman is immune to shocks what do to take that brown back so we can't make new lineups just to kill the snowman that might be an effect last round with some of the low armor but that's the worst push through they persevere two rounds in a row how about sova ult and they go back to this same setup this two one two Get a little bit of a loud, uh, uh, loud's initial utility out. Be able to surely so old works. Where they don't have as much to dump into the site. It's been about 45 seconds each time here for EG the past few rounds. We'll see if they wait that same amount to get their own signatures back up. Rotate Winter charm is that a fucking gold here. icon next to your name? They've been very mobile. surely not. Even if it's not to push, they're staying moving from site to site. Somebody give him a fake roll for like shit. Like, it's fight. the real one. On wow. Let's go. By nature. As the Alantron gets information on one of those lurkers, that Superman. There's that second one. So for AG, it's the same game plan. This is now being read by Lound. Yeah. But they pivot still on two two in terms of their positioning. It's a big kill by Loud. This is gonna come up to nature now. Getting the flash out. That's gonna break some crosshairs. So. You see Loud presenting themselves a little bit more, knowing Derek's utility isn't there. Lockdown comes in. 30 seconds left. Loud will have to reconsider positioning here once we get the spike down. Nice orb. Allowing Kalatina to fall back. Give it an old command now coming out on the attack. And a okay. mm. Trying to confirm this plan. The setup out for EG. This oh, looks tough. Might be it. Falls, and now it's a safer plant. 
just around the corner. Oh, they got the bomb down. Bad. Pig is eating up every bullet. To reset the clock, run it back in their favor. But for loud this time around, they have their own two walls to work with on the retake, and they'll use it. Log down now for Sadak. Superman trying to delay as much as he can, even pushing forward through his own Molly. Now slowly working this out. There's only Ooh. nature left. Five, Five HP remaining. The There's no way. There's no way. Pay out loud. We're going map three. We're opening wall, chat up. The wall to move around from a harbor here. Loud All subscribers. The map they wanted to play on. That was awesome from loud coming in to bring us into a map free now we all go subscribers after this but to come off the ascent where eg was so strong a night and day i predicted both maps correctly all right who wins like map three came in with the great counters for each other to say it on three three two one loud inside, right it's it's wild hey you didn't type yours it's been very difficult to play against there for eg on those amounts of walls that you talked about here riv but so now cool. it, it shows how much again the work really came in and for loud and now the next map is going to be sunset the map where it will decide the end of the journey for one of these teams and that will happen after the break all right chat i'm gonna go cut up an apple uh because bananas are the superior fruit uh you guys play some chess me the vct stream up let's put it in the corner there. that's a good spot i'll be right back i'll be right back Gonna be enough. They know where Ned is. He's dropped him. Another clip. Oh, Superman. 
placar, acaba caindo cedo, mas o Cauã avançou e levou dois. Que Cauã 13-7, note, that's not the score for the first game, it's actually a score for the second game. And note, EG didn't win it, Loud won it. That's right, because they won EG's map pick. Yeah, we're just living in the upside down. Good news is, that means we're going to a map three. That's right, folks, for the match that will determine who moves on to Madrid? It couldn't end any other way. Golden Boy back here once again with Ender. We got Mimi as well as Vanity to discuss everything that we just saw. And I think it's safe to say, guys, that this was the loud that we had expected to see out of Ascent. The, the, the loud that puts the pressure on their opponents and makes them make mistakes. We got literally that here at Icebox. Honestly, something tells me that during this past week, EG was putting the majority of their time on Ascent and <laughs> Loud was putting the majority of their time on Icebox. Both teams knew what the other wanted to pick. So in a way, it almost makes sense that they came in with a very good plan. Yeah, it absolutely does. I think the prep from Loud on this one was excellent. In particular, I think the Harbor Viper with these flood retakes really punishes the way the CG comp wants to play. It's kind of like stage base. You throw out your first Gecko, you throw out your first Sonic Sensors, you collect it, then you go into the next layer. But this comp waits for that utility to be invested and then is instantly flooding back in on these retakes and was so punishing, especially in that second half. But even going into that first half as well, Vanity Loud was looking excellent. I think something to look at is Loud was eight of nine in post plants. I would assume if you look at EG's last match in uh, against EG or G2, they probably won the majority of their post plants, and they didn't do that here. They were like three for seven, which is something that you kind of need to rely on with a comp like this. You need to win your late rounds. Yeah, we yeah. were talking between maps, and, and you mentioned that you were pretty surprised that EG went into the same kind of the same comp again. You were surprised that they were playing the deadlock for the second time in a row. Do you think it was a mistake to go back into this comp? I think going into deadlock back-to-back -back weeks without changing anything is pretty difficult because the agent is so, like, it's very strong in, like, a... What is the word? Uh, like, when it's the first time you're seeing yeah, it, it's, it's like yeah. a gimmick. It's really strong in, like, a closed uh, gimmick. Yeah, yeah, that's a good way to put it. Um, yeah. But I think using it long-term is pretty difficult because of the limited use case. I think it's something you need to pull out here and there. Like, you can use it as yeah. a secondary comp, but I think using it as your primary comp, the deadlock doesn't get a ton of value. Yeah, and also uh, something that I had really started to tack on to was it really did, we were talking about this briefly, it just felt like EG weren't really, like a lot of guys were just trying to make something happen. And I felt like it, it, we saw a little bit of that in Ascent, and we definitely got a little bit of that in Icebox, where players were just trying to make ones happen and just see if they could make a play occur. Do you think like that also could have potentially been a, a like bad play there for EG there? I definitely think the team play looked significantly worse on this map for EG compared yeah. to Ascent. I think on Ascent, they were always together. Always I'm not crazy. Out. Yeah, uh, for sure. Uh, <laughs> I think Loud also realized, like, they were making a lot of mistakes on Ascent, and they kind of, like, okay, guys, we need to be better. Yeah. They showed that they're capable of it, and then we'll see what happens on Sunset. But yeah. Loud plays a cool comp, so you guys will like this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I will say, though, that, like, defensively, like, from looking at how EG almost need to play, is they do need some individuals taking risks. Uh, I would say, on the other hand, though, when they're looking to walk forward and fight, doing it into less, the man was an absolute monster, especially on that first half. Uh, don't don't look at the funny look at the line. Lower it's not I, funny. I disagree wholeheartedly. Uh, that is no. freaking hilarious. No, more no. or less, less more. It's, it's unoriginal, so Golden Boy. It's I don't care. Okay. We're not going to give him the time of day. <laughs> I do got to say though, man, less is just slotted into this role of being like the guy on loud so he was the guy well. last year people he just was. didn't remember because of Ospas. he's yeah. always been the guy i know he's right that's crazy been. it's like it, the, uh, what was the, the joke that we said last week it was like he was the guy the only other person that could possibly take the air in the room was Ospas. he was the he was second best player in america's <laughs> yeah. and unfortunately that was after his teammates <laughs> and that's why he kicked him so he could be number one well drama starting <laughs> here true. we didn't say it ender did you can find him on twitter no in any case so let's go ahead and see where we are right now with the map update and how things are breaking down because as i had mentioned two 13 sevens the map picks for each side go in the way of their opponent and now we find ourselves here on sunset now vanity i want to bring this over to you because when we were looking at the map picks and bands i remember I remember vividly you saying you wanted to see Sunset. Tell the viewers why. I mean, I'm, I don't want to say they're comp, but it's similar to Ascent. Okay. Very similar. Uh, in practice, it plays really well. I think they lean into their strengths really well. They take the space. I think something they didn't do on Ascent that they do really well on Sunset is like 
splitting up the and by map. they uh, we're talking uh, sorry you. about uh, uh, loud i loud, think loud yeah. failed on ascent to take the space with the viper omen that they usually do with the extra flashes they have and i think it's something they're very good at on sunset and it's something they'll probably lead on this match mm -hmm. yeah something loud has historically always done is they tend to have kind of a comp that they make their team identity last year it was the harbor viper this year we've already seen this triple flash no dive be played on two of their maps yeah. in their pool so it definitely wouldn't be surprising if they go into something similar on sunset i think that can really work on this map that initiator utility on defense is great to be always fighting for that extremity control and as we saw from sentinels last exactly. week it's so strong in the retakes yeah as well. that's what i was going to say is there's already been a few teams around the globe that have played no dive on this map and i think a big reason because of that is how the a site operates because you can wrap around both sides it's very hard to actually you know get value off of like dashing there forward off of the utility sometimes so there will be a slight wrinkle on this instead of a ko it is a sova so a little bit more information here as opposed to having that third flash of a ko i think that sova is also quite important on this map because you're nine times out of ten going to be playing into a cypher and breaking those strips can be really pivotal on your attack and as we see on the other side eg going to be going back to that same comp that we saw versus g2 vanity i think something that they're going to need to do is adjust their game plan because it looked like an ice box they went into the same game plan and just loud made it look really easy. But are they capable of doing that? See, that's the reason why I, I get so nervous about this, only because this is a team that's coming into it with not a lot of experience as a unit, whereas loud on the other side, you have the general and Sadak who could lead the troops to victory. We'll see where the chips fall for this one, but for now, let's send it over to your casters to call the final map of this competition of this particular series. It's, of course, Ben Silly and Rip. Yo, what's up, gamers? So it all comes down to this final map. And what G the hell happened in this position? That could really guide his roster, his soldiers to make it through and potentially call How did this dream. happen? But for EG, they haven't changed anything whatsoever. And you don't have tape to actually play against Loud right now on this map. So well, ain't no we way this game's ending. Is, they might fall back into the same protocols. Like That's a draw. Last year by Sadak. But, you know, you could always believe in this roster. You could always believe That's a draw. in Loud as well. To fix those mistakes that they had against G2, that the map that is starting against G2 to make it to this spot right now. We've been noticing a lot of teams losing their map up. picks this year. Why do you think that is? They start off here. Trip and Dust, did you consider I checking how often they the lost them in the previous years? See if the protocol because there's no change. Up, if the flashes are able to be used, map pick doesn't really have hits, much of a predictor towards uh outcome. Jordan Joe start 1348 for the tier three really to get any control in the extremities they are peaking where they would safely oh, i can extend the blank at least that peak counts big time even spotted a pod holding back towards the link that's already spike also falling down so you already see loud pivoting yep. back forward but as they're trying to answer back through the market jogging is able to even up the tally of 4v4 eg picking up the spike and falling back not deciding yet where they want to pivot finishing just my apple up shop get a little bit more from this link side yeah good time to wait for fault line to come back up here who do, do you want to win nature's positioning he can go uh, right across into elbow and i don't really care try to take on two flash that's the flash to come through does that a lot there from that b link forcing now two to fall back in the site also he's the only defender on this a site double I like flashes. both these teams running all the way back fully blinded sadak due to smoke gets a lucky one onto superman jogging at gets the plant I say I want loud. Things are gonna get difficult right now for EG. The cage because <laughs> I want so loud versus uh, Carmine Corp forward. on ascent. That's about it. Trying to bait out the shots with the camera, oh, even getting it. shot back by less. Only now two players alive for EG, holding out towards the link. Now the swing, the timing's perfect for FuseK though. Ooh. Well, now, now, loud to get the backstab in the pinch, the defuse as well for the pistol. FuseK. Nice yeah, time. loud he really liked the Phoenix the pick. There to catch off I think it's because his flash is undodgeable. And a little bit of med, mid pressure to a pressure so eg got to do uh, a bit of sightseeing on the map if you will trying to learn what that uh, that pistol round might look like and where loud setup may be for these base rounds and they do see the breach playing left side omen playing left side so still info to be gained there even loud coming up with the defuse so they're gonna feel good moving into the next one lots of bulldog buys and that vandal here for loud feeling confident in the money so expect them to stay back and anchor each other the reaction time needed for a phoenix flash if it's thrown correctly it's like 100 ms yeah quick scan if the phoenix flash is thrown the right distance from a corner so like you only see it the minimal amount a little bit deep though so you'd need literally inhuman reaction speed do some chip damage to allowing and forcing the swing out from eg far as i'm aware nobody has 100 ms in the league seems like i was thrown on the attack here for eg and they'll fall back for a bit 
working back towards this A site. Yep. Two shock darts gone now. A pot still with 100 so MSPs. Well, nope. The site, if they can set up a post, I don't believe anybody's ever cleared, as loud comes back in been like when properly recorded to be that fast as far as we're aware really just looking for the timing to flood out some f1 driver reaction speed that is smoke. actually a misnomer oh my Han also being thrown people okay, act like f1 it. drivers have fastest reaction speeds instead. and i was curious so i dug really deeper into this it's a complete myth ready for it he wants to play complete myth. towards this elbow trying to get a couple of kills now in his position as his phoenix Cowardine just like in support. Valorant, it actually doesn't Kusiki matter that much. Also still holding back towards the site. Enemy oh my remaining. gosh. That's probably an all for him for the next round indeed. Yeah, just absolutely taken down one by Yeah, the one. average for you was like 200 MS. Just very similar to the average in Valorant. Guns like that <laughs> as EG tried to stretch them thin. Like yeah, it matters if you're 40 and your reaction sites. speed's 300 MS. But it does not matter. Good little idea though. We do get a uh, how Sadak in B want to play. I watched. So, happy to throw so I got recommended a YouTube video, dude. That was like how F1 drivers are different or whatever. And so I clicked on it. I was interested. And this professional F1 like coach, we're only two minutes into the video. And he says like Formula dr One drivers have some of the fastest reaction times on the planet. They average like 200 MS while the average human averages 500 and I burst out laughing. <laughs> this guy just dead ass stated like as fact that the average human reacts in 500 milliseconds. <laughs> I, cl I closed the video. I was like, no, thank you. No, thank you. I didn't realize we just yapping. I didn't realize we making shit up on this documentary. EG still deciding. <laughs> to move towards B, which is the right decision so far in terms of numbers advantage. It so was crazy, play, dude. Down and decides otherwise. Wants to support with a semen instead, and now even deciding that oh. they want to play the retake. A pod with that lurk on the top of the B link. Beautiful Double the average. I don't think an average is actually well known. And here's why. From how they want if, to play that retake, if I set so my frame rate to 60, then I'm going to score an average of 200 to 210 on my monitor. But my monitor is an esports panel. If I use some shitty like random monitor, like my, I've got like a MacBook monitor, I scored like 230. When I set my monitor to 540 hertz, I can score like 170. All those scores are me reacting as fast as possible. <laughs> So I'm pretty sure a large majority of these humans who are scoring 250 on the internet are doing so on their Dell Optiplex computer with their fucking 4x3 monitor they got into the year 2003, which I would score a 250 MS on. Does that make sense? It's not that easy to measure. Nice little play that they don't on defense to confirm how many players were out towards Yeah, I think a ruler side. drop test would be more accurate. Pop lurking once again. They pivot a lot of the defenders back towards B. For EG though, but even then, like, that doesn't measure your reaction speed. It also measures the time it takes you to close your hand. Information looking to be seized. Fault line to support right behind it, and it works out. Superman was stunned from that fall, and allowing QCK to get the kill. And an early advantage for. Yeah. Wow, but look at. Apoth, he walked all the way up. Here's the footsteps. That's why, like, those numbers don't mean anything, dude. Shot. Almost gets wow. that second one onto Sadak. But the numbers don't mean anything. So Execution now towards the B site. I've no never seen a person who is held back up by their reaction speed. There for EG. That's what I'll say. Losing I'm pretty Super sure we're all roughly the same. Yeah. Plus or minus 50 MS. No smokes there. You're forced to just contact which is negligible right compared to all of the other market. like time saves that you're missing in the game. Here. Extra money possibly for the side of EG. There's still time. 20 seconds left. He's got haunt in three. Maybe bait out another tap here. Looks back towards the spawn. Both players have allowed group together. Now there's that haunt from the front. He gets shot right away. The no, quiet oh, coins. That, from left that right. can that measure. Really nice there's two types of reactions. There's biological reactions. And then there's like. Good teamwork. Loud come in. 
play that one I'm making up terms right now. I apologize. I don't know the words. And there's like neurological. A neurological reaction is like when I see green, I will click. So it, you have to like mentally process data. And this will be like 200 MS or whatever. But then there's a biological reaction, which is involuntary. It skips the whole process. And your eyes will protect themselves at like an incredible speed. And keep a pot in a spot that will prevent loud from feeling comfortable on that rotation. Here towards A, we get all the util dumped into main to see what they get back. Countering it back oh. with the Nightfall Hunter Fury on a defense. Kawazin drops the first two of EG, trying to gain control towards the AOR. A third. Every team is reacting to his 500 out, but there's only two milliseconds in the context Nature of choice. <laughs> But that's that so dumb. Because what does that mean? Are we saying the context of choice when we're an expert and the speed of choice matters? Or the context of choice when we're a novice and the speed of choice doesn't matter? Like, what do you mean in the context of choice? Because I can make a decision in Valorant faster than 500 MS. But like if I put my grandma in King Elbow on sunset and I flash her, she's not doing shit. And we'll we'll measure her at five billion MS. Like what do you mean context of choice? And that's sometimes a really thin line to walk. They just seem to have EG's read, considering only to use a paranoia, a few flashes, and still having util to collapse on the team. The firepower too. You can't deny that. Two or more stimuli requiring different responses. That's also bullshit, dude. My over aim drill requires you to move left or right depending on where the bot spawns and silver players after a month of practicing that average 250 ms to react to the bot so saying like a nice formula one driver is different because they react to 200 ms in the context of choice is ridiculous for the communication to allow for him to move up and get in these positions but if he has to come down to a clutch he'll do it as well so we are going to get a timeout. My grandma now. is narrated. <laughs> to one in favor of loud on that defensive side. And you got to figure out what they're looking at. Yeah, you have a loud comp that switches sometimes, but you also have Sadak on his first Sova play. The sources say 120 is fastest so recorded. That sounds like the guy can pre-fire. I'm Sadak not going to lie. A like I can go on human benchmark and pre-fire and score a 50 or whatever eventually. Map and Sova is one of the best at being able Dig to enough people, one of them gets lucky. Yeah, so this is just plays into loud. Categorical stimuli. So well, maybe they should have King said instead of yeah. just saying it's the average reaction speed is like that's how the way they worded it that's on them against g2 where even i think their first timeout was being called at like oh and five on the scoreline then burning the second one just a couple of rounds later to be actually be able to win this in overtime but also i guarantee so you whatever like the reaction is an average person could learn job. to react they roughly to at the same speed within like a month of practice towards the middle when they actually add that pressure on that side getting shut down immediately and consistently towards the A side has been a pain point for EG's execution. So this time out, you're hoping that it's going to be a little bit more. I mean, racing is a whole nother thing, chat. Control. I think racing should is dumb, really area, dumb. There should the just be a countdown. Back to the same game plan. Reaction that, speed should not be a factor in who's faster at running or whatever. Yeah, it's so dumb. Right here. How can we make loud feel uncomfortable? I don't care. Like what if Usain Bolt was 30 milliseconds faster than some guy on foot, but that guy reacted 40 milliseconds faster than Usain Bolt? That guy don't deserve to win. again, fault line sometimes just a cosmetic. Whoever runs faster runs faster, in my opinion. Once again, both initiators for EG. That's actually crazy. Are the remaining players for the roster? A plant is good enough, at least for now. Another kill would be even more, even better, but it's not going to happen. Loud comes in for the defuse, and they take the lead by four. That get the spike down round. We fire super easy. Took me only six attempts to get a thirty. Yeah, exactly. Less does fall, but no guns are retrieved here. Is I know one racer got DQ for reacting too fast. No, that was a false start. And now, EG has a chance. Because the the time limit for that's a hundred MS. People don't react faster than that, dude. It's not just going to be this round. Loud buys next round too. So they're not too bad or uh, bad off right now. Example did not lose the hundred. Bro, no shit. I said if he did. Really contained. We, we did, I didn't state it as fact. Happened, loud figures out. They just gather together and. I'm saying it's dumb that reaction speed is even included in their time.
we should just say how fast they are with these plays pushing up mid getting in their face not with the stupid arbitrary variance of very good corrections one reacting a bit faster or slower you have to expect that look at a little height spot here for cohen zine and market he's using this i was wondering if they would use that it is kind of scary though if you're there for too long somebody's just gonna spam it but neat little trick Loud has with that wall and market to scoot somebody in and back to mid vans yeah i need you want to try it a little bit more this time around the smoke my reaction time is zero ms last. my molecules <laughs> react so instantly to acids that. dude that is so and true in the market it works out flushing out kawadzine punished mm -hmm. by superman rocket is still up to clear the b site both players allowed are at the entrance of b main there's that first pick from less once again good crosshair placement the basics traded out by Derek. But QCK is still accounted exactly for, gets that kill, has a really good Two instant kills onto Apoth and Jogimo. Derek on a one versus two. Thankfully, a hat came out just before, allowing Derek to get ready on this one versus two. Another clutch attempt. But both players walking down slowly, couldn't get the What a round from kill. QCK. Loud. They're looking good on this defense. Stan Silly, if we look at what goes into this round from, from EG, Loud takes it away from them tears the carpet out from under eg the yeah, only way to remove reaction speed is a factor from race to have a rolling start what bro this they fixed this problem with the fucking release of mario kart 64 it goes beep 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 and that's when you go but, and then they get killed by QCK like that. Yeah. After solidifying the strat that has corrected the problem from the first just count the down. What a Set a metronome to, to 120 BPM. The, the Say start running on the, the fifth beat, motherfuckers. Right yeah. Lose position towards the back. You team position towards the front. Exactly. They didn't have B main control like, in it. They were paying for it. Allows for you to play the retakes and now EG. It's a solved problem. Now it's painful in there. Yeah. How well, come an entire orchestra can start playing music at the same time? We can have but five runners around, start running at the same able, time. It's a solved problem. The B -side. This is like, the first like time come on. You could you could take a hundred fucking drummers in a drum line really and they can all whack their snare drum at the same time. So of course, well, just ten runners can start running at the same time. It's a solved problem. Oh, we'll see what happens though <laughs> but for loud it's gonna be a five team retake with the focus on the market an orchestra is incentivized cool, to start to together one. though bro just enforce the though. rules yeah, and so will the runners because if you don't I start at the right time which is now directly measurable back, you're disqualified so we're gonna be dancing around towards this b site a push towards us okay well how could you possibly think this is a flawed idea you're just playing devil's advocate Vansilia, I swear. Boba is their kryptonite. EG could not get past Reaction that time area. variance is good, so it'll be more Loud upsets, more interesting them. races. Bullshit. Um, boo, boo, boo. 100 meter dash Olympics. Past 10 scores. There's no way anybody's running within uh times that were. Here we go. Da, 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 da. I want to see like full scoreboards. Oh, here we go. There's no way. I'm sorry, but their times are not that close together. And They're not finishing within 40 MS of each other. Keeping the momentum from Ice Pox no. rolling, Van Silly. Let, let, let me let me pull it up. It. It's gonna be a big flash through the wall. It's gonna hit Sadak immediately, so he's gonna have to back off. Right, I want to see the full line. leaderboards. Can, can somebody Still grab me this? Uh, I need to watch the game. Sadak's hardly moved. So, somebody grab me like oh, fight this. Yeah, 10 races two, with all of the racers' times on him. So I can time this this idiot out in chat. Just keep EG at bay. Flash. EG's side Thank you, though, Grady. Too much utility on their end, but as we talked about, this B side not being contested too much, it allowed Loud yeah. to even push forward. Yeah, Notice perfect. This is perfect. Really Why is my thing doing this? Okay, here we go. They could actually even pinch towards the mid if they want to. After this round, I'm gonna defend yeah. timing out pre crumb pre Q trumble for literally just making shit up. For no point for no point. Other than playing like an annoying devil's advocate. Like there is no world you can possibly defend it other than its tradition. That's the only defense for it. And it's a dumb defense, and, and people will hide behind it. They'll say it's tradition to react. 
the amount of space that loud has given them. 30 seconds left. You even get a safe plant. Might have to maintain and stay within the site now for EG. Two versus five, and you know, money's flowing for loud. I want to go for these fights. Caught with a snake bite in hand. This is unwinnable. Less falls as only one smoke. Trade on Tajagimo as Tui's now moves in alone. Smoke available. Yeah. Gets the dink through the wall. But All right, let's take a look. EG for the rest. Swinging out, and they finally score their second round. That's a hundred MS difference. For EG, they have a long way to go for ultimates to really <laughs> be able to cycle. <laughs> oh wait, these are different heats. Really okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. These aren't even in the same heat. Still got money. They're still wait, we'll check how do I sort by heat? Play. Beautiful shots here from Evil Geniuses. Slowing no, down, this isn't what I want. I want to show like all the times in one heat. And, and then and all times in another so heat. Big. I think Loud's been able to do everything just like, I want isolated heats. Bro, why is my thing doing that? Has had free movement. Maybe make them rethink how they get from site to site now. Single heat, not a large sample size though. Yeah, I want multiple heats, of course, but I don't want... Like, if you take all the times at the Olympics and slap them on a chart and order them, then yes, some of them will be really close. But if you take a bunch of heats and you just look at those times, heat by heat, the, the variance is going to be a lot wider on average. Oh, here they go. They're fighting for it. And this time, Boba is not their demise. A trade off. Super you know me? The top, easy kill. And that wide it's variance is specifically what I'm looking to point out. As we talk about it being a little bit easier to hold the pulse plans, because yeah. Kalanzin this time does not have a rolling thunder to work with, so they couldn't flood as much. But even I the Mario Kart scenario, right you still have to react to the sound, even if it's nominal. Bro, match, which is why I changed my analogy to the to orchestra. Why can a hundred musicians all start playing fight, music at the same time? Because you, you need, of course, you need a faster yeah, countdown because Mario Kart's king thing is like 40 BPM, matters, which is too slow. You can't keep up a rhythm at 40 BPM in your head. But like, I digress. It's obviously a solved problem. So really trying to attack this okay here we go this is a lot of data i don't want a lot of data i want individual heats work with on the other side of the strat and that was having a in market this time and remember they all started in b main right that had reaction time 108 is that cannot be real get their asap push down mid yeah a rare push from loud not happy with so many rounds that eg has done to set up for mid control to start Somehow loud finds the perfect timing to push down towards mid in round number eleven. I guess it is actually it can be because it's auditory. Nonetheless, though, never mind. Yeah, auditory open. reaction speed can, can be that fast. QCK hits a shot and you get to run it back. They have to prevent the Phoenix ultimate here. Already down, trying to hold it with four in sight. Oh, this is annoying. Look at all that. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> and they just got put in the meat grinder. Still players flooding across. Shock darts coming through from the spawn site to still hit players down for EG. Derek again. Light travels faster than sound. Bro, you're so right. You're so right. So the runners line up like this. And the gun fires from over here. Which means this dumbass at the end has a huge disadvantage in reaction speed. Because the speed of sound is so slow. This guy over here gets such an edge. This is actually what they kind of wanted to do on Ascent A take, right? That EG was preventing. We're seeing milliseconds matter, chat. Milliseconds matter. That flooded that default. That's what you guys sound like. Almost feels like EG probably could have started typing in <laughs> team mode. That's a lot of utility to play against. All right. Uh, last round of the half now. A fight towards the B main. They put speakers at their feet. Back, <laughs> That's even worse. Guess how QCK. long it takes the yeah, data to travel. Like the, the audio wave data has to travel through the cabling His to the speakers. To What's the resistance the on those wires? What's the impedance on the speakers? Wants to give him that respect because it's QCK with Are they the wired in parallel or series? Works out for a bit though. EG still holding their ground at the bottom of the mid. <laughs> also, I think uh, at that point, at this point, we're gonna have to talk we'll about the how close to the equator we are. That That's gonna affect the the, ma to, uh, the magnetism oh, no, at play. So and those alive. magnetic waves might Attached cause very minor deviations in the speed of the data transfer through the cable. 
I haven't milliseconds seen that in a very long matters. Time. I haven't seen that in so long. What a, he what a heady thought. Like I said, it's milliseconds that's going to decide this one. <laughs> there they go. There they fucking like go. That. I hate Fast that statement. What is up with the timing? The, the caster just said it's milliseconds. That is my least favorite statement. You can't just defend all arbitrary talk of time advantage with milliseconds matter. You can't just hide. If he wants to rip you know what? Fuck it. Bet. Fury, Milliseconds matter. Oh, Superman turning twice to throw that smoke. Starts with a one way. That's gonna come to time here. come to bite. It it's a little oh, inefficient. At least they don't get the stun there, so that might give a chance for a Milliseconds Darius matter. That beam. And the aftershock comes out a little bit too late. Nature in a forward position all the way towards the spawn. Cancel TP. A flash. It oh. gets cancelled by Nature, but he couldn't line up the other kills here with the Vandal. No old banks coming through. Superman and Derek. The Vietnamese duo with Derek with the first kill on to less. Hey, can Derek win this? Some information. Doubling up the fight back towards the A site. The oh. line up on two. It's a 1v1. Right. Him and QCK. Eight bullets left. This break comes across. Yeah, he can. Yeah, he can. I saw it. I saw it. You know why he won that? The double turn. The double turn during the smoke. Milliseconds matter. Are you saying these setups and rollouts are frame perfect? I am. Ooh. QCK from shop. The rest of the shots we saw absolutely incredible stuff and awareness coming out of EG's Derek to win this round. Derek is back, baby. Win this <laughs> round, but still far away of trying to tie up the game. Yeah, you, you needed some heroic plays. Stay to come two through. meters away from a person, then gravity for you and this person is different. Today, means the race is not fair. That's true. Future. So let's have a listen. Actually, every single entity with mass has a gravitational oh, I mean, force. A successful for sure, we qualify. That's like the biggest thing. Uh, I think that we have the tools to do it. We've shown that we've had the tools to come back. Stuff okay. like that. We start hot. This is an easy qualification for us. But other than that, easy. Uh, just show our hearts out, you know, like this is only the start of the year. There's a lot of progress to be made for a team that has four new players. Every lane for the gunshot so, adds 3.5 milliseconds to your action time. Really, lane really eight, good, that's 28 milliseconds. Wait, really? It's 28? That's a big enough number that people who think milliseconds matter, air quoting, would think that that's a significant disadvantage. 28 ms there's no way it's that slow right the speed of sound is way faster than that no one sec speed of sound do, do, do. 343 meters per no you're way wrong you're way wrong your math is off by a factor of 10. mentioning that it For didn't sure. really matter too much that they had less time to practice <laughs> because they had more time as well to be able to see other teams play and adapt to that things are 1.2 meters wide yeah then it should be 2.8 milliseconds not 28 and the fun and the vibes definitely were shown here right. on that Derek clutch in that last round of the half an opportunity now for eg to bring it back here on the defense but again it took a lot of big heroic plays for eg to get it to the score yes yeah it seems drilled and well protocoled to potentially take the series so far in professional sports you'll never see the, the loud viper wall i saw it it went like this half time i'd say a 4k from derek is one to get the blood flowing for evil geniuses here and we're back now into the second i made a mental note final map here masters madrid on the line eg loud eg down now as the map continues to rotate around, I thought it was pretty great. For EG to cool. Loud's just trying to delay so that this double. You trying to talk about Valorant so at my oh. Olympics racing oh. reaction oh. speed stream? Here, watch yourself. Oh my! The flood back towards the spawn to give EG an advantage, but the plant still comes down. It's gonna be flank after flank again. Sadak from the backside. Frenzy took a bit, but Nature's from the spawn. Trades it right back. They also have information on QCK out towards the spawn. So Les is alone. A 1v1 in this corner. Wins that second Les one. Les is so spot. good. And turns it around for Loud once again. Eight Nature at 8 HP. At the shot to try to clear QCK Would back. you give one year of your life, Stan, to become a radiant level player? 
The tap on that spike Can I give more? A, and less. Like I said, man, when he needs to step out to the plate, when he needs to come up huge, he definitely will, and especially with that 4K. Yeah. But ghost there, operator before, it doesn't matter. Give this uh, I'll give 20 years, down. but I want to literally shots. have human wall hacks. Chase to ease all the way back to spawn. I, I want to biologically sense habits. my enemies through the walls. Seeing that hot hands come over the wall makes you deal or no deal. How many walls hot hands can go over? It's pretty low ceiling to the walls on sunset, or you have windows to throw stuff through. So QCK have a field day around here trying to find places to line those up. Twenty is crazy. Three again, push for Bro, but I can sense them through walls. Just on the other side of that smoke. A lot of the times we saw super. Would you go pro with that? I don't know. Pro Valorant is a game of milliseconds, and my reaction speed's pretty slow. I think even if I could see through walls, I might struggle in the duels against Demon One. It is a game of milliseconds after all. As you can see, these three players working out towards that B side. Good way to counter a judge in the smoke. Now a drone that could come through flashes in the smoke pulse range, flashes long that goes behind the wall too. Won't really allow EG to get good positioning here on their lurk plays or mm -hmm. the sneaky plays from Superman with this judge, but we'll have to see. In the later rounds now, as Loud gets the plant in round number 14, EG full classic mode. Might be those situations What's Peeker's like advantage in milliseconds? It depends on your ping and their ping, and no, it doesn't really matter. But there is a thing that there is holder's disadvantage, which directly scales with your ping. When your ping is honestly like above 20, you don't want to be stationary holding without like an operator or a judge at all. You should be moving. Because your holder's disadvantage will be too gargantuan. He understood the flanker though. After shot then comes out. Just got here five milliseconds ago. Apologies if you've answered this already. Would you say it's a game of milliseconds each? Honestly, milliseconds might not be a small enough denomination to talk about Valorant. Dare I say Valorant's a game of nanoseconds? Solidified now by that side of evil geniuses. Can they get the bonus is the question. It almost feels necessary. With if two players down, click at roughly the same millisecond, who wins the duel? Play their game. Milliseconds aren't accurate enough. EG has to keep the momentum here, and they do carry Derek's 4K for that last round of the first half now into round or the second half. Really, these 128 tick servers are too slow for high level Valorant. At the LAN, I propose that they play on one. 128,000 tick servers so that we can properly experience nanosecond accuracy in our Valorant match. Because right now, the faster player can lose a duel. If player one clicks after a mere 50,000 nanoseconds and player two is a, a boorishly slow 50,000 and two, then it's almost a, a coin flip as to which player wins the duel on a 128 tick server. That's a great point. Getting those ultimates, being able to flex loud off the site just by pressing R. And Jogamo honestly just holding these positions. Only 128,000? You're right. We could go higher. I mean, how many CPU cycles? And that's what makes it look so good. I mean, Can we get it are, to a point? Uh, we we need to make a right CPU designed to host Valorant the servers. Just, is hard. just like we have the, the move processor instruction, we need the Val processor instruction. You call it like this. Because we, we need to be operating on a hardware level here. How how fast can a like a Intel chip get run right like now? 5.4 gigahertz? How many how many like operations at a low level can it run per second? Because the server code is like so many wasted operations. We need dedicated CPUs. He's good for those three. Transistors oh, yeah. manually linked Spike to run Valorant server code spot. logic. Less trying to squeeze through now towards the left side of Derek is a hero. He's being spotted now by nature. 
taunt being thrown out. And he reveals team. both. Decide to fall back and not want to play the power of numbers again. Four versus two. Three point two billion cycles per second. That would probably be a decent target for like a version one. Shouldn't happen. But that's and definitely that's not Derek fast enough. From loud, but Derek being able to place three shots like that without timing to get left. swung. Because there still could be a world where a player technically clicks faster than another out of the hat that they need to right and they lose the fight. Beautiful stuff from in fact, that will always However, exist until Valorant out. becomes exactly. analog. That space and that respect, Digital systems are incapable of capturing data purely. The Valorant servers at LAN need to be an analog system, which process the data in real time as it comes in. jungle gym how do you play that to catch superman off guard who's actually been having a rougher game than usual superman was him the past few games we see but loud is not allowing that to happen in the 1v1 1v2 situations they are that so is so sad for derek that is so sad to lock it down five avatar they were the six month tier three We'll get back into it a lot loud. Make it real life, no delay. That's what analog so is. Evil geniuses, the money gets analog really systems are zero latency. Back onto stingers, back onto a low buy. Back to the basics. That's a camera track play. And you see how loud answers back to it. A wall comes these goofy digital systems that are and ruining things. Denied. So full line paranoia. All well done here by loud towards the end. Superman trying to catch a timing off the speed of light is finite. Yeah, we're limited by the speed of light. Also map and series point. Madrid in the sights. It's kind of annoying. We'll never know who's truly the best. Not even needed. Derek falls wow. But I'm down to We'll just use cables as short as possible and call it a day. A strong first half on the defensive side has set them up to have this not relaxed second half. But one where they can stretch themselves, they can push. Pooch, I they challenge you to a battle of rock, paper, scissors. Really if I win, you have to stop talking about milliseconds. I moved on from milliseconds a while ago. We've been on nanoseconds so for at least right the past five right nanoseconds. Slay! Thank you for the tier three. Find EG and let's bring the fight to him right now in Util Dump. It's really working out. So EG is pressured. Uh, from a few sites, they're trying Chat, to how about instead of increasing the tick rate, we decrease the tick rate to make it more unfair. Rounds, I like where you're thinking. Loud is waiting so we play on that two tick EG servers, usually results two ticks a second. A defensive positioning, holding other angles. With the gunfights are practically a coin flip every time. Now, should we implement them like old school RuneScape, so where whoever logs onto the server with better player ID just wins every time? Or should we do a a coin flip each fight kind of constructs a little bit better of a and which random stop, algorithm stop should we pushing, use that mid control has been tough to get we see lineups from fault lines ready on it i think everybody knows it's going to be a trap once you get in there so we have been avoiding it for now let's see how they play this one again towards b main to start us off is eg they actually they're not really in a setup position right now but they are going to be lurking it looks like to be a little bit pushed up on b main here it comes down now whoever has more followers on twitter wins the gunfight <laughs> that is what the people would want tens would be on top the calls have to be good the confidence has to come back and that's superman moving out towards that billboard in the front of b all of loud continue to play very passively towards back yeah. because of this type of play style that eg has been doing with this someone's reaction time is fast enough they can change their rock paper scissors choice right as their opponent shows theirs not if their opponent has faster reaction time and they see you changing yours and they change theirs even Derek left his teammate just to clear out middle to make sure trying to leverage now the nightfall potentially for what if it turns out the speed of light isn't the same in both directions that is a real problem that's unsolvable with our current understanding of physics speed of light could be three times faster in one direction and three times slower in another which would give an advantage to the players who are sitting facing in the direction of to make it the faster light, right? But if Loud could win a two versus four, potentially EG Because if they both clicked at the same instance, yeah, the data would return to them slower. A 
but purely based off of them clicking at the same exact instance in time they'd have an advantage louder going to madrid We should start talking about muscle memory and sense. <laughs> You're right. Muscle memory does not get brought up enough. I changed my mouse the other day and I lost 5,000 RR because the mouse weighs seven grams less. And so now my flicks, which were perfectly hammered into my brain and muscle memory all need to be adjusted. And then it did look like it got to the outlier that sunset we go back to and loud really good at the lurks finding some in non tier threes it was lovely talking not valorant with you until next time we're getting ready for nrg versus sentinels the team the way the team works as well in their 1v1s and the fact that they keep bringing this composition back that's almost a universal composition of agents with just a few changes they've almost found the golden goose with the updates that's been happening we had question marks of what the meta could be looking at when you're kicking things off just for the vcts across all regions sometimes some are saying it's double controller some are saying it's double initiator or for loud why not double controller? i on average lose my bets so if i bet on nrg then we'll win it depends on how much you bet on nrg if to bet enough that the universe wants to punish you you bet eight hundred thousand. How did you pick this number? How did you? 818,405? Oh, now what? You're at exactly 5 million or something? Damn, the Sentinels pay us 192x right now. Not bad. I think one of the things that separates loud as well is once they get on that defensive side their decision making becomes so incredible we see them again understand I have 100 percent win rate on predictions should I bet on sentinels or NRG bet on draw I want to see a draw happen protocols makes loud one of the strongest teams and they remain one of the strongest teams yeah. right now congratulations to them especially when you're looking at how that team has played from and the question marks that we can you add the draw option i mean i'm down for you to commit to betting on draw right now and i'll take the points away from you if you lose i will give you five million x payout on draw you can wager as many points as you want with that payout I put 10k uh, loud to like a like a very hard 10,000 so like, like, sure. like, oh so if like there's a draw you get came out with a great strap book against the <laughs> 50 billion they have knowledge on that team and that is a team that is nowhere near All right, the that. ceiling so it's going to be really awesome that. to see how far yeah. they go up so as you mentioned it we have a big congratulations to loud commiserations for eg but let's throw it down to the stage where it's mixed can i take hoots box away basic lethargy thank you for the tier three thank you very much fans standing here with the victor uh, Zine, congratulations how do you what give people hoots box that you have had it all started with a give points Sentinels, robin wobber can you how many points do you have over the 2023 world champs and evil can i give you negative 10,000 i want to find out going to masters madrid tell us what's going through your head you have no i need to know the exact number i'm going to give you negative 10,000 2 a 1 na leviathan agora 2 a 1 na eg os campeões do mundo e vocês estão indo para madrid como é fala um pouco pra gente cara o sentimento de ir para madrid é muito bom okay now how many do you have em 2023 <laughs> yeah, we've been to Madrid. It's very, uh, we're very excited for it. We've been there for the boot camp. We love the country. <laughs> it worked. All right, your 10,000 has been Crazy wagered. Your 10,000 has been wagered. The, if it's a draw, I will give you 50 billion huge bucks. And then luckily on that third map, on the side, we saw you guys able to close it out. <laughs> in simple fashion so talk to us about what was going through your head as
as you walk through all yeah you used to be able to bet negative numbers corporal corn and i had to remove that <laughs> As a tier three for the whole server? Well, you can't use that on other people. Does a game delay or cancellation count? No, it has to be a draw. A delay would not be a, a draw. They would still play. Yeah, for Accent, we didn't have a lot of material on them, a lot of info, so they they did a, a very good map against us. But keep in mind, chat, Robin Wobbin has uh, never lost a wager uh, with huge bucks. G2, I believe, so we, we had uh, some material on them. No, we definitely saw that. And last question before I let you go, we were able to speak with Sadak and get his Which means that this game might be a draw. To the team. He really loves the flexibility that he's able to bring. From your perspective, what is what is Said the car, why are you putting more on NRG? <laughs> the more I bet, the more likely Sen win. <laughs> not true. In fact, the more you bet on NRG. Okay, so there's two types of wagers. Watch, I'm gonna blow your minds, Endercar. Okay. So we have Gambler A. Always wrong. Okay. And we have Gambler B. Always right. So this is like Robin Wobbin. And A is like you. And then we have Gambler C. Sometimes either either. 50 50. Okay. When you, the always wrong gambler, bet on NRG, it's because you're statistically trying to make Sentinels win, right? But you should bet a low number of points. You know why? When you bet 2 million points, all of the other type A gamblers will now tend to bet on Sentinels. And when you have two type A gamblers on NRG and three type A gamblers on Sentinels, all else equal, then NRG will win because three type A gamblers are going to be wrong more often than two. Now, that's only all else equal. Of course, if we have a, a type B gambler over here, now all of a sudden it's a 50-50. You see, the B's counteract an A on the other side. Does that make sense? So the outcome of this match is based off of all of the gamblers out there gambling on this match. You gotta, it's you just win. add them up, subtract them up, and whichever side is should win will win. That's how an upset happens. Too many type A gamblers on one side. Does draw mean OT? No, draw means draw. I would need to see a 0 0.5 and a 0 0.5 right here. After map one. <laughs> That's a draw. If you've ever played chess, you're familiar. Moonvade01, thank you for the prime. Yeah, if it goes 100 100, I'll consider that a draw. <laughs> if the server crashes because it's been going too long, I will count that. I will count that. Just because that's gas. And then Robin Wobbin can do her 500 hour stream or something on my channel with her 50 billion who's box. Use if the venue explodes, do I also win? I'm going to have to say no because I'm afraid of what you might try to do to the venue if I say yes.
Oh, Vendy's here for the Sentinels match. What's up, Vendy? Who are you rooting for? NRG? Aren't any VCT rules in the rule book outlining draws? <laughs> it's because you can't even you can't even vote for them in a tournament server. Like it doesn't happen. Who's the rewards are so expensive? Thank you. champions tour america's kickoff playoff say that five times fast not difficult to say at all you, you said, said it fast slow once. okay welcome back to the valor <laughs> champions tour america's kickoff playoffs that's really Wait, bad he you. screwed up the first time right. welcome back it's a second qualification match guys Madrid. no let's let's actually set this all right who's gonna win gonna be an excellent sentinels or shack we we're already sending one team to Madrid, congratulations to Loud. And uh, you know, I think when, when when you think of teams that should be at international, it's Loud always pops up and in the mind. Every other team you think of isn't there. Yeah, <laughs> kind of wild. Where's Fnatic? Not there. Loud have nothing no, to not worry about. No no not not there. It's crazy, but hey, you know, Loud showing that uh, Father Time ain't their opponent today. They managed to hold on, and they are moving on. To Sentinels got no go celeb power against Shaq, bro. That's what I'm saying. And also Shaq is big. You Have you guys ever seen Shaq? Tickets for VCT Masters Madrid is Shaq is QR big. Code. Pop up here on the screen. What are you gonna do against that? It's big. big. Quite massive. It takes up the whole screen. So go ahead, scan that bad boy, and you will be good to He's go. He's big, go man. Go and cheer on your favorite squads from Americas. Heck, maybe from EMEA, from Pacific, from China. Don't really matter. We just want you there with us. Scan that QR code today. We know the Spanish fans are gonna be loud. Dude, yeah, because he's so big, his ears are closer to the the gun when it fires for the 100 meter dash because his ears are closer he gets to react faster but hey you know that's a conversation for another day in any case so guys uh we have two teams that will definitely need to brush up on their spanish if they pick up a dub here today let's go ahead and get into this matchup we have our play-ins win i'm flipping the script on you guys when you start talking about like hardware or whatever i'm just gonna start talking about reaction speed I i'm gonna be the annoying one and you're gonna have to get me back on topic. Get silly is because they dismantled MIVR to yeah. open it up, right? That first series on today set the tone for everything. Can we but time you out, Huge? I'm down. You know, uh, How long you want to time me out for? for them to win. And Sentinels just had a fantastic it's map. So drill. Yeah. No. And and honestly, I, in I milliseconds, like the, the, the Sentinels we are now currently seeing is that right? They clearly put in the time in the offseason. They had one the minute, five minute, five minute, from their very minute large, large number of milliseconds. They are so so together. It's the first time this. You guys need like to present a unified like front. Literally three years. It's yeah. been a long time running for Sentinels fans. But the disadvantage of getting to see all that. If you all agree on a number, I'll do it. Is that they have had to play yep. a lot. They've already played film. more rounds this I can fly yep think of the six month prime combined which is absolutely ridiculous and is gonna make it I think pretty hard here going up against a team like NRG you can also play double so heavy and say that you know they're they're mods run a poll go ahead pull it and then yeah other teams are gonna counter against it maybe yeah. that's a little devil's advocate you that's play? the counter offer is what just happened last series ah. loud had their funny ascent comp that eg came in with bod on you guys are gonna give me a break it, and ah. loud came in against the eg silly icebox comp and owned that 2 13 7 so sentinels do absolutely. have more yes, rounds played games, and that is uh, fantastic as a team that has to be an advantage right to watch those games oh boy they are coming in ready 
the thing is there's two goals there's a none of these are in milliseconds you can for the season when it really matters when you can make it deeper make it to champions marathon, not a sprint. The year. but also this tournament i dare you guys to vote one hour i dare you a few matches i mean eg if they i dare you see what happens and, I mean, here goes Sensen, try me just making it work thanks for the tier <laughs> so good with the counter stress and chet as well from the the core of this NRG squad they never disappoint in that regard yeah i yeah. I, am, I am thrilled when these two teams finally get to take the stage in fact we've had a lot of really good moments uh, throughout this competition. actually this one hour from, uh, from coach kaplan he was uh, talking to the team during halftime while they were down let's go ahead and take a listen great this i see yeah. this happen all the time in these late series where you're you know we're the one coming in they're yeah. already warm but they're tired we're rested yeah. up, and it takes a little bit to shift into gear. Just don't lose confidence. Don't look at that four and think about it. So much of coaching is not just the, you know, coming up with the pocket picks or the strategies. A lot of it is literally what you heard right there. It's it's digging players' mental from the trenches and trying to like lift them up in moments where they're the most down ender. Yeah, there's the two different games. There is the on the day you have to be able to lift them up, but the pre-work in the week, that's what shined in this series. You can see it in a retake like this, how perfect the utility was drawn up to go back in there. If you saw that from top down, there was nowhere that you could possibly yeah. have played on that site and not been destroyed. And Sentinels also showed two different retakes the first one was full flood from shop this is a full flood from ct both of them equally destructive there's a big difference between what sentinels and nrg have shown nrg has been playing really default comps the old ascent comp that everyone plays even on sunset they're still running solo sky yeah. what i've been focused on more for them is how the synergy is working how the mid rounding is working sentinels through other games have already proved how good those fundamentals are and what they're starting to show us now is that deep in this tournament they have new ideas new prep and are actually willing to take some risks and be ahead of the curve on the meta i yeah. think that's the best comp you can play on sunset and i think they implemented it beautifully this is a sentinels that doesn't just have those fundamentals but also has these creative compositions yeah. and the question today is if we're going to see more of that or if that was just something special for sunset well honestly you know with this squad you don't i mean anything can be possible here but one thing that i do feel quite confident in us discussing is is zekin's prowess on the server so because he is having some Damn good games. And Ender, I, I think it goes as far as to say that, like, this is the best that we have seen Zek in. Oh, yeah. He was already fantastic last year. No, the guy was an absolute monster. And specifically, like, it's not just funny big numbers, haha. -ha. First in kills per round. Yeah. First it's in damage per numbers. round. That's against exactly. every other duelist playing in America. Yes. And there are some amazing players here that we have already seen showcase. This guy is still a young player, but he has experience at this point. He's been in tier one for at least three, nearly four years now, and is just constantly leveling up it feels unreasonable how how much better he looks every tournament he plays oh yeah and like i uh, in the sentinels dismantling mibr he was the factor almost he had almost two kills for every death he had in server in that series that's what the 2-0 was about yeah, and, and I think when you look at Zekin's overall just, like, impact on the team, he's only going to continue to contribute like this. I mean, he's on a great path here, and it's going to be a tall order for their opponents to have to stop. And, well, that actually brings us over to their opponents because you got NRG now. And what's fascinating is Sentinels, you know, they really needed to just push their way through round after round, match after match. NRG, well, you know, they did it in four. They're vibing. <laughs> they get to remain an enigma because yeah. they also – didn't play really the new stuff. Three of their four maps were Breeze and Ascent. I just feel like that's such a bad thing, though, yes. in my mind. I don't know why but I'm just is worried. Is it a bad thing, uh, though, ooh. Because there is still time, right? They had a, yeah. they've had, a, across this tournament, you kind of have like two weeks where you're not playing during the week, where you're yeah. practicing, prepping, coming that's up fair. with That's new perfectly things. fair. For me, I think it is a, a distinct advantage to have played less, especially for a team like this, where I have no worries about them really needing stage time with the experience you see on those five phases behind. Us. Yeah, ultimately, they have shown in their four games they are the best at playing boring Valor, the 2023 <laughs> Valor. Yes. Yeah. But, like, that is the superpower because we don't know what their read on the current meta is. Are they playing old stuff because they don't need to tap into new ideas? Yeah. Are they playing it because it's comfortable because the sky patch came in pretty close to, to the league starting? Have they made any changes from then until now? 
Sentinels have no way of knowing. That's How true. are we supposed to know? The only ones that know are NRG, and until they're forced to show something, yeah. we're not going to know. Yeah, yeah, and if you're yeah. playing boring 2023 Valorant, the player you want is the best player of 2023. Demon won. Yeah. He's picked up his performance from last year and just continued it here into kickoff. The guy has been lights out on the jet. What I'd love to see is that it seems like his teammates every round buy off Demon 1, yeah. buy off Demon yeah. 1. He, he's using it so much more, 26% more than he used it last year already. And that's because co compared to with Potter when sometimes he had to play the silly smoke. Hey, get role, on Astra. Hey, get on Astra. And NRG only, like, I don't think they've unlocked any agents yeah. in the client apart from Jet. The man is playing Jet on every map and again, Breeze and Ascent obviously it's plays it. It's just fascinating. This is the same playbook from yeah. years prior. But a, a Sunset is very unique because no one else is really playing Jet on them. You're always like seeing Rage. Team, yeah. You're seeing no well, die. Yeah. He is still well, going for that well. Jet. Having a huge impact with the fights he's able to take. Well, and again, look who's back. As much as he possibly can. It's going to be by a pure democracy. Navigates this, or whether or not he doesn't need to. His team is just like, I do whatever you need to. Tier <laughs> three jail the until game. the uh, game course, starts. Though, when you think about this squad and what they're going to need. Uh, Once well, the game starts, we will switch it back. Out there. You got Ethan, who is again just continuing to show why he is who he is, why he is him. You can't He's run so Discord good. polls while you're yeah, timed out. That's where you're wrong, Pen Flash. I have two yeah, Discord accounts. Quite successful playing that older you can't style. time out both of them. That's exactly what this guy Look, brings. The calls this, this is who you timed game. out. His synergy with Demon and one this is my excellent. other Discord account. He's playing KO, where Demon 1 seems to have a perfect flash to set him up every single round. It's beautiful to watch. This duo is one of the big reasons why NRG is so strong right simple. Too simple. Yeah. Uh, again, because they have focused on things that have been so static for so long, they get to be really. I mean, there was a world where Twitch Anyways, chat just votes uh, no, and I just have to shut up for a whole hour of Sentinels versus NRG, though. I would have done it. I would have done it. If chat voted no, I would have done it. It would have sucked. really making it into these international tournaments the core of this but NRG you got to commit to the bit has been to pretty much every single one they have fourth place they have first place they're always on top this is a chance for sentinels to break that streak. let's see if this happens folks the teams are ready to go and let's see oh the teams are ready to go let's take a look tier three jail is already gonna end hey guys welcome to map pick ben. oh not yet not uh, yet since nrg is our group winner not yet pick, uh, team, they're gonna pick so ben and they opted to pick team b don't worry the tier b's don't get to come back till the game literally game. starts Sentinels ban Breeze and then Archie, your map ban? Uh, we're gonna ban Bind. Then and they get to come back. Bind and Sentinel, your map pick? Pick Sunset. Sunset. Ooh. And Archie, your side? Pick Sunset? Uh, we'll take defense. And Archie picks defense and your map pick? Uh, we'll go for Ascent. And Archie picks Ascent and Sentinel, so your side? Defense. Sentinels pick defense and your map ban? Yeah, we'll ban Icebox. Sentinels ban Icebox and Archie, your map ban? Also, you guys acted like he always wears a kilt. He's wearing normal pants. When I pointed out the kilt, you guys were all like, yeah, he always wears a kilt. Who's that's okay. normal? You gaslighters. You gaslighters. Sentinels split, but defense. Oh, split, sorry. Oops. By the bundle, by the way. <laughs> by our bundle. Oh, you said defense, right? Yeah. Cut. All right, good luck, have fun, guys. Those are pants. I know, I know my leg wear. Those are pants. Now, if I want them to win, do I cheer or does that curse them? Oh, fuck, it's too late now. Did I do the right thing? I don't know. I gotta I got prep the twist chat. Uh, ignore these Google searches. You guys just had to be there for the first series. Those are very relevant for the Loud vs. EG series. Had to be there. Had to be there.
And now, their opponents for this NA showdown. Give them your energy! Now, do I want to cheer for them because I don't want them to win and that could curse them? Or should I stay? Oh, it's probably too late now, isn't it? Well, who's you use Twitch chat to regain your power? Then you immediately turn them off. That's right. Like a true devious IGL, I use even my own teammates to my advantage. Saludus, thank you for the prime. In my defense, Pen Flash, I diluted the yes the votes intentionally. There were two the yes options and, and one no option. North American teams to fill that spot. Will it be Sentinels or will it be NRG? And make sure that you guys poll was biased to keep me timed out, and they still voted to save me. Awesome confrontation. It is going to be good. And with EG's loss just moments ago, there are only two players. We'll ignore that one of the options EG was far more exciting than the others. That is and anybody who mentions that will be quickly and swiftly Sentinels, dealt with. They have a chance to do something their organization hasn't been able to achieve outside of auto qualified events in three years. It has been a long time yeah. since this team has representation. <laughs> what do you how do you think you would write out this song like if you're writing english like a deaf person's watching stream right now can you guys sing this song in chat for that deaf person this is going to be the tournament where the old dogs are gone it has been upset after upset if energy could make it here again deny second a shot at an international tournament they would be a real contender for the title honestly is it buzz or does? Which is first game on this map and looking so lose a single round on their Hard to say. I'm really hearing the B sound. Thank you, Gray, for your input. Just one birthday. We have two Let me too. Ethan and Zelsis on opposite two sides of the birthdays field, today. Together. Someone's gonna get a really nice birthday gift today. <laughs> yeah, but only one person. Yeah. The other one, Hands in chat if it's your I birthday. I hope that they Nobody lie. This game. <laughs> Nobody lie. Hands in chat. Now it is far too late. If Let's it's your birthday. On this map, though. Last time energy played the old style. They had a sky. They not had me. A jet. That was not me. Nope. I not me. Not me. Three days. I think it gives you uh -uh. To fight for a main. Nobody has a birthday today. Holy shit. Having high impact with the op. And I think that Sentinels comp would match up really well. Wow. Unless they're changing it up. Some yeah. Wait, this I, is I, statistically. I Impossible. To the tried and true. It has to be somebody's birthday today. This jet, against the <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Is you can sort of play outside of yeah. space and peek back into it with a dash to then escape. Sure. So I think if nobody is playing around that, it's March second. Before pouncing, that is his chance to now disrupt the This makes no sense. Have to figure out how to solve the post plant here. Remember, birthday people aren't watching. What? What are you insinuating? Are you saying that? On your birthday, you'd rather be doing something else? Fine. Fine. I... Fine. Fine. Thank you so much, GBJ. Fine. Legends are made in May moments like Maybe this, that is why there's no birthday boys here. Spot up for grab at, the, at the international stage. This is what Valorant is all about. Fine. Yeah, and Sentinels has been trying so hard as the desk was saying to get to an international land in general other than the ones that they're already invited to yeah so a lot on the line on my birthday i'll be drinking red bull and playing the jimmy lynn playlist all right we're starting we're starting you're buying on tier threes thank you for saving me see you on map three yeah this is a roster everyone was excited about when the off season hit and we found out that these moves are happening that ethan and demon one were heading over everyone went nuts and there were a lot of questions about hello tier threes 
who's going to be the leader, who's going to be the caller. They've gotten to this point in the tournament again. Who's going to let you know it's my birthday? Thanks, Frank. From and I'll make sure not to stage, say happy birthday. So much. And we'll maintain our perfectly healthy, non-social relationship. Into the jet combo on the other side. NRG already aggressive. The flash is out. The swing is there too. But second with the classic punches back. Whoa. One hot dog per long-standing member. I'm gonna need an official definition of long-standing member, Penflash. Going two for O. Because that's a hefty price. Evening things up for each other. I think there have been a, a lot of conversation right around six months plus is way too many hot dogs. Nuts. He's goaded. He continues to impress and continue to improve. But I think there's been this question. Now, now that the lights are at their brightest, now that the stage twelve is months. The biggest, how can how many twelve months are there? Yeah, so far so good exactly and demon one, also i'd have to no it's too hard because i have to paypal like individuals and honestly yeah. out, out one v one it's way too annoying way too annoying so far mm -hmm. but zekin he's been putting his head down putting the work in for years to get to this point and it looks like this a site will be free a little bit of a retake from nrg and this is what we saw a lot okay sentinel take in sight 30 seconds left retake focus setups Demon one sitting very healthy after those after that confrontation. Yeah, like I can't just hand out two hundred hot dogs. That's over a thousand dollars worth of hot dogs, and also just like getting that money in the hands of two hundred people is a full-time job. Nah. Nah. And second puts four up for the for Sentinels on the round, but gosh, he's just sticking the bomb. And how many times have we seen this energy roster do this? They just stick the bomb. Ah, bro, so what? Much faith in their team. Is this what we're in for? B. Already. It's been one round already. <laughs> They got pushed so far into elbow, they had to spit at their feet. They contest the diffuse and <laughs> no. It just wasn't enough. Look at Ethan. He's like, "Oh, you gonna give that to us? Big mistake, huh? Big mistake out of Sentinels there." I mean, you'd kill to have that one back, but there's no time to think it over. Okay. They've oh, invested. Yeah, they've invested into the round. You're right. Stingers and then a share for Sasi. Once again, wanting to return to the scene of the crime, investing and turning their eyes over towards A. Marv close by, though. It looked like they wanted to flood there, but something made Marv call that off. Yeah, I think oh, twice no. about it. A shot. And speak of the devil, the demon is here. Already getting two on the round, pushing the pace and dashing forward. Demon one's like, all right, you guys want to go to land? Check it now, right? Surely you don't fall for that again. Demon one holding the line, or at least trying to. Ethan one, or excuse me, Ethan sticking the diffuse, and that's another one for NRG. Honestly, decent damage for Sentinels. The bomb down. They have to check. I would take that. Oh, absolutely. Ever since the first three kills and a plan. I'm looking down. Sticking the bomb in a two v three in a two v four. This case, they have the numbers, but. Get demon one already. Mm -hmm. Second wasn't even his initial target. Yeah, like that was such a last second flick. Oh, what a great spray down from Crashies there. That was clean. Wait, they're not really shooting back, bro. No, they're not. <laughs> uh -oh. Uh -oh. They're not shooting back. To tell if they're shooting back or not, but uh, you know. I mean, Zekin has so far. Definitely. A great start. Oh answer, fuck! Oh, you cannot. Demon one's so good. You can't deny that. That peak is good for Zekin. Plays a game, and he's so confident in taking that duel. And then you know some of the mind games become a factor too, right? It's not just the fight that's oh, happening on the server. Oh, Shoot back! Shoot back! It. What's happening between the ears of the players and so far for Sentinels? This is a, a good start, all things considered. Look at how aggressive. Oh, I didn't realize that was forced round two. Never mind. The three kills was not good. Trying to take the fight into the maybe not at the first barrier, but into those spots that Sentinels like to walk into. Right. The second line of defense. Mm -hmm. Marv has gone exploring. Yeah, and off all that commotion, he just pushed all the way through A, like you said. An opportunistic denial of space from the controller. He's just going to miss this timing, but that should give the info that they are working up mid here. Especially yeah, when this trip breaks. Yeah, and you start to see some of the pings on the minimap too. Suspicious of where they might oh be. Last Tier threes. How about this? Uh, I'll bargain back. They waited too long. Mark not able to clean up Rock game stream. But with 42 HP, 
with I'll I'll implement embeds in the overlay for six plus monthers. For a second there, wasn't gonna turn. He was looking at tiles the entire time. But just so embeds will work finally. Gets the 2K there. And we'll play rock game. Spectre, long range. And uh, it's, it's That's already here. a proposal. Demon one snowballing off of every round. All the kills he's gotten with that guardian. Now he already has you bring that to pen flash in the hall. Oh, that's just so satisfying to watch. Yeah. If you don't pick that, I'm not doing it. A great start for NRG. And again, it looks like it may continue. Demon one with the open hand blades in his back pocket as well. And I, I really want to shout out this strategy from NRG where they're they're not playing for the first the first wave of util. They're playing for the second walk in. And that's so important because it that that's just all prep. Yeah. Prep so like prep. hippos in bed right there would like work. The dagger to find close space take take control of areas early on but they're playing for that second layer it looks like sentinel so far is not ready for that Let's see if there's any adaptation and so with the Sam. little guy go dog yeah save utility on the first choke Bolt used to clear out the site and rg respectfully giving up all the space that they need to that's but an amazing gecko all done I mean, they've just created so much space. They're going to live to fight another day. Wingman should successfully get the spike down, and the crowd will cheer. Huh. The crowd not cheers that, for Sentinel's Wingman, overhead. but yeah. not for... For Saucy. For, for EGs? For NRG's retake. It's quiet across the border now. What's the cue for NRG to go? You see some of the smoke start to come out from they're the controller. They're contacting. All the way, though? It's not with second and tens there. And again, Saucy still has his ult. Hasn't used it yet, but I think energy. Yeah, energy call save. Yeah, and I mean, uh, I respect it. I respect it. You have it off on the board, right? Yeah. You want to see Demon One try to get an entry first? I mean, he, he whipped the shot. He did get the dash out. So had he gotten that kill? We've been using embeds to play in the rebellion. The I guess it depends on whether or not you want embeds to ever work, or not. You know. To take the A site. I really like that ult from from Sassy once again. Wrapping all the way around lane, going into elbow so we can pick it up again. That's huge to have for that post plant. Here's the replay. There was that off shot that you mentioned. Zekin and Tens did a really good job of holding the line. Yeah, it, great poise from uh, Zekin there to not peek as soon as the molly came out. He understands. He can let it cook a little bit. He's not mm. going to die right away. Try to catch him off on a timing. That's exactly what he did. Really A control here. There. Energy looks so good. Flash line up for a second to get elbow control. Like Sentinels get a couple good frags and NRG's like, all right, let's save. Is there anything? Oh, the knife. He should know. He's got be anywhere. Yeah, there, it's it's almost too big. There it is. That'll connect. Marvel's a sitting duck. Had no. Damn, Marth is so patient. Tried not to move. Ultimately, doesn't matter. Numbers advantage. Are they gonna do it again? If NRG save here, they're the fucking best team in the world. Really finding space, not really able to convert any of this. They did it so room. fast, dude. They did it so inside. fast. And something they struggled with the last time they played on this map was that utility on these A hits, but it looks like they're way more rehearsed now. They're so good. On utility, not missing anything. I think in their matchup, they didn't, they didn't even have a, a Molly lineup for the They're default so today, good. Where in their previous comp with the Breach, they would always have the Breach C to clear that area out. So now I think that they, they went to the lab and they cooked up. Saucy. They did not hesitate. They like were like, well, zero kill, zero tough. Assist, but his Utah has been getting tremendous value Let's try again. And yeah. info. The impact he's had on these rounds has been yeah. tremendous. And so with that, Sentinels get up to two. They keep things competitive. They keep things Sentinels close. have gotten two, seems like we may be getting two really kills per round the past two rounds. Here. Four kills over two rounds. Yeah, and I think so far what we've seen from Sen is they realize that Demon 1 and NRG's game plan has to been has been to fight that early B control yeah. at some point, right? But since NRG are not playing the initial barrier, they don't have the info on B main. So they're playing so far back that that allows Sentinels to actually full hit. Wait, Lily, you were only there for the first series? Run into only one Omen, right? Crash, he's had to try to get a trade, but the KO ult was perfect. Ended up being a 5v3 post plant there. Uh, Dre, at, at this point in a series, a big series, there's a lot of hype. There's a lot of excitement and attention to it. You get mm -hmm. through the first couple of rounds and you teams start to settle. 
right yeah. you kind of lose some of those like early round jitters where everything is hype the comps slow down a little is that what you think part of this timeout is here I think it's just to stop any momentum of Sun right now and maybe make an adaptation to what they're doing. I think that Ten Flash, I think this vote is misleading. Here. Instead of the Rock the game stream line, also comes with so me far. adding yeah. embed and support. Maybe even drop the op and pop knives and, and do it that way, right? So I'm only adding embed support if we do the Rock run, game stream. Running into somebody else with the op, and there it is. Otherwise, like, I'm not bothering. There you go. Yeah, yeah. the one-two combo that NRG has been setting up for I don't know forever, right? Even yeah. back in Ye days, right? Marvin Ye. Right there. Because embeds are specifically gas for rock Sen games. Already pinged that there might be a mid walk out here. Well, that's really important going into this round. Maybe already having a hard read. The blades are online. The off is currently mid. And they've got an early pit invested, I mean. Beautiful dagger gets all the info for Sen. They're aware now that this jet was trying to go for the walkout mid, so a very, very hard read. What they don't know, though, is that it's Marv who has the op, and they don't know where he is. Very true. Oh, they know now. Just narrowly missing. Yeah. I mean, the tiniest of pixels, the difference there. Look, they just reset here, go to B main, but energy should be aware that they saw multiple bodies crossing off of that one-off shot. I think what they That's don't you see look at the minimap yeah what i think they don't know is if the hit's going to be split through mid or not because mm -hmm. they just dropped a one way back and spawn they have to respect that start to see some of the flashes come through with the nades room ball on the way out dizzy oh we got knife now they have a paranoia they're gonna have to navigate around as well starting wow. to make their way forward okay second, second on the first the flash There's okay the second for the shoot forward. back sentinels finding everything they could possibly want and another situation where we're just calling the save? Mm -hmm. Save plan. <laughs> I mean, the money is just gonna continue to- Even one unlucky? Nah, process. he got owned. Yeah. And to Even fair, one's I not mean, shooting back. Can do with an off and one rifle on right. retake and a yeah. 2v4. Yeah. Sentinel's doing a great job of picking the right site off the contact that they did. And that second dagger, Zelsis, gotta shot him out right now. Getting massive oh, that's value. Tough. That's tough. That's off energy's pause. He basically made Demon 1 useless this entire round. I mean, he got knifed twice, twice in a row. Ethan got caught out there, maybe thinking that his team was going to flood a little bit faster. They're hunting these weapons. I mean, it's as they should. It's primarily just Elsus who's going to be the closest. But can they get there in time? No. So the op and the rifle will be carried into the next. And it'll be surrounded by a couple of other weapons. Oh, what are you going to do? Back into the hands of Demon 1. And we get to look at that play one more time. Good. Oh. Night. That's so close. Wow, that's what cost it? And it's shots like that, missed shots like that. That is the difference between winning and losing a round, right? Oh, for sure. That one whoa, 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 whoa. Saucy's using the crosshair. This is the Shin crosshair. Setting up for early mid aggression. Is Sentinel aware this time, though? Crash clears. I really like that he breaks the dagger there. Yeah. Because it's going to make Sentinels overthink here and potentially have to use more utility to clear it. But maybe that Omen Smoke was a giveaway that no one's pushed up. No info on the other side. The orb up for grabs. Oh, and one again. Just a little short. Oh, Damn! Yes. He legged him. He can't Clips get him. 25 HP for the initiator. <laughs> but look at how much info energy he has here. They have him pinched. Yeah, I mean, they can't get out. They've lost all mid control. The only place they could really go is to spawn. And this hit has to be clean from Sen. Zekin has gotten out a little bit, but keep a close eye on Ethan. He's tucked. And I don't think they know that Ethan's there. He oh, two with the shit. Crashes with another saucy left alone. Oh, He's shit. Watched. He's peppered. He's done. What just he happened? And he saw it. Sen, Energy just blasted so much him, dude. Push Demon 1 off the op line, but that opens up the play for Crashies to get trays for Ethan to have a crossfire with him. And he even took out the Gecko plant so nobody could play in the main. Look at these shots. As oh. the cage is coming up, that first one is he's nuts. nutty. Ethan is so good. <laughs> dude, you might have to end every sentence with hot dog. 
satcheling forward. That's not a problem. The pace. Look at how fast he takes control. That's of that. really close. Whoa, he got him anyway. I feel like you guys would get annoyed with that way with faster that? than me. <laughs> Massive numbers advantage for NRG. Oh. Still a 3v1. Zelsis with Spike and Toe. Two members of NRG on the other side. And he just dropped a single one. Wow. I thought the Gecko ult was going to tag him. I mean, right around the corner. And this is what makes Demon 1 separate from the pack of other duelists. Like these. Yeah. These yep split second decisions where he just goes for that peak lands the shot and then also up i legit don't understand how the hot dog one has so many votes i think the so younger viewers are all self-reporting it's like he's playing a different game he's just on his own he's doing his own thing confident always disrupting the hits i vote that all votes should be, be weighted about. by age when you're playing against this guy I voted for it's, hot dog with so Zami. What the hell? Conditioned from the start of the rounds that even one wasn't going to go so. Who's the so hot dog voters are fools? Mm -hmm. I agree. So Should we make a union so from well. the union? All these little mind games. The mature played. tier three union. We just want a nice around. interactive rock game stream with working embeds. Send here, just trying to and we don't like this ringmaster down. pen flash yeah, enabling the hot doggers to just go around left and right bullying the other tier threes off of their rock game stream we'll see where they go from here again a two round deficit first enough about the little man the who's gonna side. defend the big guy cool has played very well us this map. the adults and more by committee on the other side of the stage definitely i do want to point out that sen did struggle i'll tell you what's gonna defend us side. rocks Last big round, they played this map, big their rocks to it, so i think just a couple more rounds for them they'll be very confident going into defense with how they played it previously i think historically this map has been really good for them they've lost it what once yeah including the off season and all that stuff i think they've only dropped this map one time so they're and, obviously very comfortable in it and on two different comps making energy mm -hmm. like mm -hmm. have to prep for two comps is huge it's a lot easier who's just to vote i didn't and vote i didn't vote you know on the other side you know it's a i'm not part of the tier three union mm -hmm. i don't pay for a tier three i have no right to vote the trip was just high enough oh he's gonna get too far up honestly as a raise main now you take those because you die made air too much ethan's there to help but they've got a trip keeping him at bay for now you could no, vote. I could. I could. Or anything like that. They're gonna have to clear. Maybe Mark. But you can check it. the reactions. Oh. oh, I like that. It's just a dog. I don't know that they're gonna be expecting a second. Now they know the paranoia. Tagging onto John. What a great counter flash from Tens. Marv, trying to keep them back. The spike ticking away. Meanwhile, okay, the fight Tens. On two fronts as the spike continues to get approached upon. One Demon one's out, but now he's dead. Damn. Oh, falls too. That's another round for Sentinels. You keep the door open, Lisa. Heads it's getting too hot in here. Thank you. Sen on that flank. Tens was sitting on default and actually still omen flashed a main. What one shot? Teammates. The rock game win. It, it was actually beautiful. Oh, rock game dominated. Play this trade. Done. It's actually a miracle. Victor got that. done. Yeah. But Tens played this tomorrow so morning. Great. For Variety Sunday, we will start by software developing and fixing embeds. Then, depending on time, we'll play Rock Game. But I won't rob you of Rock Game duration. So if we don't have enough time for a good Rock Game stream, then we'll schedule it for another time. Oh, the defensive side is taking a fair amount of space mid here. Marved and Demon 1 both passed that mid -spot. Rimstone, bro. Thank you for the tier 3. Perhaps getting a little too curious. What about in-houses? In-houses are tonight. What do you mean? It's on the events tab as far as I'm aware. I don't know if Marv was looking tiles or, or what, but Dizzy wasn't cleared and Demon 1 pays for it with his life. So smart from Sun to pick up that Gecko Flash. Yeah, maybe we just play Rock Game for tier 3 Friday. I'm done. Look at this. Didn't know you're still doing them with watch party going on. What I normally end up doing is we replace the in houses uh, with casual in houses. So I'll drop the like serious sweaty blocks and we'll just play more for fun. 
Cause yeah, I will. So I will be a little tired. We're looking for. They managed to get to their prey, but the rest of the play is on the other side of the map. Thirty seconds. And they still have the trips up from Victor. He has his ult online too. I can't cancel the announcers. Kind of post plant, Doug. Is Sen gonna do here? I'd love if Second stays up there. They play a little high low. If you're Sentinels, but he drops down. Sen's waiting. You sweating tonight? No, no, Unlikely. No, no, no. Unlikely. For just the right moment to strike. Though. There it is. They both go right through each other. Ethan got tagged in seconds. One who falls. Trying to continue to funnel out from the side as Victor plays his life, plays his time, waits for the right moment to strike. Okay, and Sentinels. He He's left alone. Loki EML. Thank you for the five gifted. Creeping forward with three before him. One falls, but we're tied at five. Sentinels looking good. And Dare I say it? Right now at this A site post plant, looking so clean. It's on the back of a crazy Zekin performance, though. And Demon One map, is missing op shots. How they're playing these post plants. Who's his scores looking pretty even? I think it might be a draw. <laughs> Towards that CT spot area. You're so now, right. Onto the there is 50 Understand billion who's box on the line. In this lane area and punishing them for this. <laughs> I feel bad for the group of people behind those Sentinels fans. You can tell they just like into the next round we go. Ethan has a trying to watch. The rifles in an op. The rest of the way for an RG. I mean, I can't believe you get you wagered 10,000, Robin. Robin. As like you could have wasted a hundred and had a fifty million upside. Wow, my ultimate is ready. But instead, you wager like ten thousand to have a fifty billion upside. In the hands of someone else, <laughs> he's just as formidable with it. Masking is that his, presence. Is that his third ult of the half? <laughs> I think it is. It might be. Uh, yeah, I think it is. And Marv gets tagged. He should be safe for now. Oh, Mike just misses. Yeah. Just a bit short. Looks like they're gonna have to find a lineup for that now too. <laughs> Victor still playing on the site. He hasn't been cleared out. You wonder here what the flood is. Maybe off of the dizzy. No Maybe off of the paranoia from tens. But yeah, you're right. No smokes. Vic's still alive. He's a nuisance. He's got to be dealt with. He has to be cleared. Sean QT tries to and continues to push forward. Thirty seconds left. But you haven't checked this box. Well, might be the most difficult one to clear because Crash uses is covering on the other side. Zeus is a John QT left alone, and it's all it's on so good. now. 12 HP in the face of three. None found. Wow. That's tough. They need to land that Molly. Victor just a menace on this A site. I think they land that Gecko Molly, so hard, and the round so is like so different. Possibilities. Not getting caught out by the spam either, then holding a little off angle there. Well, I think good on energy too to understand like you're gonna have to cover for him They mm -hmm. have to push really aggressively to clear him out of behind yeah. Jenny And also Gosh. just from the start of the round from energy masking the off presence, right? Yeah. Dude, Victor yep. was in my Dude, DM two on. days he ago. He was cracked <laughs> He wanted <laughs> Sen to know that he was there so that <laughs> I would hope th I would hope Marved. that Victor and they Was cracked this off around once again in the hands of Marv. Look at this. But I appreciate oh, the, the data point. No no. Oh, but they know he's there now. Wow! Oh second just destroys him. Are you kidding me? They've invested the ult. Gonna head B. Oh, well, now he's dead. How, how did he kill Demon One like that, dude? Not far off. And they've kind of been split up. I don't remember the last time I've seen a whip like that. From Bro, this shit is literally just like Pearl. All right, we playing it on B. Everyone go into main. I would have lost my mind. Not with an op, surely. Cover going out. Seen crazier things. Sen playing a full post plant. Something I want to point out is that Tens has been holding on to his omen flash. Oh it's shit! Tens just takes Victor's head clean off. Three left up Before for the using his flash. That is as a timer criminal to tick away. There's that paranoia. A tap from Ethan and the Molly at his feet didn't get it to half. They're gonna have to win these gunfights because they know now that it's not being stuck. Ethan. Halfway there, three quarters, 90%, he's gonna stick it and he does! <laughs> they can't keep getting away with it! How they started. They can't ended. keep getting away with it! That's crazy. Stealing that one away was an RG. Very, very Two? good. Two? Two defuses? Based off of how they played the last time they played defense. 
because we didn't plant it against the wall, man. Yeah, I think that they're feeling very confident going into this next half. Yeah, yeah great. He showed the tens kill, here. but like he swung when they were off. Seven five lead in favor of NRG. The Sentinels kept it close. They kept it competitive, and I feel like we're in for a fight, Dre. I feel like we're in a fight, a good one. We're gonna throw it down to Ender, who's standing by at the Telestrator with a little something cooked up for us. Let's preview the next half by checking out Sentinel's perfect defensive half versus G2. And it comes with the power of their retakes. In this situation, all five coming through shop, which is yeah, I'm down to hype up Sentinels. But their utility, especially Zelsus and Saucy, is just simply ridiculous. How they combo it, not with each other, but with their self. Let's check this out. Give me just a second on this one. Okay, focus on Zelsus first. We've got a knife killing the site. We've got a blast hitting behind slant, forcing someone off the angle. We've also got a flash in a second that's going to come and ding the vibe. Viper. All right, move on to the gecko. We've got a dizzy coming over the top, which is going to blind this player in leaf, and also a mosh that's about to hit right there. And I'll explain that in a second. Here comes the mosh on down right there. Mosh lands here, and what it uh -huh. does because uh -huh. they're all five coming through shop, they're effectively seeding control back here. So G2 could push for that space. Mosh means they're forced behind that wall and they can't support these poor little players. There's a dude back there, trust me, on site, it's over for them. So, there's not a dude. Team, how do we, they call we have the mini map First idea info. is well they could put like an omen smoke that's second back with there on it on site and they can hide inside that's our own that, dude so they don't get blasted by the dizzy over the top they could also call their mid rounding into it as well when they we want can to see control through mid if you pinch into the you can see second is the control back there and you force sentinels to fight you in these locations it's much harder right and you'd stop them second's the guy back retake the other option wait ender i'm trying to, to push for ct control yourself but as we saw with g2 and no can we, can we go they only have two on the sky and one on the Ender, i want to rewind a little you, you were using a hit i don't know let's get back to the game and we were talking about can we rewind thank you so much Ender. a perfect foreshadowing of what may be uh ahead of us as we turn he said there was a guy slant fills out the attacking side you're mentioning dre a little bit about how you felt like given the history for i'm pretty sure that that was second kind of feels okay yeah yeah and uh uh, I think that was yeah, second. So yeah, I think second's on Sentinels. Take, which I think is the name of the game for both these teams. Great IGLing from both sides. They're playing in the smokes. They're playing in the smokes. Dizzy over the top. The KO flash there too. And now they erupt. How much more can they find? Victor and Ethan keeping them at bay. In the face Holy of the knife, shit. They find another. Sentinels had a great push. Just when it looked like they were going to find success everywhere. We have Across not seen Tens clutch yet on this roll. This this has to be it. Oh oh so Mark is just no, on the no. other side. Ghost puts him away. Now John QT. Bro, I need to see like one way. Tens clutch. All of them tagged. The smokes were fresh. And the timing's just so he doesn't see him. You ready, ready to be in-house teammates but tonight? You ready to sweat? Too much. Yeah, I'm down, Lily. Green shot from John gets counterpicked from victor but yeah that fight kind of much kind of like you're gonna be on my team defense, honestly but way more aggressive and you see the prep work from both teams now disappointed sounding not because he hasn't clutched one sketch dude good like good read on each it's other. the most like clutch role in the game the for NRG, I think they're gonna and i want him to succeed i'll be your igl trying to abuse what? that much like how sentinels was trying to find victor where right, lily's trying to force right, herself right, into the in-houses Go to the post plants, go to the retakes. Early space denied once more. RG. I think as long as the tier three union it green lights it, I'll allow it. But Sentinels does like. But if the tier three the union denies the them. That's why you see them taking mid. You'll have to enter the raffle. And honestly, this was the bread and butter of the last time they played. It was getting demon one set up. Trying to take one of you ones into mid. We'll only allow people who play in the in houses to vote. Because of course, like plays the jet. an Instead APAC the viewer is gonna vote yes. Because they don't care either way and it's content. But I want people who actually play to be the ones with the say. Or Zelsis's hands and they put it in towards Zekin, who's now the closest to having his If everyone who already if everyone who plays like yeah, let Lily in, then we'll give her a dedicated seat. To apparently time. be I'm my team's IGL and initiator. That it was a faint smoke in mid. I hear your request, Lily, and we will take it in. Here. A 
five on five. They were all so quiet. John QT falls, crash he's pushing forward. The flash on the other side of the wall is gonna cause disarray across the site. Honestly, a bit rude of you though to just assume you would be given a spot. What a sick viper wall, it's disrespectful it's, it's, for the, the paying tier have? threes, Lily. Really. Not only does it allow you to walk up a main for free off a of contact and take that elbow control, but it allows you to walk on a site and clear the default box. Yeah, and that's so important because we saw Victor even just there finessing, exactly. right? Exactly. There you see that wall. And it was Crashy, I believe it was Crashy, who funneled in behind the wall as soon as they had that early contact. Yeah. You're absolutely right. Very good game planning around the comp that they have because they don't have all this utility to clear these these tight corners and these places that people could be hiding behind right so they have the in in-house like that, players association whippa so will decide <laughs> and uh again the, a very slow round from nrg it's really taking their time Look at this viper wall for the B split. I, almost identical in concept to the other side, but this time they've run into tens. Ultimately meeting his death, but he's already gotten so much value. John trying to turn the flash to clip wrench dry and demons there to greet him. I don't think he's going to pick this phantom up. I think he's going to stay on the guardian. It's telling that when Sentinels is in the 2v3, I think it's over. And when NRG are in the 2v3, I think they can do it. Great Molly. Yeah, they've just been a couple of threats. Ethan's tapped the spike twice. Daring and beckoning any challenge from the opposition. Now Demon 1 hold the line. Second layer. Oh, the timing was perfect. Ethan in 1v3 with the guard. Never mind. Second, Look at him. Zekin just did something that I'm really bad at. For a second there, I was kind of did you see how Zekin didn't no use way. Util so at all until he made his contact? Because he had space that was unexpected. But like, wow, I'm really bad that. at that on raise. So you can you can you can tell the respect that they have for this player as they should. And it's honestly helped them in so many rounds. Let's go, baby. Every round. Yes, sir. Six, yes, sir. <laughs> 16 and 11 for second. Yeah. Damn, tens is triple ten. What are the odds? It's tens, and he's ten, ten, so ten. I that mean, has to be a sign. So quite admirably. God, this entire off season was meant for him to basically have, like, get that experience on land and yep. everything. Take him over the edge. I don't think Victor. I don't think Victor knows that tens is here. Shadows. No, that makes noise. This is a crazy time. If Maybe Ethan's hyper aware, then he just heard Tens throw that smoke. To throw this cam. Oh, the footsteps. He didn't hear it. He didn't hear it. That. In and out. That's huge. Just like that. And he's been heating up, Doug. Like a thief in the night. You've got to cover John here. Gets out of the cam, feeling some of the pressure. Oh, that smoke needs to go up. Just in time. There's no flash on the other side of this, yeah. so maybe they double face. Think, or they just hold in the smoke? Oh my. I think John is aware. Will the mid players from NRG get first contact is the question. It just seems so far away. No, it's out. Vic who's creeping Fixies forward. Elbow. The contact Fixies out. Fixies his elbow, Doug. I don't know that he did. John what QT the fuck? Toggling the camera you know now spotting Demon no, 1. Cage triggered. And now they know something is afoot. Both of them spotted. They've got trips, they have oh hands, the paranoia is going to connect. The but timings here are crazy. Is there something to capitalize on it? Yes. Peter invests the old butt. Crash uses gun behind enemy lines. Oh. Can he find any more value? No. Getting in, getting his kill, then quickly taking a step back. Martin Crash, he's in a 2v5 with 13 seconds left. The spike still not in a comfortable spot Dude. as they crumble. I feel like that brown could have gone either way. I cannot so believe creepy, Victor Doug. got out Everybody across that sight line. So hyper aware of every gap that was there and having crossfires on every gap. We're almost one one hundredth, a, a one tenth of the, the way to the one hundred one hundred draw. Start of draw. One enemy Understanding the Whoa. default cam of Victor and outplaying it. The little micro play like that gets you that first blood on the initiator and then that causes. Is a timeout? Well, Perfect. I'll go to the bathroom. Beer back. Everywhere. Yeah, it's huge. I just want to point out that like Tyson right now tens. I mean, everybody knows it's by Tyson, right? He's been <laughs> he's been dominating these last couple rounds. Like yeah. he's really heating up. I can tell by his aim too. He's got that little crackness back into him. Sen is the script. I mean, it might be. <laughs> 
Oh my gosh. A two round lead for NRG. They're the ones who call a timeout, perhaps feeling the situation slip from their grasps. Yeah, they still have a lead here, but it's definitely getting a little uncomfortable with how these last two rounds have gone. The Wave Sun. And just great, great setups. And honestly, all off of John there on default, playing that corner so well. Jiggling sight. Jiggling his rap. We back. We back. What's up? And pretty much just staying alive. Yeah, like he probably could have committed on that demon one shot, right? But the difference is he knows All right. the hundred percent. Energy on eco, play, right? So just sentinels just there. there and just stay alive for Looking as long strong for his rocket. Ten's omen flashes have been killing it. I mean, they've been on point. Yeah. They've been perfect. They've been killing it. Damn, Lil Lily got rejected. Been holding on to them. It's, it's Serves her right, honestly. I think she was kind of overstepping. Game plan demanding that we allow her to skip the line like that. The attacking side, he was holding on to it for the post plant. Wasn't even using it for the initial hit. It's that same Viper wall out from NRG that we were talking about earlier. They've taken a lot of space mid though. The buy is lackluster, but the space they've taken so far could prove to be the difference maker. Waiting on the other side of the oh, and now Lily acting like shoulder. she was just always gonna Showing a little skin and take the loss right with up. some class, Lily. That allows space for the eight players to walk up here. Saucy's there to greet on the other side. Meanwhile, Ten's got the best oh my. of the oh. Saucy with three on the round. <laughs> He's got another ult on mine. <laughs> and Zekin just running in there, but didn't have a target because Saucy just went. Insta rocket yeah, is crazy the there. The against Zico. Right Do we and buy off? Hey, bro, buy the operator, Zekin. Come on. So for him to be to be waking up at such a crucial time, it's very important going forward. And kind of dangerous from the likes of NRG now. I need this crosshair. Wow. Big play out from Sassy. And the lead continues to dwindle away. Just one now. One round separating these two squads. Oh, bet. Bet. Yeah, I'm down. He's in the flow state right now. The man has ascended. Yeah, let's just kill that guy. <laughs> I think I think Saucy traded 20 That's years, Jet. I think Saucy traded 20 years. Like that, just understanding timing. <laughs> he, he took the biological wall hex. Time. And he they took have the, the deal. Luxury, too, of having such a big advantage with so much time left on the round. I mean, they can still play the map however they want. Yeah, getting rid of that Viper Lurk. They don't have to worry about this at all. Right, Just exactly. contact here. You'll probably see Saucy just jiggling this, but the main fight is actually going to happen here in Market. Sends is close. He has a paranoia. You imagine as soon as the trip goes down, they should be ready for this. Demon yeah, 1 has purple hair. He does. 50-50. Just like a draw has 50% of its rounds for one side and 50% of its rounds for the other. Is it a sign? What do they do off of this though? Hard to say. So carefully. So quietly, so cautiously. Tens is ahead of the cage. Even one pushing forward, Tens falls, neural theft used. Wow. Dude, they were down in numbers and they this thing right back. Planted. Oh. Mark was there to greet Saucy unaware. No real chance to fight back. I mean, what great mid rounding with from NRG without Viper, yeah. without the lurk. Putting Bro, NRG are so spend. good. This was a four v five round, yeah, by the way, chat. If you remember, Crashy's got insta picked time, off by Saucy. The they put so much pressure on. That they just hit B site flawlessly. John had to get off that cam, and that opened up the gap for Jimmy. I like broadcast Mark. to start using the term Ethan One. And catch that timing off the I, main contact. I kind of like that. And it, I, 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 just real quick, I gotta say. But what up, yeah, Eamon? One. Himself the last couple of rounds, but I think that kind of got to his head here because for some reason he he took a timing in front of those cages that that Victor threw and ultimately gave Victor a one v one and him dying there. That was that was a disaster. That that opened up the entire map. Take a look at that. NRG. We'll take a look at that opening kill there one more time. Is. Ultimately irrelevant you just remove the the d i also love the little hezzy that nrg threw in there once they hit market yeah cutting noise just, just pausing for half a second i yeah. mean it wasn't very long but it was just enough purple one 
Have you guys seen that talking parrot on the internet? It's like this YouTube channel and the parrot can say what color things are. Every time I see the word purple now, I envision it the way that that parrot says it. He says it like purple. You know what I'm saying? Makes people worried about different things. He gets off a cam. I can't, I can't unhear it. They're slow around here from NRG. Just one gun fired. You should understand from the audio cue that is it the one that says Shrek? One yeah, says, uh, yeah. That, yeah, that yeah, guy. From the likes of Sun. Crashies is one point away from having Zolt online. It's Apollo. It's the wall, by the way. Yeah, it is a little bit different. Metal. Than yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is just to take all of sight. <laughs> Bro, that parrot is such a beast. A Again. He He's looking at Demon One's webcam, so noticeable he looks at minimap. That's job, common for a lot of uh, pros. If you would have just gotten out, had a five v four with Omen Flash, perhaps. World. Now they're gonna have to deal with this pit. The one benefit, though, for Sentinels is that they have the Gecko ult, and that's a perfect <laughs> thing to try to clear out something like this. Oh, this is perfect. We'll see if it can find oh. value. It's gonna tag them. Oh, that's huge. Flood, that takes the pit down. Do they capitalize in on this window as Mar pushes forward, expecting the aggression? The pick gets dropped. How much more can they Not find? huge enough. They're trying to flash out and funnel through the utility. A 3v3, Jockey T1 HP as he falls. Elsus left alone. 16 HP in a 1v2. Damn. He's gone. Tries to get a free one in the spam, and it's just not going to be found. Mar, so clutch for this team. Understands that he has to push up there. He has to try to take out anybody walking into that Viper's pit because if he didn't, Crashies is just dead and it opens up the entire retake for Sentinels. I think the other thing too is NRG are so good, man. Exactly. I don't know if you guys notice, but NRG are winning this right now with Demon One having a bad performance. Like it's an objectively bad game for Demon One, and Zekin is having a great game, and NRG are up three rounds. I, I really think they're just the better team by a lot. And he's 17 and 12 right now. Really taking over. Cover going out. A three round lead. It was down to one. But NRG have found a second lease at life. I like this from NRG. He slow round. Sen's got this for sure. I don't know. If Not you've seen the NRG comms that, video, their comms are like in the first, you know, as close seconds, to perfect which, as I think comms can get. The likes of these at shooters on this state of the game. It can really happen that fast. And, and it's really showing it's showing half. yeah right meticulously dissecting and devouring everything the defense is showing i will say here for sentinels they've taken a lot of space a main there's just a trip keeping them back mm -hmm. but second finds the opener Down, great response from crashies fast trade you see the hours of otter view going in yeah to these games against other teams maybe sentinels would break that trip but this time staying there not breaking it understanding that energy likes to rewalk into space saucy usually zekin in those scenarios just blast packs out so yeah. again like i just feel like set is this, this angle is really good of staying in for too long saucy can get a lot here if he tucks the first is found the second oh. does too omen flash right off of that and the dizzy chat update Oh, this guy's yeah, he's, gotten. I mean, I'll well, read this after, one. actually. I think Sauce is about to. Yeah. He gets his first. Isn't that funny? 10 seconds Ten left, seconds though. A flash left. in his face, a spike in hand, but just no room allotted. No space found. All right. They continue Surely not. Yep. From every we have 70 underpill draft players. Two teams yeah. have registered. <laughs> Accountant really favorite team, penguin.png, have rebranded to frog.gif. And we'll be back for season four. Oh, my accountants would be very glad to hear that. They want a one I'll and let them know. And done. Yeah, and I trade them instantly. And I think it can be looked at two ways, right? Like one of them is oh respect. And NBA the yeah. thirteen month know, prime. Fundamentally true, but I think you have penguin dot png have rebranded right? like, to frog dot gift and are confirmed for underfield season four. Lurks. It's meant for contact plays, and here comes aggression here. A change of pace from NRG, but the knife. Initial reaction slows down the entire push and the dizzy from the top. Second was there on the swing. The timing is gorgeous. Oh, Sandals. Wait, I need yet. to keep saying it's over. 
and NRT are better. Using to relent on sunset. It's over. NRG it's are gonna win this. And Victor are left alone. These are the dangerous rounds from NRG. That is true. They when, have two rifles too. Yeah. When sound is cut and nothing is being shown, they just finesse their way. Look. <laughs> Imperial the more like MP fake. What's the next reaction? That's Victor coming out. There's still one more on site. And John was here last time. And he's alone. And there's help. Maybe yeah, you better backtrack, Robin. You know, MP played in the, the Game Changers League for League of Legends. They'll take you to now town. The upgraded. All three of the members of NRG have rifles. You get worked. To getting the spike down quite yet. Is popping the Wait, what happened to two of the plan. Sentinels players? It looks like it's for me. They don't have any post plant utility. So patient on this retake. This son. But is the patience going to be their downfall? Is it going to be too much? Second with the first. Color me shocked. Okay, second is a freak, dude. He's a freak. Let's go. And man, NRG almost brought that round back. I set it up perfectly. They're so dangerous. In the rounds where the, 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 the sound is just cut. When they put down in the minds of Sam, he is a free fundamental play style. Lisa, look at this from Zekin. Not that, that's not Zekin. This is not Zekin. This is not Zekin. This time closing it out, and I think Marv did not. This is Zekin! Boom! Wait, that's the only one they show? All right, get out of here. It was hype at the time. such a close game. Hype at the time. Anybody could take this away. Yeah, you had to be there. <laughs> no, Zekin! Lisa, look at the bad luck charm! When you're watching, you can do no good! What? An early attempt at a strike and aggression no, from the defense. No, was. It's instantly popped. Demon, Demon, Demon won such a beast. In the previous round with his alt out. This time, clapping back. I know exactly where you are. And again, Dre, the DNA is the same. They cut noise, mm -hmm. instilling just the tiniest fragment of doubt, creeping into the minds of the defense. Uh, Lisa, Lily, type your name in all caps. Have to play elbow because of that viper wall. And then she typed more like loser. Lily, what the fuck? Another one down. Crash's plan is perfectly right now. Crash's isn't really the spot though, but Crash's. You wonder if he's aware. Whoa, oh, shit! So good. Oh, he got too high. He got too high. Ultimately, yeah. cannot persist. And John left alone. Lisa just left the there room crying. The Lily, the wall goes up. crying. Oh, this wall is so good. He gets out. I thought he was gonna hit that shot. Celsius now flashed. This is so Decayed. tough for Celsius. Paranoid. It's not planted for them though. They still have so much time. There's nothing keeping him back. He's gotten it to half. <laughs> the, <laughs> the controller the classic. The energy, it gets a map point. I love that accountant so favorite clean. team is our fun fact. <laughs> and demon one to open it up like this. Wow. My accountant has responded. He says, I love it. They were ready for a rebrand, I think. It's time to take it all in season four. There you go, frog dot gif. His dash was not primed and ready there. Yeah, he was done. My accountant is excited for your return to the under. <laughs> It goes off, so it's not a one-for-one. One. It's just insane. <laughs> He's so confident in those moments. Those millisecond timings where it's make it or break it. And that's why he is a champion. Lisa, Lily says come back. But I, I honestly don't trust her. Match point. I feel like Lily's about to just roast they you really again. Good alts coming up online. Crashy is getting his Viper pit. <laughs> I think you're going to have to see... Sun playing more aggressive in these mains on this round, but will energy really Why are they showing this? They understand that. What's that? <laughs> yeah, it's a blob like fish, you know them? <laughs> yeah, Tens has one on his desk. <laughs> Continue what you're doing. I don't know. I don't know why it's so if realistic, dude. Goes down. I mean, that could be the nail in the coffin, right? For Sentinels, this map. H tanks. Thank you for the prime. Huge, how many subs will it take for you to do real life events like that. VCT? This A site. 
I went to VCTLA, did a meet and greet, a had a booth, also, keep an eye on Marv wore a banana He's suit. So aggressive with his TPs. So it'll take about negative 400 subs. I've already done it. And I've already got a flight book. They mean land under peel. To perhaps suggest that's where he was going. Five thousand. Celsius's knife just denied all of that. He actually canceled the omen all as well. Sentinels with the numbers advantage, and they get the pit. You want to land? I'll give you a fucking land. Getting healed up, but not to full. But we need money. Lands are expensive. But I think 5,000 is actually possible. And second doesn't. Sentinels just continue to push forward. Wait, Cratchy's and Vic left alone. The duo. But it's expensive. It's expensive. Ooh, let's go, Tens. Tens gets two more. Life for Sentinels. Now, if we're talking knife. something like the Ludwig no Xteric shit, right but instead of pro teams, it's viewers, I think realistically, uh, it would cost probably at least. <laughs> if we're being if we're being very safe, I would want to set aside at least fifty grand. So energy, no answer for that when they were down numbers. And that's like an absurd amount of money. And Marv sitting on a stinger. So we would need like a crazy big community. Ethan as a classic. Keep in mind. Land events are money sinks. Yeah, but so they are aware. at a certain point, when you're subscribing to a streamer, when they're super large, you're just funding a goofy money sink where they do things that you think are cool. Right? Like, at this point, I don't need more subs. I'm happy. I make enough money. We could sit at 1700 and I would stream site. for a decade and, or more, the and we'd all have a good time. Will be a more subs past this is just going to fund me IG doing IG crazy shit team so far has been that you would like to see. To like me funding Pen Flash, quitting his job as a teacher, side. to run an in-house league full-time. Pets! One more! Second, you piece of shit! Fine, fine, good, good. Was that all ADS? Good. It looks like it's the 3K. Yeah, it looks like it. I'm flabbergasted right now, Doug. Let's go. Oh. What a beast, man! And the crowd comes. Yeah, more more subs is just like at this point, I don't need it. But I I know how I would use it, and I wouldn't just I mean, hoard it. We know. That's the tens we love. So subscribe if you want to support that. Oh, it's like his bullets just have like a magnet on everybody's head and that was to force ot yeah i mean he gets picked there map's probably over single-handedly takes out three members and the viper ult which was so crucial for nrg to win that round momentum in the hands of sen right now after that but ot needs a chance to reset reference the 15 months It doesn't look like there's a challenge early. What happens when all the it's junior engineers in your subs become seniors? <laughs> you have an army of good Valorant players with lots of disposable income. That's that's that to get when away. we get real dangerous. No! He got the bomb. Tens is alive. What can they do Enter form. Enter form. Spike not in hand. Position surrounded. Shh, calm, calm, calm. Well, demon one would be Last everything. Player, oh. Oh. Spike down A. As I say that, Crash, he's just one tap Celsius. NRG take the lead back. Victor going huge there. He had to Switching win that one v one on second. Yeah. Match point. Jumping the gun. NRG call timeout after going up one. <laughs> NRG won the round and they're the ones they're putting the timeout, Sentinels so on ice after they win around. Really trying to make the Sentinels players soak into that moment of the round that they just lost. 
perhaps trying to cook Ex Grayo, up thank you for the three month prime. And you imagine maybe the conversation is going back to the second half of regulation, right? Where things mm -hmm. kind of got away. Do timeouts reset in OT? Maybe they don't reset. Each team gets one. When OT begins, well, both teams game sunset. gain is one timeout. With this timeout called, I mean, everything is up for Can rest. you call back to back? Like, can Sentinels call timeout? right now this is Sentinel's map pixel for NRG. probably not right away. they're feeling very confident going into the rest of the that'd be really funny though series. that'd be really funny yeah. they just call another one timeouts mutually no, good surely um right so timeouts benefit both teams hey. yes but if your team is on a roll a like really hot from that previous round, then it hurts disgusting. and if your team is tilted then it helps <laughs> Timeouts help restore the mental to neutral. Like if you're tilted, timeout helps you on tilt. But if you're really hot in the zone, a timeout can pull you out of that. So when your team is almost worse, a timeout can be favorable as well. Yeah, it's neutral utility. Just because something's neutral doesn't mean it's not beneficial for one side. Like this omen smoke right here. Because Tens chooses where to put it. Completely just like Kaplan chooses side. when to time out. Yeah, and also uh, they're investing three to hold the middle of the map. OT timeouts mutually good, but during time though, it's not. No. Flash on the other side of it and the deep push mid. When you a coach call a timeout, it's because you have something important to tell your team right now. Does the other coach have that? No, or they would have called timeout. So the timeouts generally favorable for the team that called it. And you can see that in the data. Um, teams win the round after they time out way more than average. He's got two trips to play off of. They must know now. Oh, what's afoot? Ten's waiting on the other side of the smoke. Oh, no. Victor drops him. John going exploring. Here. He had the moment, not clutch this time though. Flash deep into spawn. The spike committed. Oh, a spam kill. Did he hit the trip? May have. Ethan. Ethan Flash. He's got two, three flashes in his face. And now Zekin's there. Oh. Oh. Numbers in favor of Sendles. Oh okay, gosh. this is really tough, though. This wrap from Marv is perfectly timed. But is it going to take too long? It's not going to take too long. I mean, the onus here is on Sentinels. They have to take some space. Is he going to break Wingman? About it here. Oh, the gecko is Wingman got half. Wingman gets you so close, but can Marv get a 1v3? He's going to have to finish. Let's go! Let's go! What great utility from from Sentinels there. Switching sides. Timeout advantage, Sentinels. Timeout advantage. We feeling good? Hope so, hope so. Ethan, he couldn't go anywhere. Yeah, he had no choice, man. There was a nade behind him. He had to run into the flash. From Saucy. Poor guy. He's full blind. And that's where you see the gecko just. We're 13% so of the right? way to 100, 100. That is correct math. Bomb. Tap the bomb, right? So that you have four guns just holding. Fighting, yeah. And so double OT on the cards. These two teams, it's just been the first map. You know, you can flip percentages, it's real simple. If 13% of 100 is 13, then 100% of 13 is 13. Sentinels now might have to overthink this and see how that works. Isn't that crazy? So I think you will see this. How else would you have been able to tell what 100% of 13 was? It's just silence. Jokes aside, that does work any early aggression anywhere no i think there's a real good chance they wait here and regroup b for Zelsis to get his knife back online and then they go this is what i was talking about the great igling from both sides always picking the site with less numbers like five percent of 25 is the, the same right as 25 percent of five especially when they're on attack so five percent of 25 might be hard 25 percent of five oh, is what 1.25 he's up top right where so it's the same They managed to get the spike down though. Second has fallen. NRG with numbers. And there's no late flame. You cannot call yet. that the 10's angle. <laughs> Playing on top of the I mean, box in King Market is flash. not the 10's angle. It's all on to Zelsis. A 1v2. Jumping up on top of the box, creeping forward. 
timing. Demon one. Huge. Zealous is oh man. Oh man. Oh man. I can't watch. I can't watch. These post plants are are what's making the difference. And also just Marv there. Every round we get closer to, to get Robin Wobbin getting 50 billion points. Amazing retake potential that they have. I'm going to start calling any angle I hold the tens angle. Lily, you're so going to forget you so said that by the time match. you start queuing up a Valorant game. Because you're going to start thinking if you're attack or defense. And then you'll be dizzy and you're this not going to be able to remember anything. Yeah. They've had this opportunity. And they're doing this mid wall again, it looks like. This time, do they actually use it? Is the question. Maybe a mid to A. Oh, it seems like they want to. Oh! I think he was a little behind the flash, <laughs> just a little late. Trying to find a timing, maybe thinking that he had a hard read on the setup. From Even one down. Mid. A bit of a gamble, but you know what? When you're in Here. the when you're in the driver's seat like this, you know sometimes you got to go for plays like that to try to win. You know. I think part of that goes to how they showed the, how they played around this wall in the previous OT. I don't yeah. like that you have as good a read on my fiance as track. I do. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, you you're not supposed to join in. You're supposed to be like fuck you talking banana. I I'm going to eat 3 bananas tomorrow. Freak on this B side of the map. It said you're out here like true. Gunfire erupts, his body's fall on both sides. This is this slow mid round again. But this that that, that peak right there will be the read. That this will be another one of those slow rounds where the NB that knife tag both. Oh, what a shot! A lot to do, and he can't find any. That was huge. Sendles with the numbers. Fuck it, TP out. And the very likely possibility of another round of OT. Oh. Yup. 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 14-14. Vendi. Vendi spotted. Give him a week. A week timeout for Vendi and Sentinels will win. I mean, energy have had map point a couple of times, but it never really feels like they're a kill away. It's been pretty decisive. Who salutes? Who salutes for Vendi? Who salutes? To give all of B. Who salutes? Timeout Vendi, Sentinels win. So kind of makes you want to end B. But Sentinels was aware. Tyson was aware that he could be in sight that entire time. Just great control of of emotions and not over eating this. Damn, time. the guy just the guy just whacked his buddy. That guy keeps getting beat up, man. <laughs> I feel bad for him. <laughs> now it is Sentinels here. who pause after winning around. Percent this time. Touche. Sentinel. Who is Vendi? Lily, do you even Lily watch my YouTube channel? How deep is the playbook, and honestly, Lily, you gotta catch up on the so Vendi lore. Um. This off season um, on this map. Yeah. So they actually yeah, here. pull out I start, from another is, is this video. Try to, try to make it work. Well, if you and don't follow the lore, I don't know what to tell point, you. It's been We're in too energy. deep. It's never really been Sentinels who have had the advantage. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to send huge salute. It's not in my stickers. Oh, that's because it's an emoji. Play Barrage. You can find it. Music box slave of the tier three. Talk about. Wait, I think that means we're only one off seventeen hundred. So far, like yeah, he's had great IGLing. I'm not a YouTube Andy huge. But now it's understandable. That you know, that rumor, a facade of IGLs being. I'm a stream Sally. Let's be real, you're not really a stream Sally either. He's having a little bit of a rough time in that department. Got a quiet map. You're an intermittent. A lot of space taken from the Ivan. Defense, across the middle of the map. <laughs> like uh, I was cooking. I was cooking. I think Second made an audio cue when he got off this angle. The dash went out, but Marv stayed. But when you do show wow. up, you show Does up John big. This? He has to look. He's looking He's right away. at him. The gun barrel's gonna give him away. Ooh. He gets the kill. Wow. Bro, you're always on my TV. So smart. I take it back. You're my fucking goat, Lily. Will this finally be the moment that Sentinels are you're able just to push? A, you're a lurker, aren't you? Lurkers are the best. As I've said so many times before, I apologize for my words and my deeds. You're a lurking lily. Lurking lily. Sentinels are glad to just hold, right? They don't have to make a ton of noise. So smart. Kitty cat X meow.
thank you for the tier three, I guess. It might be the Kitty cat, yeah, that's really me out. He's hearing everything. Does he try to peek? That's what you got. Though? They're taking a step back. It's a great nade. But somehow, honestly, Victor doesn't get away with as much damage as I would have expected. She's lying, Hoosh. Don't fall for it. If there's one thing I know Lily wouldn't do, it's lie. Head flash. If anybody would lie, it's you. This post plant utility is so clean. And Tens is on a late flank. Keep a close and eye Lily says she has me on her TV. I Can believe her immediately. Second on the first. Demon one falling. One and is the last Let's go. Out. Timing out Sentinels worked. To map point. Timing out worked. Yeah, I really like that from John. Getting the pick in mid on the reclear. And now, now we seal the deal. Just intuition. We untime out. And if we Sentinels win right here. We add another another and three months of gifted up. tier Someone three. Be here in mid. Yeah, we no way we use both of our weapons. We've seen, we've seen both weapons. On these a post plans. I'll add three It'll months. Be so cold. Even NRG, honestly. I wouldn't be surprised if NRG, if NRG try to end A here. Just like Sentinels did. I'm yeah, dual wielding. So strong. I'm dual so wielding karmic. Listen, put me back the in. Oh my god, time him out. And and both flirting with Trust. A piece. No gifted. No gifted. Absurd. Vendi knows better. Vendi wants back in the Great box. So <laughs> Vendi is she, her, chat. Four I forgive you for there. presuming that they were he, him, because that is the default on the internet. I am simply the notifying you that Vendi is definitely on she, her. Not so much on the B. Pure Blade 9801, thank you for the prime. I mean, they still have to reckon with that wall. If I'm not mistaken, utility was used to reclear this A space. Sorry, you said he? I definitely did in the OG YouTube video because I didn't know at the time either. budget, man. Tyson's here with the Omen Flash. I think they have a good idea of what's going on here. This setup could be disaster. There's four here. As soon as there's contact, yes. there it is. I can get to head yes. I think because of that, yeah, Tens is able to hold the flash. But there's a flank. Oh my Demon God. one behind. No. Lines. Can I get two? Oh, Tyson tucked. He didn't show his gun. 16 HP. Spam on one side, the cam on the other. A 4v4. Saucy spamming into the smoke. Yes. Tag. Yes. Tag. Yes. Again. Tens in second. One yes. Yes. Vendy. Vendy. Uh, I think. Oh, the shot count did update. I was about to restart the service. Good comms. Good comms. That's map one. And as expected, Zendikar loses two billion huge pops. Did you just put four million? Wait, wait, Zendikar. Zendikar, how are you going to afford... Zendikar, how are we going to win at Madrid? Zendikar, if if you do this and send them to Madrid, they're going to get day one. You're not going to have enough bucks. <laughs> you put four million on NRG. <laughs> on the other side of this break, don't go anywhere. This series will continue to deliver. We'll be right back. Yeah, you know, I respect it because now it's win-win for Zendikar because Zendikar really is like a big Sentinels fan. So if Sentinels win, he actually would prefer that. He would spend 4, huge bu 4 million huge bucks to send them to Madrid. I know that. So now if they lose, at least he gets everyone's huge bucks. <laughs> Guys, it's Jimmy Lin. He actually, In Jimmy series, Lin. I'm gonna walk you through attack on Pearl. Yeah, watch out for the, watch stairs, out for the stairs. Clear this angle. Clear this angle. You're gonna be able to fight this. Be able to fight this. <laughs> Haven C Long, good. All right, thank you, Jimmy. They have plenty of time to remake this video, but the Jimmy Lin video is is actually cinematic gives you purity. It's like
it's the best form of cinema imaginable i don't think you could do it better i don't think you do it better wish me luck putting the kids to bed hoping i don't miss map two. Oh, oh i'm on it i'm texting tens critical mission tech pause needed all right Boom, 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 boom. Both the Underpeel All Stars teams that played Pearl last night won almost every round on attack because Jimmy Lin taught them to clear angles on Pearl, right? Oh, wait, map one was not a draw. Sorry, Robin Wobbin, but your 10,000 points are going to remain out of circulation. Double or nothing? <laughs> yes? What do you mean, yes? You want me... You, don't, you want me to take... More, 20k points for 100 billion. I, I'm not going to let you do that. You, you're just throwing away 20k points. Like, I could make a reward called do nothing. This does nothing. Don't redeem. That costs like 10,000. And you could just redeem this. Like, there it is. You guys had too much power I, i'm removing that i'm removing that apparently i i can't give you that room oh what do you mean oh it was a reward that come on smick standing here with coach kaplan after what must have been a very stressful game for you to give watch, us but we had so much fun watching it you are now one map away from giving Zelsis the best birthday gift ever, a trip to Madrid. No, you guys are going to regret Let's this. I'm working on a TTS map. reward. Are you sure? Series. It was the longest you know what? I guess I told you. Had in, in the Americas thus far. You we'll make it 20,000. The score was 14, 14, but there's going to be one that you can claim yeah, um, I mean, to I TTS on stream with funny voices. Default, so we and really you're burning points right now. So you, and, you know, micro adjust. We won't be able to the plan we wanted but i was like hey, right, take a minute to iron it out great thing about ot time dts you know sucks exactly it's gonna be with the ai out, voices so i spent some time like you'd be able to pay money and you know, I said, I have consenting tier threes say something so i'm gonna have a sign up form and everything so tier threes can submit their voices and tts using their own voices could be really funny let's play 4a forget b i'll just sit here and he nailed it i mean it was a sick play from the guys they were really but like you could spend your points Certainly, and the fans were cheering so loudly as Wait, well. yeah, isn't that gas? Isn't that gas? Sentinel yeah, I know it's gas. Up the first map here in a match that is you will have, if you submit that form, you, I'll make it clear. But if you submit that form, you're basically consenting that other tier threes can also TTS with your voice. <laughs> so like if Pen Flash, for example, agreed to that, then somebody could TTS with Pen Flash's voice. Um, I will use my voice as well. Um, it'll be one of the options. 
if there was two players to be the catalyst to come back into this one, it is. You'll see. Zekin I'm working on it. And, it's going to be such a cool feature. The kids on Sentinels. And those two guys were electric on that second half, especially I'll be on right this back. defense. And an overtime right as well. Second winning a ridiculous amount of opening kills. And Tens continually clutch as an anchor on the site. Kept Sentinels in this to even get to OT. Yeah, honestly, this was, and I'm, I'm not usually a stats guy, but this was Sentinels owning in the numbers. In the important categories. Yeah. First kill, first death. Sentinels were up 19 kills to the 11 of wow. NRG. So much of that was to tens and to Zekin. But even more than that, it came down to gun versus gun rounds where they got smoked, honestly. That's that's 14 out of 23. My, my math isn't great, but it's 14 rounds to nine rounds. And it comes because primarily NRG won so many rounds because they were won both pistols and also Sentinels were trying to force up in those second rounds. So they got a lot of buffer early on in the halves, but it was Sentinels convincingly dominating rifle v rifle. It yeah. absolutely was. But beyond just how good the individuals were, I think this was a clear game where both teams really understood their win condition and played to it quite well. In particular, I thought that NRG's mid rounding to contend with this heavy retake comp was great. This round, one such example where you see NRG isn't really going for aggressive, using a bunch of util to take space early. Instead, they're slowly inching up, taking space after space, and not allowing Sen to set up for these floods. Yeah, and they know that Sentinels, their prep for Sentinels is Sentinels like to play deep and tens like to plays on that high box yeah, all right absolutely i'm back what's up ready for that stuff and you see here again in this post plant they're they're pushing forward they're finding space but on the other side for sent when they were permitted to play these more set retakes that you were talking about in that halftime telestrator that is when they were owning when they get to pull out this preset stuff they absolutely ran over nrg they just didn't have enough counter utility to deal with it cool yeah, yeah, brave like thank you for the tier three appreciate you back and towards you guys are putting over you 5 million bucks Again, on this match? Utility, just insane. Although Sentinels are still showing some different layers on this as well. In previous attempts, they actually would go for a late wrap. You can see it here from 10s. Who's just asked me what's up? Time him out. Yeah. In previous iterations, Sentinels would commit all okay. five players in. In this one, they had the pinch, and it was those tiny wrinkles that gave them the And it was hand. literally the end of the game, too, right? Yeah. I mean, just 10s tucked in a corner. Really smart play. Not trying to overcommit, not trying to show too much. It was just discipline. And don't forget that it was tens that completely saved the game when he was on top of the box in market, sees yeah. over the smoke, mows down three players. NRG are looking around like, where where the hell is this guy? Like, yeah. we don't know. And it goes back to that interview as well, where Kaplan's talking about giving a big idea and then yeah. the boys coming up with these little adaptations on the micro. I think that really showed here. They were doing the same big ideas of playing into these set retakes, but the small adaptations, positioning a player in a slightly yeah. different spot, setting up a bait for tens. That was what was make or, make or break in such yeah. a close game. I, I couldn't agree more. Uh, there's so many pivotal moments in that matchup, and the good news is that it's just a start. So let's go ahead and see where we are right now. If you're just joining us, you missed a whopper of a map on Sunset. It was a fun one without a doubt, but now we move forward, and we're, I think it's a cent next is what we're going to be yes, getting sir. here. So I, and again, are we going to be seeing any, you know, funsies here? Could we potentially get a little fainer? I don't Maybe think so. Not I, after I, what I, we just I, saw. I, I'm a little bit less of a believer. This is yeah, also fair. a map where NRG played the tried and true, but this is a map where Demon 1 must step up. He got yeah. beaten in the opening kills, and after a pretty decent, pretty good first half, he got trounced yeah. in the second half. This is his map. This is a scent. Jet has to be dominant here. If he's not, it's Sentinels going to Madrid. This is also where the pressure is going to fall back to Ethan. I thought in the first half, the mid-rounding was really excellent back on Sunset from Ethan, but Ascent is where that absolutely matters. All right, I'm back. Some of that magic in the first four maps from this energy squad. Where that was convenient timing. Perfection, where the flashes to set up Demon 1. I had to, to answer your text message anyways. On point. You're calm. Everything needs to be Honestly. For energy to take this home. All right, there is your agents. No funsies. Pretty much oh, what you would expect. Yeah, yeah, Cypher like kills, right? Cypher, actually. I'm a big fan of that. Yeah, I think the, the Cypher is very good on the map now ever since the buffs to give him the extra range yeah. on those trips very powerful and a good a better answer into ko because he doesn't have the range gap that a kill is vendi back yet uh vendi is untimed out setups are really Beautiful. powerful but this is the moment where sentinels no raise it's a scent so actually qualified to a master uh, odin seems to agree with you event was champs 2021 a completely different team so much has changed since then but this organization finally has another chance to make it to a global event 
They're only a map away. And if but raised, no, I'm with you, but there, there was raised last map. Championship EG will go to the first international event. Oh boy, a lot at stake here for Sentinels to get this 2-0. They will certainly need your energy like a spirit bomb, but we'll see if that's going to be the case. Cause Wait, NRG they can't say NRG like that. Here now, of course, at map three. Let's send this over to your casters. It's Duck and Baby Bay. Thank you so much, GB. What a perfect setting to potentially close out this series or extend us over to split. We talked about the comm changes of the Destin a little bit. I'd love to get your thoughts. The KJ for the Cypher, what do you think? Yeah, just in general, I, I really like how Sentinels is being comfortable, like changing their comps and like, yep. I mean, that just puts a thorn in like any prep that has been done for the likes of NRG or any team that they play against. Like that all right, all right, let's see is so it. important going into these games because if you can catch people off guard and do it for him rounds, stop you guys are making me want to play raise right now i mean that that's the difference save that shit saw, for right? tuesday's rank stream winning a map that goes into ot and not i'm gonna be having withdrawals soon dude i'm about to start traveling so for madrid on the cypher like i'm spending a week not, right? on the east coast with my family before i fly to madrid i'll still be doing vod review streams do not worry but i can't play because I'm traveling with a laptop. And he is littered with Cypher utility. Oh, John single alive though. There's the trip. The dark too, but they're going to go away unscathed. <laughs> it's the classic Sentinels. Rock game on the laptop. Rock game will be workable. Yeah, we'll be a... The variety Sundays will make them work. And that's just going to make for a chaotic attempt. Yeah. Like we, we can play something. That's for sure. Is taking a little bit of damage. Ethan has two. Can't you like buy a baller better. setup and just bring another so bag? Those two are, be this late B main flank. Yeah, those two are just going to sit side by side. If you're asking if I could just B. spend a ton of money to solve the problem, the answer is yes. So close, and there it but is. I'm not it's that type of guy. Finally, things starting to crumble, but Ethan trying to keep him back, trying to hold the line. Saucy from up top disposes of him. Ooh. They know it's just more, but the clip runs dry. No like, way. even if I had oh, that, was so that much money to just waste, I wouldn't waste it on that. Uh, Let's go! What a start. It comes down to just ammo. Not having enough. He dinked him so early on. It's a, it's a miracle that he stayed alive though. Yeah. yeah. Saucy, Saucy just in the matrix in that moment. Oh, it looked like he already wanted to invest into the Odin, but. Chad Jesus says like the EGP setup for the travel a lot. I don't think you understand outlaw into play here for First me to play it a high level and what a better spot to be at then i also need like a um a. i need a monitor i'm not going to use a laptop screen i'm not going to buy a second monitor that sits like i do this too much they've got the spike and I know I stated earlier. I have a skewed viewpoint of your finances. Playing with a lot of respect towards Demon One. My finances are very healthy. I could do it. Like I'm just that narrative having money. Change, especially usually, usually the types of people who can there. like he was one shot headshot keep money are the types of people who don't just fight spend anyway. it crazily like that. Look at this. Trip. You know what can you really do? Yeah, I, I think at this point, energy is just trying to get out. Did he guns out of I hands of their opponents? I will spend my money like a complete moron if it's for my friends or like people I care about. What door do we hear? Maybe not this door. Maybe that. Like, if I'm t treating my friends for dinner, I will buy them the fanciest fucking food imaginable. That's one weapon found. If I'm getting myself digger, it's three dollar rigatoni. Like jump peek that Marv just did. Give it him props. That was a nice shot. I like that. You know, having fun out there, super important, especially to play. At a stream consistency. No, I can do VOD review streams though with my playing. laptop, like no problem. Honestly, stream. In that kind of zone, you play like, we'll just better. shift the rank streams. Uh, rank will be replaced with more VOD yeah. review, pro analysis. That's amazing. Damn. Damn. Dropping that bulldog. Look at his money. They forced him to save. Wow. And like, 
You bring I'll a cheap little USB mic? No, I bring an expensive I a, microphone. I'll, I'll speak about it after this replay because <laughs> there's some nice shots. But I have a, as a player, this is I have an expensive microphone strings. already oh, packed alive, in a. You know? yeah. Keep them alive. So I have a travel backpack and a travel luggage. In the luggage, I already have everything I need to stream on the go, except for my laptop. I have a microphone already in there, a stream deck already in there everything Zen packed so when i go to travel i unplug my laptop Once again, put it in my backpack and i've got everything i need i love what i'm seeing out of second though man that's and that's because i'm incredibly kill. forgetful i didn't even realize that ethan had this online already he still has that outlaw like, i will forget something no way, so i have the bag second, already packed what's the microphone of choice this is a sponsored stream vct watch party so you don't get an answer and already very costly for NRG. And I think if I'm saying But you here, will barely be able to tell that at it's point, not me at my home. Maybe we don't go the mic will sound a bit different, but it sounds really good. Well, Zalsis did just get a weapon. You mm -hmm. just carry on everything and from Madrid, right? Um spotting the first or just a little Probably. Ahead of what are you packing? By the narrowest of margins. Now Ten's feeling the heat. He should really just Try to get as many as he can before he dies here. Why not buy the same mic X2? Because my I current mic needs to be plugged into an audio any. interface. Yeah. Yeah, they, they very which well means I would need to travel with a large audio interface. Which is Celsius. unrealistic. And tons in that scenario decided to just play crossfires. But I've been hyping up the outlaw so much, and this is the reason why. I'm actually debating replacing Even my current mic with the same one I travel with. <laughs> That makes the because they both so sound really good. Even right. a classic, right? Yeah, a classic one shot. That just does so much damage. I'm very surprised that more people haven't been using it. Light armor on four for the defense. And energy back to their similar antics yeah. from sunset. A slow, methodical approach to the attack side. Great shock dart there. Getting crashes off the of drone, taking chip damage as well. And there's the info. Demon one is in B main. Yeah, this won't adjust their positioning at all. Already Zach and leaning towards that market area, playing anti here. Dude, you guys are so bad at picking up on. Does he pee? No brands during the, the watch party stream, cam. man. I think he does. Yeah, I think so too. But look at the setup from Sen. They're so ready for the speed up on Cat. Yeah, and NRG are trying to potentially cure at trips that may be controlling mid. It's often an alarm bot that's there, but given the Cypher pick, the approach is just a tiny bit different. So important here for NRG to break this cam and get out. You also oh. got to be careful here if you're Zekin not to overcommit. He oh, okay. Not to over oh. Deliver, but he doesn't Ooh. make any noise. He doesn't get the kill. Wow. He got Warning robbed. Shots. He actually got robbed. But is that going to be enough? Zekin might be in trouble. Yeah, he's dead. He had nowhere to go. The TP back B. Okay, well, they know that Tense is full. Ooh, it doesn't tax Sova. Continues to trample forward. Marp's gonna fall. The spam trying to connect onto another. What? Nothing's found. Man. I think Sen. I think Tens has to bait him. And John have to try to take this back and attempt it. A flood is denied. Crash, he's weak. Quiet. His footsteps now pushing forward. Ethan. Disposing of IGL on the opposite side. He woke up. Damn. Yes, he did. Oh my God. Damn, yes, Ethan's just That's tapping. Maybe it's a really good angle. A Everything's a good angle when you're Ethan. <laughs> you. Look at the <laughs> scoreboard. <laughs> He's like, oh, we need me to shoot? No, I bet. This, I mean, that if he had gotten that kill on the Demon 1, I think it's such a different setup. But not only was that the problem, but again, Zekin didn't know where he could go. Yeah, it was, it was really good fundamentals from the side of NRG because if it was a flash play, anything like that, you had Ethan bottom right of mid, you had Victor right. bottom left of mid playing anti, like jiggling in and out, right? Holding for Demon 1 to just get contact there. So uh, they have they the wrong read. Had an idea Maybe it's the right read. The round that there might be a trap play around that mid area. Oh, NRG are faking B. And honestly, Zekin was lucky to even get out alive at all. Just Ethan best KO in the sounds. world? Doesn't matter. Team game. One of the best for sure. Yeah, and this is just pretty good IG yelling from the side of NRG, but Sen reading into it, understanding that NRG has had that B site for free the last couple of rounds. 
I wonder here what they do here if they try to clear out wine. Is that smoke? That's a really good timing on that smoke. Yeah, they have to clear it. And that's exactly what Demon One does, but the paranoia dissuades for a little oh bit. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Oh, they barely They're spotted the TP. One! One! That's bullshit! Come on! That's Come the one. on! That's what the one stands for, huh? <laughs> That's what the one stands for. He's demon fucking one. Slow down just a little bit, but energy have so much room. This is doable for Sun. 13 HP between demon one and Victor. How didn't it kill him? You have a deagle on the board. Marv, one shot headshot to a ghost. This is very, very doable. And they might get spammed with this dart. I don't understand how it didn't kill him, dude. He had 81. Oh, so many options. Maybe it was 77 and four armor to. The second falls. Vic has 12 HP. Oh my gosh. But he does have a gun. Can he hold him back? The first falls. Victor once again trying to do it all on his own. Dancing around Jenny. Saucy tapping. Time is short. He's playing with him. He's bought so much time. Ah! Oh, he's so good. He's so good. Just finessing around an object. No, dude. The last map it was A site default. This time it's Jenny. You can't even be oh, mad. He played it so well. His movement is just too good. How is he? Did he have 81 HP around. check? Can somebody yeah, check? Tested. The Sova alt, but. They had a chance. You really had 81? So Eyes up. I mean, 12 HP was the difference maker. Yeah. And so we go Get energy with way. three ults on the round. One of them was just used the blade storm online. Wow. And it's neutered for just a moment. Delayed by the blade. Oh, very, very interesting change of pace from an RG. Drop the snipe. And I do wonder if they were going to actually commit there or if the whole plan all along was to have four shields. Piece of shit. Look at how proactive. Sentinel, Sentinels are right now. Tyson reclaiming that A main space, going into wine. That's so much info gathered, but they're not moving on the map, not reading into it. Energy did just enough to keep Sen guessing on his A site. And you know what? That goes into last map's mind games, right? Where NRG would cut noise and still re hit the same site. Dude, NRG's attack though, default is like online now. See some of the mind games already. That shock intended to clear the cam. It was there a couple of rounds ago. Yeah. Here. Should be a free B site here. Yeah. Demon one not finding any targets. Oh, what an interesting trip. But it'll delay and it'll buy some time. Left. Second has an op and Odin in the hands of Sasi. And another explosive attempt at a 5v5 retake yeah. on the cards. They're taking their time though. Wow. Demon one with one. That's all. It I is. cannot believe Sounds Demon one is egoing it like that. Spike like I know he's high ego, but such a good spot. All he has to do is nice shorty tense. But that's like crazy. <laughs> but there's still so much to do. Oh, no second whiff. And time is short. They've got to push forward if they want to take this thing back. Ethan and Vic left alone. Nice knowing you. 15 HP. Last There's there any challenge? Standing. He ultimately falls. Second is not gonna be able oh, to get out. Oh, and they dropped the shorty. And honestly, a couple of shots there from the side of Sentinels, specifically Zekin. I think he had a chance to get two or three op kills into that round. Bro, He's energy got four connected. on attack. I think I think Zendikar might be gaining a million huge bucks. This kill was so insane. That just makes you think maybe, you know, maybe we swap the gun of the off to somebody else so Zekin can run in with the rifle and entry. Sure. With tens there, because if he would have been right there, he could have gotten that trade maybe. And that could have opened up the retake. Small things like that change the outcome of the rounds. This is a very, very I'm betting it all there. map three. To see energy if we lose, I'm betting it all. Ago. Really, you're gonna go Chamber broke? Medic. You're gonna go to Mars zero Zendikar? You're gonna have to rebuild. Cat, they're dead. He's holding that line down. Now looking deep in the mid. Looking for even a jump spot. 
from CT, looking for anything. He's zero right now. He's all in. Is he? I thought he just spent a million right now. Oh. For four million. Nicely done. Like Spot even. One. Is that all in? I still, like this, there's still so much time in the round though. Yeah. That's all I had. Oh my jump. god. Trying to reclaim the info game in mid. Can Zekin find any value with these blades? It's not set up off of anything. There's not a flash on the other side. This is a duelist. You fan of that TP top mid on Omen? Seem Bang doing it too. To find a threat to pull on. Uh, it's solo queue. If you have a read that they're like fighting so bot mid, it can be good. Warm. Yeah. And should stay up. If you have no such read, then it's, it's pretty passive. Because the you're just going to all follow so your teammates dark. up. Off of contact with these trips and spam coming out. There's a dart. It's only spotting oh. one, though. Nicely done, but the spam is there. They have to understand. Meanwhile, Zekin with the blades oh finding one from up top. Okay, Sentinels. Had to have gotten high ground, but Demon Not okay, forward. Sentinel. Uh, do I need to stop watching? Invested. Ten seconds left. Go. Yes. Go fast. No. But you've got to clear out John back sight. Yes. Uncharacteristic whiff. Done. Let's go. Let's go. Almost a very scary round. Let's go. Honestly, off of whiff, uh, like a whiff from Demon One. I just want to see him at Madrid, man. Even the, even the previous round with the knives. Usually in that scenario, we see Demon One get two, three in that case. But just not stringing multi kills together today, it seems. Is Demon One just getting a lot of one and dones, getting traded out very fast? They're okay, not back yet. I one. think Sentinels wants at least seven. To be continuing that here, map two. But the way like when you start defense ascent. Down, Doug was so clean, getting that late left. Oh, oh shit! What was that? <laughs> okay. Okay. A few shots in the previous round, not this time. That was cold. And he knew. I mean, you go back to the beginning of the round. The crosshair was expecting the jump spot. I mean, you should run. That was for anybody. That could have been. That could have been anybody from NRG there on the jump spot. They're yeah. dead. But who better for Sentinels than to take out Demon One? Can I get a score update? Three Especially to four. Ascent. Sentinels is defending. Defense. They're down three to four. Go They're likely about to be tied four to four. Too, so I think Sentinels needs at least seven though. No fucking shot. Your score update might be a lie. Marth is a beast. And this is a perfect bait. Oh, but Marth, or Victor whiffs. Time is so short. Yep, Sentinels just dropped around. It's three to five. These battles are so round. He's gonna keep the up. The spike will do the dirty work for NRG. Five rounds already. Morphed again playing hero. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Oh, that's dirty, bro. Very accurate flick. But I will say that that jump peak was a little bit too wide out, honestly. Yup. Agreed. Hit that shot, though. But I think most of the time you see players jump spot that. A little bit tighter. It's a lot tighter. Yeah. Nah, no, I agree, with baby bay. Zekin's crosshair placement was good for it initially, but when he pulled it down, he got lucky that he hit the shot on Demon One. But that's really it. <laughs> that's a cool dart. The rest of the buy is not great. Went to wash my hands during the thrifty and energy won it. Even worse, dude. Really energy good. won it four v five. And a lot of them were towards that B side of the map. Zekin killed Demon One the, the moment the round started. On the A side. From NRG. Something to note, maybe for Sen. Not luck because the Hujin luck. No, no, no. I'm saying the way that Demon One jump spot it was the only reason Zekin even had enough time to react. And again, silence. A proper jump spot, you can't hit the shot unless you're pre aimed for it already. This door smoke. From NRG, one in the smoke. Yeah, not even a footstep. They're not worried about it. As the spike, excuse me, the smoke goes down. The spike pushes forward. The flash and the dash. NRG looks so structured on this map. John trying to find some value with the classic. That's a big ask. Oh, they they saw that, right? Start to see is that really a Lily through. message? Ooh, 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 ooh. Just fuck hygiene bro slash S. I'd be curious to see how energy plays this because there's plenty of time to hunt this op down if they want to. Is that like hoop on Lily's account? Chen. While they're hunting, you see on the map everyone's moving right now. 
I want to point out that I think energy had a hard read into this round. I think they understood that Zekin was offing B because they made There's no world Lily's calling Penflies a barrow. Shot baited out or anything like that towards that side of the map. So understanding that these bad guns will be on that A side. I'm telling you, Lily's foul mouth. Lily calls Penflies a barrow. Not dying to anybody from sight. Okay, that's incredible from Zek and then he gets one. He things up to condition in the future rounds. Yeah. We've seen how much of a menace Marv can be in that garden area, the garden cat area. He kind of owns that spot. <laughs> Look yeah, at he Ethan, man. <laughs> this guy has 14 he's kills, man. Yeah, he's, he's got another ult. He's had an outrageous he's half. I love how the server is super stressed for rolls right now, but Lily has a so Lily obvious. mod roll. <laughs> hey, man, she wanted to be yeah, pink. Uh, yeah. right. Zendikar Zendikar has a fake a bronze right rank now, mod like, roll. Send will be taking a timeout. Very wise to do so because this game is just slipping away. Didn't you shout out a deadlock for tech too. sometime this week, huge? Uh, no, a neon they player found some success with Zekin having the in the Zami VOD review, maybe Frank. Uh, deadlock, deadlock, deadlock. I don't, deadlock. I don't think so. Energy, this, this I really don't think so. Approach yeah. the attack round just continue to cause fits. Yeah, their, their, their game plan is to just try to find out where the op is, where the cypher is playing. It's very much like the last map that we saw. And yeah, that's true. Hitting the weak side. Uh, viewers listening, yeah. Sentinel's taking Especially a timeout. It's three rounds. to six. Sentinels are down. Round, obviously, they walked into a stack but they were aware of what they were doing they didn't they did not want to walk into the op at that time so just a master class right now from nrg on this attack six of this last seven rounds i mean the rounds have come in bunches mm -hmm. isn't for having good util Given really a tools they have at their disposal, deadlock they could pop very quickly yeah that's something i want to touch on actually is how oppressive a KO that is going off, that is popping off, can be. I think I said there's yeah. merit to the With pick, and I faced one who had good util, like, but I don't think I specifically recommended like a player. Any round you win, this guy already has an alt up, and if they win with that alt, their economy is already broken and in the shambles. Zelda yeah, sound sensor on the ramp, I'm aware of, but that's me saying there's merit to the, the pick, not me saying go watch this player; they have good util. There's the challenge. Face one didn't. Re yeah, I'm aware of that buy. The, the, the phrasing was there a player you recommended. Death. There's a judge on the other no side. Way. And just disposed of. With a ticket, sending appreciation about your shout out on a stream one. earlier. Oh. It was going wide. It was effortless. It looked the so fuck? easy. Looked like he knew. Did they say who? <laughs> Peaked it perfectly. And here you go. I don't even you know who I'm shouting out now. Again with the smoke on door. <laughs> The energy good. looks so good. Well, just for a second, it looked like, and it was just enough. There's only Zekin here, and he has to go huge for his team. He's got the <laughs> oh, I see it. I see it. Kind of to stay alive. Bro, it's because oh. I read. No, He's this guy prime subbed to today, Zendikar. This guy prime subbed, and I thanked them for it. <laughs> Energy is so smart right now. They're so dialed in. That's the shout out. Trying to dance around. Oh, wow. But he got the job done. Spike is planted. What a beast. What a beast. He submits a formal thanks. A 2v2 as you hear the dart. Please do not follow in their footsteps, chat. Our mod mail will be over flooded. Or I'll have to stop thanking Prime. his own devices. That ult's gonna be big. Can Vic keep him back by himself while Ethan starts to move forward? Drop Saucy. John by himself will not deliver. He cannot. Dude. And Sentinels were up 3 0, by the way, chat. Oh, sorry. No, no, no. They're up 3 1. They, 2 1. It's a 3 1. Now they're down 3 7. And you see the different layers that they have on this map now and why they condition that door smoke. This time opting to fake and go back to the B site, investing the KO as well. And had Ethan not gotten that trade onto Tens, who killed Demon 1 there, maybe a faster rotation would come out from the likes of Sen. But they did they were not able to make it in time. And Zekin just got overwhelmed. Alright, coach, what's the answer for right? Sense right now? I think point two three eight hundred DPI is the truth. That one way is not kind. Here's the truth. But honestly, I mean, tens of two HP. Yeah. Wow. 
it looked like they were trying to set up Zekin on some really aggressive space B main too. I really like the way energy just played that map. Or just played this round, this early round. Showing aggression in A main. Showing that there's multiple players there. And that ultimately ultimately led Sentinels to try to claim some space at B, running into a Dude. flash. Zelsus play. is just gonna get flashed. Oh wait. Zelsus is gonna oh, oh, never mind, right holy shit. He died so fast. Things, but three members on the other side. And now energy can push forward. Look at the mini map. Just like you said. Nobody on this A site. And look at how cautious energy is still being. Yeah. Please clearing everything out. Still committing the utility. They don't want to get cheesed right now. Yeah, they're playing this round. Cool for you just don't understand. Man, this is you're, you're not radiant, yeah. I mean, That's way too high. Already decided to save. Yeah. And oh, this is a disaster half for the side of sun. Just look at Demon One. What adjustments need to be made? I think, I think it all starts with the mid area of the map. I think when Zekin was able to get those early kills in, med, in mid, I think point zero one going for eight hundred is round. the truth. But without any mid control, not point one. Mid clear, point zero one. Just not, not able to hold these hits or or anything. Right. So I think we need to see. Isn't D one point two sixteen hundred though? No, he's point one sixteen hundred. Demon one is point two eight eight hundred. I mean, this is a 3-8, almost a 9-3. Does NRG give them this round to dodge the 9-3 first? The <laughs> That's the question, because at this point... Yeah, he's on half the sense you think he's on. 17-5 and five for Ethan. <laughs> I, I mean, the timeline tells the whole story. Sentinels have struggled to find success. Bro, Ethan is 17-5. and five. And now Demon 1 has... What the in fuck? Hand. Ops actually get an op up for Marv and Kiwi so by the fruit. Thank you for the dollar. The I volunteer like to be timed about. out for yeah, sense to win. Drop yourself a rifle, like, show you want me to keep talking about sensitivity, is what you're saying? That makes no sense. How does he move so fast with his arm? Into this. I mean, and, and just having op presence on attack makes you just play so differently as the defenders. You're oh, scared to sure. jiggle, you're scared to hold certain lines. And that's tough, especially when you were just calling for uh, perhaps a little bit more proactivity. Yeah. From yeah. the defensive side. It causes massive hesitation. Oh, oh great. Jesus. Molly, though. So dead. That is the proactivity we needed, though, and I'm glad it was off utility. Making sure we don't get picked by the off. That's one down. And that was crazy that Saucy just went for the 1v1 with an Odin against an op. Because the op. He's picked it up. That's oh, huge. Meeting the same fate. <laughs> I guess the counter to the op is the Odin. <laughs> Since when did Seems Baby J cast? Has been living under a rock, dude. I don't know when they just started bringing him on. I think he sort of fills like the Sean Garrett's role as a caster, where he's not necessarily like a professional talker, but he's a professional like understander of high-level Valorant, and he has a good enough voice and ability to talk. Drawing attention, trying to allow Marv to find an opening. That jiggle, I don't think it was seen. Oh, yeah, it's Baby Bay. Sorry, I just read that guy's message. Is it Baby Bay? Yeah. Bro, these guys, these guys got confusing names, though. We'll take a look at it again. I think jokes aside... I think when you think about how well mashed up these I teams love the slow-mo audio can make all the difference okay. That's not an insignificant round boo, And it was all based boo, off of what I was talking boo, about Like trying to boo. re aggro in mid And they actually caught a timing to, to punish Earlier we spoke with Victor about the legacy of NRG's core The original NA super team Take a listen I think for uh, our core, uh, or our old core, uh, myself, Austin, or Crashies, uh, Marv, then Chet, I think we're kind of used to that perception of us. Um, people have been calling us the best team in North America since like Optic and like late 2021, we were still known as Envy. Uh, so uh, I think we're just used to it. I just brain blasted. You guys, know, you guys know how like Finesse is considered to be one of the best IGLs in North America, but let's be real. He's got some of the worst aim in the professional scene. Isn't Ethan just like 
sure they use Super it, so. finesse. As a team, I don't think it bothers us. Um, if anything, it just feels good that people like are slightly scared of us. If anything. Sentinels is he just super map, finesse? Down on a set, and I think it's really interesting. And so now this team is super energy. optic. Now, yeah, I think there is an element of respect that's shown to this squad, and I mean, you see it in the game. Good reason, yeah. yeah. Sentinels trying to play finesse, bigger proper, brain. You know, trying to play fundamentally sound, using utility. Have we ever measured like the <laughs> circumferences <laughs> of their true. heads? <laughs> Do we know that? Two titans on the server. Who's got the big head advantage? They're so good. Yeah, they've matched up super well. I think this this feels like I mean this has to be what the biggest gap we've seen this year. Saying Demon One Super yeah, Som? No, if anything, yeah, Som is Super Demon One. I will say it is on Energy's map pick. And if you're picking a scent as your map, you have to be so confident in your attack because you know you already know every single team is gonna choose defense first. Right. It's the most defense side of map in the game right now. Right. But to be that confident, like that, that's what makes a good ascent team is that when you do start on attack, you control made some popcorn for this reason. watching really good like players this. shit on irons is like is my third favorite like things right after Just kicking said, puppies and side, grandma. What is this copy thing. pasta from Lily? Everyone towards B here and quiet. Where did you get <laughs> this? Expecting the knife, dodging the knife. Crashy still has his dart. <laughs> the thing is, is, they haven't shown anything towards the A side of the map. Oh, attack! <laughs> They're gonna push him. The, the, you had to have made this up because this can't be a real copy pasta. Because there's so many high yellow streamers who do just shit on like iron players. That was a sick knife. I mean, he never was able to get the dart off. Here. That trip. Oh, so planted. impossible. <laughs> Still has cam up to watch the cleared up and lock it. Who are the iron players in this perfect. in this world? In the game me. that we're watching. But the bigger issue lies on the site, lies before him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah, Demon ones. Are NRG the iron forward. players? Oh my Sentinels are the iron players. He does it again. Sentinels <laughs> when we are the iron players. Take this pistol around and have a chance. Energy just sucking the life out of them. Demon one getting way too much real estate there on that catwalk area. Too much value there. It hit the flick on the guy back sight. Are you kidding? Are you guys microwave popcorn enthusiasts? Or do you use those like um you, know, you mentioned just how important it was to win this pistol? Those like heater thingies. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what are those things called? Uh, Air popper? Bad, man. Yeah, you can see it on their faces, man. They know, they know they have that one. Everyone who's that saying microwave, how many of you have genuinely tried an air popper now, designed to pop popcorn like and that's it? Because I feel like all of you Call saying microwave shots. have Don't never tried one and one, you're though. all living under a rock. Celsius in that 4 HP. I had a stovetop one as a kid. No, 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 no. An air popper. Does not require a stovetop. It uses hot air. Can't be that good. That's what movie theaters use. I mean, this would be a if that adds any merit to the air popper. That'd be crazy. Meta. But as you and I have talked about, I mean, you just take it around at a time. Yeah. Exactly, and when you're losing, it's not like what movie theaters like do, don't matters. they? Yeah, I've said this before, but they literally use hot air to pop them. Get, truly does matter. That's exactly how the machines the work. Map. I think you can even see the, the machines heat up the air and they pour kernels into the, the middle basket, and the kernels pop out. He just got one step closer, now two pins away, upgrading a weapon. They do not use like a microwave at the fucking movie theater. Yeah, yeah. 30 seconds left. But honestly, I think playing in the long term, the closer Zelsus can get to getting his ult online, the better. I think that's key here. He falls, John, a he lot of movie theaters still use oil. Off. Really? Give me the data on this one. Because I've been to quite a few movie theaters in my life. Second, the last one standing. And he will get cleared. Energy gets a 10. I got no idea what the hell you yapping about. I have never seen. I mean, An oil popper. Done, but Ethan gets KO'd off of that. What? What is an oil popper? 
oil popper popcorn. So really taking it personal. A night and day difference. Hot oil. Not allowing what happened in the last map to happen again. Maybe what was going through his head. I got no idea what's going on here. We could have won that last map. Maybe this could have been a 2-0. Must win round for Sentinels. Demon one with the Guardian. Ethan investing as he should. He's they pour a quarter pound of game. butter on the popcorn. Uh -oh. Nah, bro. Nah. How do they know? Nah. He still gets the kill. Wow. The butter obviously that makes it really good. Cool idea, smoking off Vic, so the dart doesn't. But I've poured yeah. hella but hecking uh, butter on microwave popcorn, and it does not hit as hard as Air Pops popcorn. Saucy took a lot of damage there in that opening scuffle. You're actually coping if you're defending yeah, microwave really popcorn. Did he see him? No. But he falls anyway. That's a gun diff. That's now three HP. Three members left what? for NRG as Ethan continues to farm, continues to frag, and continues to frustrate the opposition. I will admit I was unaware of the oil popping method. So I'm unaware if oil popping is superior to air popping. And I would like to try it. However, I will proudly state as fact that air popping dominates microwave popping. Not even close. Not even close. Microwave popping, I laugh in your general direction. And something I'm noticing right now out of Sentinel, specifically Zach. What was that? Hesitation Victor there in the bottom mid before he swung out. And then you saw him actually get punished in A main, jiggling heaven against Demon 1. So maybe doubting himself a little bit right now. And that's not what you need. That's not what you want. There's He's oil the inside microwave bags. And maybe that round win could be the confidence that he needs to. Yeah, but when you issues. microwave it, you're not oil popping Demon it. You're. Like last, like, <laughs> what, four rounds? Three rounds? You look, look at the money that they have. There's a real good chance he carries an op into the next. This whole conversation was just to laugh I mean, at us lesser microwave users. No, it was to open face. your eyes to a world well, of popcorn that you might not have realized exists. A little confidence. All the picks to get you away. potentially yeah. considering Both trying an air popper. In this round, the two yeah. If you're a popcorn enthusiast. On the ground. That's the confidence I was talking about. Yep. Zekin needs to tap into that. Don't doubt your don't doubt yourself. But I understand. Maybe you thought there was an op online. Yeah, air popping is cheaper. Things that go on in the mind of a player. Popcorn kernels alone are so much cheaper than buying bags of microwavable popcorn. It's like having a if there is contact and then they can flood. But a pour over and grinding your own beans for coffee versus having like pre-made coffee pods. Like the pods are always going to cost more than the the beans over time. So even if he goes down, it's okay. Their economy is fine. They'll be all right. You gotta, you gotta go the up front is too much? Bro, I'm pretty sure you can... One sec, I'm checking Amazon. You really can't think I'm pretty sure you can get an air popper for 20 bucks. And you're a tier 3 huge subscriber. Do which is actually crazy. For next round, though. So maybe you'll see one sec. A B main default out of Sen. Or I, main default. The Try first to result on, to Saucy, Saucy. on Amazon is seventeen dollars try to explode on a site with that ult <laughs> they want to string some rounds together the higher rated one that. is 37 for the fancy nice one nice readjustment there from second and so they get to four Thank Ten six, still in favor i'm pretty sure that pays for itself in popcorn costs for if you eat popcorn like from it I don't expect like 20 times here, but there is an op online <laughs> he is passive off but uh, we should do the math on that it seems like that's the name of the game for chet here against the send squad playing these passive off angles now he's gonna get re-aggressive now yeah. in the mid round so really playing for that second layer and they're, do they're doing such a good job of trying to set him up mm -hmm. you saw vic to contact there's a turret there and then he can swing. Is Zekin ready for this? Oh, he's dialed in. He looks ready. Just one. That's a footstep. Difference here. He's got to know. He spotted oh. a hand. Demon one shoots Demon just a little early. Yeah, he's stuck. This is very reminiscent. Fuck of this jet agent. There we go. Oh, he got wow. killed by the other jet agent Not because she can dash to chase him. Oh. Fuck this jet agent. Ethan filth again. 
a 4v4 though as the brakes are thrown on the round Nowhere to run. expecting aggression oh, and it lands. Ethan's done Whoa. Up the site, Doug. I think he's trying to hold from spawn though Oh no. And now he smoked off. This is a good attack round for Sentinels. But like. What? Oh, okay. Fuck you. The smoke? Yes. What the hell? The moment oh, I started no. saying anything. Tens do it again. Planted. My ultimate is ready. Desperate I was blind. To pull out a miracle here. Vic is weak. The first one falls. The second You're welcome, Zendikar. You're welcome. An attempt was made. Crash has just hit five HP. But NRG get another round. I would love to see that back from Zendikar. What if the universe wants you to have huge bucks though? That was crazy. What if you need to we bet on Sentinels bullet. next game? I think it was all that was fired. And you need to lose, I mean, lose or win, so win. They, I mean, they had it. Oh, one step. Oh, one what foot then? Step. Yeah. <laughs> Unreal. Oh, have you thought no. about it? And now a timeout called from Sentinels. Like, yeah, if Sentinels lose, then you're really road. sad because you lose all your recovery. bucks and <laughs> Sentinels lose. I just can't but if they win, then you're really dollars. happy. <laughs> I mean, he could, he could go for 30 right yeah, now. No, no Are you guys timing out Vendy? He really could. Like, legit, no one's even close. Just great play right now from NRG. Sentinels losing a lot of these micro. What the fights. hell? But like, I mean, what can you do when you're just getting spammed through a smoke like that? You know. That's tough to say, but Kaplan seems to have a lot that he wants to share with his team right now. Very animated, trying to will things back. Yeah, maybe trying to make the Sun Boys maybe just calm down a little bit, understand all the steps they have to take. Don't skip a step. You the know, the little like, things, yeah. Like that, that even just that little footstep that Zach and made. Made, made or break the or how do I convince my dog so, that he's fine when I pick him up? Trying to make everybody this right Odin now. guy now you're seeing thinks he's gonna die. John's he's like, right Yo, Normally pick me up, bring me to the chair. And, and so I pick him up. Pretty good. And he, him, you know, I just, I he's literally like, like, not really getting anything going here. Trying to like wave his arms around, like, Oh god, oh god. Hold under his legs. No, but that's like, I guess he's waiting. That's not a solution to the problem. That's like a band aid. Second with blades. Like, yeah, I can give him more stability, but I shouldn't need to. Everything He's fine. Right now. A main control. Bottom mid smoke comes out with a mid dart. The drone B main also clearing out. And the knife to yeah. get even more solidified info. If I'm Sen right now, I need to show something B or just go for a B. Better comms. I'm worried if I like tell him, oh, don't worry, it's fine. Then his like stupid so animal brain round. is going to go, I knew it. There was danger. And that's why they're stacked up here. You're absolutely right. Look at all the pings Hold him till he calms down. Yeah, this dog will not. We've, and we've tried that actually. Though. He'll dead ass hold Second a stiff pose until in practically oh, like passing out. Exposure therapy goes now. skydiving with him. Now that is the radical thinking we need. The the I'll take him skydiving. That's genius. It was decisive in the face of the rotations in the left. face of the fact that energy had a heavy presence here they find success they find space to pick up odin and give a tree again, we tried the that the possibilities of a comeback are flirted with <laughs> Not he like really doesn't party. like it I, I, so he I, doesn't I, relax in your arms yes, correct it's really correct it's an important one at all still so much and he used to has to go their way and his little brother udon is no problem he's super relaxed and victor's getting close to this kj alt as well Odin's like Should giga nervous. Into the next. Crowd's going crazy right now. No, there's just one guy. Yeah. He is the crowd. <laughs> Did you drop him? I have not. No. John on cat. Yeah. So it looks like Vic is he relaxing your off. lap? Yeah. Into Super relaxed. Sentinels will get to seven. And the money is the money is not great for NRG. They did save the op though. I wonder yeah. now if we're gonna see. He's in my lap right now, like practically sneezing. Because he does have funds. He should have the funds to be able to do a light buy. So maybe you have demon one with the guardian and somebody else on the opposite side with an op. Marved or somebody. Weird. That's yeah. what I'm saying. Could be the case. Historically, it's been marved. And that might be part of the conversation right now as NRG calls the timeout. Yeah. What can we do right now to get a cheese round win? You know, or cheese first blood.
to try to have a work up to it in small operant economy. conditioning no, steps clicker or keyword so treat only once he's calm maybe he's not calm don't give a treat do smaller steps it's gonna be knives on the op and try that you're gonna see maybe uh i'll try it i'll try it i feel like the moment my hand touches him the dude's going to go giga tense is util in heaven to delay and it's like he, he wants to be picked up too hit. he and just wants to be at the state of in my lap and perhaps and not in the state the of being transferred to my lap maybe a, a flash dart with jet knives dashing in maybe tiles something like that yeah causing some problems wreaking some havoc trying to push having cases made me swear off pets <laughs> but we'll see they are a lot easier <laughs> that is a preset play that a lot of teams like to do and look i think they're already gearing up for that i think i was I think right on right. the money and i think you may have been right <laughs> i mean it's what i would call if i had jet knives i'm gonna keep it real we had to do touch <laughs> pickup training with emma she would legit fight us oh my god is KO isn't mid to, to do the splash tiles yeah but Sen is already read into this well, as well. Well, bet that's like one step above well, being super like tense. Flash what what, what, would, what did that involve, Lily? Yeah, no one there though. Very Give wise me the tech. Sen, but this is all on Vic right now. That's a deep will smoke. Will he get the entry? There's the paranoia. They're taking all that space B. The question is, will Sentinels take A while they can? He's got the op in hand. Ah, Not going to find a timing window. You're right. Oh, wait. This would be huge. Why do they have an op and nothing else? Oh, oh, he lands a shot on the what side the fuck? He needs to live. Now it's winnable, Doug. Demon one, play it's online. And look at Crash, he's in spot again. He's so far back. I think he's gonna ult the back. I think so too. Oh, the only cap. There it is. Bro. Oh, NRT are missing. so good. No repositions, but three players are detained. Demon one pushing forward, looking to find oh. another, and he does. Oh That's fuck off! John Cleet left alone. Oh come on! And once again, the seeds of a comeback fall upon Demon the Demon one soil. is so good. I mean, NRG are so good. This Just is an eco. Like they have this is an eco. To, something they could use to push back. My camera is destroyed. NRG pull out a miracle. And like. Work up touching her, give her a treat, which she wouldn't react. If she turned her head as her hands approached her, she wouldn't get the treat. Interesting. So she has to not even look at you. You get the treat? Like has to ignore the treat, basically? He knew what the win con was and he acted upon it. Nice thrifty. He got his one and he got out. All those jet reps from last year playing the, the jet on Breeze. You see it coming to fruition now. Hopping on Killjoy. It's so funny how and things work. And honestly, not just him, you know, we talk about him getting value with the off and whatnot, but his lockdown. Why is this team so good, man? The round. Yeah. I mean, their coordination is insane. He's on a neutral reaction with each move closer to her. We did it over many months. Holy shit. Still guns Bad. on the side of Sendles. There's still a chance here. There's still hope. So you see Sendles poking and prodding, trying to find a fight. Demon one's on the other side. He gets the best. Uh oh. Of Zek and Butt. Can Sendles punch back? They're going to get the sight. Zelsis has ult. Yeah, pen flash. Energy lost on sunset, but look at the score line. The ult here. I mean, I kind of almost want him to keep it. It was a 30 round game. Hopes of a comeback, but you got to do what you got to do to win the round. Yeah. Dark flash. Not in sync. And they were Sometimes up in OT something, twice. Something a little bit uncharacteristic. Mm -hmm. From what we've seen out of Sun, normally they synchronize those together to make sure they get a scan. Oh, I don't think they're keen on this, man. I think energy's just going for exits. Yeah, I think so. Just trying to get damage. Yeah. Get more ult orbs up. Okay, oh, that's, that's huge. That's a huge. That is kill. huge. He's got plenty of money. And they don't opt to grab it. The op. <laughs> <laughs> Map three is split. Fast, Sentinel fast split looks cracked. <laughs> yeah, energy look kind cracked though. Zekin like in general. To just be a lone warrior while the rest of the players hit B. It's a distraction. Oh, and also putting, I mean, putting the game in your duelist hands. Go get a pick, go find a kill. Yeah. And so again, Sentinels continue to push the possibility of a comeback. And my concern though is, I mean, there's no, there's really no room for mistake anymore. Mm -hmm. It's gotta be perfect from here on out. 
Yeah, Sentinels have revealed a lot on split already because they had to play a much harder group. And this is where I think John really will come into his own. I like the calling this. has to be perfect. I like this. Smoke bottom mid, knife A main. All signs leading towards A again. Last mm. time they did stuff like this, they actually committed. But Ethan looks like he's ahead of this. The drone tagged one. Now they're contacting him with the KO all. They've got to go fast here. KJ's on the other side. Kills so are on A. Able to pop these Five oh, to five. press. They wait up oh, the they the nah. Space. Where's the challenge? Where's the re-aggress? Oh my gosh. They try to hold back side on their own. Crash, she's falling. Oh my gosh. Or at least staying alive for now. A flash in his face. He tries to turn it. Well played, Zelsis. Well played. Him. Demon one and Ethan left alone. But they've gotten it down to two. Spike's still not playing it. That Zelsis peak there off the flash on the other side is brilliant. Time now becomes a factor. Tag them up. Just All right, how do we use our smoke? The two implants, the two okay. new additions to this squad with an opportunity to take us to split. Oh, that dagger. If they can drop tens and Zelsis right now, Ethan creeping forward. The no, first one tens had the advantage. Zelsis having to clutch and he cannot split on the cards as we're going the distance. We're going to split. We're going to split. From second, quit switching his gun before he peeks. Map three. Misclick or something. Map three. Everyone go all in. Maybe the pressure getting. What are you thinking, Zendikar? What are you thinking? A lot of micro mistakes were made. What are you thinking? But again, going on at RG? Given the stakes, <laughs> given what's up for grabs, for things to settle on split, I wouldn't have it any other way. Yeah. NRG historically pretty good at split and Sentinels this year has been absolutely dominant on the map. <laughs> we have Andy Miller saying one more. <laughs> I'm a true Sentinels believer. There are so many close moments. And again, I'm I, going I all in on Sentinels. Was, Sentinels just kind of and I'm a and very wealthy individual from all of my all inning. The runway was just too short. Let's see if we can yeah, match the Zendikar's 5 million. Late split on the other side of this break we will see you guys in just a few moments we'll be right back uh chat i'm gonna quickly grab a snack refill my drink then we'll be right back let's see if you guys can complete a chess game this time uh i will give you guys the broadcast all right all right you guys have fun i'll be right back catch you for game three don't forget to place your wagers
Small structure keeping them apart. Victor with two on the round. The swing on the classic. That's three for Victor. Rustling around. And yeah, he's just dropping into his face. Getting out of the group was harder. Talking about like the pressure that we felt. So I think we did everything that we could possibly done to be here right now. So we just need to enjoy the moment. They need to enjoy the moment and focus on the task at hand, which is qualifying for Madrid. And for NRG, they have managed to keep themselves alive in this competition. And I would even go as far as to say in comfortable fashion. That was a 13-8 closeout from NRG. Couldn't have asked for a better way to respond after what was a very intense OT matchup. Yeah, that first half for NRG was absolute perfection. The, the mid-rounding out of Ethan was great, and Ethan was just unbelievable. It, it's unfathomable how good this guy is. He, yep. he just takes over games. He's on the team with Demon 1. Don't care about yeah. that guy. This game was won and lost <laughs> by Ethan. Like, and in any moment, whether it was finding some opening kills, whether it was just being dominant inside the clutch, like, the guy was absolutely on yeah. form. All throughout the last game, we were talking about, oh, it's, it's the 10 Zelsus show. They're taking over, right? And then all of a sudden, Ethan is like, I'm going to be better than both of them. Especially and by Zelsus, I meant second. Yes. yes. <laughs> 333 ACS, 3.0 KD. Those are some big numbers well, for threes. a reason. This guy is ridiculous. Uh, in particular, on those post plants in the first half, he was so impressive. Sentinels won one out of nine trying to make it back in. This energy team was really good at calling the right mid round to get into a site. And they had really great synergy when they were in those positions. You just yeah. pick Sentinels apart. But you can talk all day about that. But I feel like what really mattered is that ethan you want to call it a life game but this guy will just del he just Yo, chat, who's winning i feel like that's just like a, a day in the life of him he, yeah. he's so effective you for roll this the dice sometimes he this? hits a nat 20 and he goes thank you so oh, much shit. i really appreciate that uh one day we'll get you in there yeah. uh that being said though uh on the nrg camp we need to we check really paying attention to demon one because where know, it could be demon captured one, by what impact two different it, it's nights it's been quite fascinating and it feels like you know it was a really a tale of like, Wait. Well, I would say two half. But it's kind of hard to. Yeah. Okay. Somebody found the right Robin Wobbin. Leave it to Robin Wobbin to know it's Knight C takes E2. Demon one spot in there. Damn. At least in map two. I, I mean, a little bit towards the end. I, I honestly think like Demon one is not living up to like his full potential today. I think that's just like fair that's to fair. say he was not dominant on a, on ascent. He was not dominant on sunset either. And that's why you need a guy like uh, Ethan absolutely stepping up. Because there were a lot of moments yeah. where he, uh, Demon one, especially on attack, was like the first one in. There was no, a I agree with Ender. The other side, Sentinels were fighting Demon off well, and Demon one was. He's tall. not Demon one but today. Even with Demon one falling early and on, they're still cooking. Ethan was stepping up, and yeah. that's what was so ridiculous about Ethan's performance is that he in a lot of those rounds was playing like two people like he was taking everyone on uh from sentinels yeah and in close series like this it's very rare that you see the team with the jet who's kind of having a, a mediocre fine performance yeah. especially on a map like sent ascent to take it home but that does really put in context how impressive energy winning this one is but still looking ahead to split Bishop i think takes it's going to be absolutely four, huh? pivotal for demon one to turn it you guys forget how the knights move demon one map because i think sentinels look a lot better on split it's their most I mean, you got your fork. Enemy. I would say that if Demon One shows up, I have very high faith in NRG. But also, this shows the class of NRG. When your yeah. duelist is not having a great day, and you can look down the line and say a few different people could step up and perform, that's a team that can perform on the highest level. And you see that heritage on the screen in front of you. NRG has made every international event since Masters Berlin. The core of this team always goes to globals and they always perform well look how many one three twos fours top level placements this core has there was an expectation of them making it and on the other side for sentinels if they were to win this final map and make it to madrid it would be a new step in this organization's history. It would be tens returning after so, so long, yeah. uh, which would just be incredible to see, especially Saucy back on an international. Yeah, I mean, Saucy even second back. back. We haven't seen second. Yeah, yeah I mean, set. really, you know, it's exciting, but it's also, you know, for NRG, uh, what a statement it would be for them because- Robin Wobbin's not an A. No, they're EU. Is this team gonna live up to the hype? Are they gonna live up to the players that they signed? 
And here they are contending for that spot, and they are in a very strong spot to potentially prove those doubters wrong. Yeah, I mean, when you sign two champions in Ethan and Demon 1, you better believe that the expectations All right. are minimal. Home and Viper Cypher Race yeah, Sky. They don't make it e for Sentinels on split. It's standards it gets. Select now. No surprises Nothing out of for door, Sentinel. Harry. Same comp we've seen from them before. Flower 23, thing for the Prime. Did I update the stream title? How Saucy's using that utility on defense. You can run out back and get the of you. It's on the been other a while. Side, Victor locking in the race. That means Demon wins on Omen. They're looking like EG out here. I'm excited to NRG see what they have on split. And if it's enough to take NRG Valorant. to another global event or if Sentinels can qualify for the go. first time in so damn long. Yeah, it all comes down to this. Riot Games Arena, let's make some noise. It's the only way that this matchup could have ended. And let's send it right back to your casters to call the action. He got Doug and Baby Bay. Thank you, GB. All bangers must end on split, and this is no different from the norm, baby. Bay. Yeah, and what are energy I mean, playing? This is Demon One's uh, they haven't shown Omen. yet. They haven't shown yet. First time we've seen him play the Brim. We've seen him play the Astro, but Omen's a different beast. Yeah, I had so many questions about what energy would do when it comes to a map that you have to play raise on, and I right. feel like this is one of those maps where like it's so necessary in any comp that you run to have that raise. And well, we're chest time it, so it over. The old EG blueprint where you put him on that second controller role. Now on the Omen, more like a duelist. You know, maybe you're going to see him opting yep. a bit more than when he was on that Astra previously on EG. Aggro TP's flashing for himself. No, we would have won. You guys got to win faster. He, he gives him a lot more creative agency for sure. And how there you go. Has Victor Demon once playing on Omen. Has he yeah. still been practicing yep. it? Because we Victor's know playing Raze. On this role. Demon one not on Astra. Here. Interesting. All five members. Dude, the omen flash, the sky flash, and the kill for tens. Ah, he just gets spammed. He just gets a spam kill through the smoke with a clash. That's so dangerous to do. And there's a gap in the A main wall. Victor's already gotten back. Side saucy was surrounded and disposed of as oh, Demon no. One continues his fragging ways. Here. And dug that gap in the A main wall. Oh, bet. Demise, but bet. Second gets the spam kill on Ethan. Vix pushing heaven. Vix pushing heaven. Tags John. Applies pressure. Now they have to respond and they have to deal with him. Mark utility out with a classic in his face. Oh, what the away. fuck? Survives. How much more time can he buy? What is this fight? Oh my god. Oh my god. That fight was so classic, close. They're weak. 21 HP. Too many targets to deal with. Sentinels get the pistol. <laughs> um, Let's go. One, Let's go. It's too much of an ask. Yeah. With just a classic. But honestly, who you rooting for, Huge? Getting that kill on the bomb, on the bomb planner. I think it was on Ethan. Just spamming him, knowing exactly where to pre-aim. That actually opened up the entire retake and gave them a chance back into the round. Oh my gosh. But look at the smoke. Like I was talking about, actually ended up getting Demon 1 two kills. One on Heaven, one on Elbow. So almost disastrous. Demon 1 has to learn Raze, man. It's right not now, that simple. Raze is very, very, very was, different from Jet. Was huge for energy. Source, look at me. Those little things can be the difference maker. Not just in rounds, but ultimately in series. It's not that easy, man. And to set the stage for those of you who may just now be joining us, Madrid is up for grabs. There's only one spot left for America's at Masters Madrid, and it comes down to this map to decide who gets to go. I think it's a lot easier for a raise main to maybe learn Jet, for but month. even then, I think having a flex like yeah. Victor makes a lot of sense. Such high hopes for both squads leading into the season. Durka did it. I'm sorry, is Durka going to Madrid? Finally having an IGL that they're much more comfortable with, and then energy on the other side. Because I think they lost to a player who. Of Ethan and Demon One. They lost to a team that has a raise player and a Jet Put player. On notice. Separate. Couldn't have said it better, Doug. Two Titan. Just fighting at each When they need raise, narrate plays raise. So crazy. When they need jet, narrate plays support. I Legends jet and raise are, are so hard. Dude. Like these. They're so different. It just comes down to who answers the call. It's just so slow. It's just so respectful. I'm trying to get a feel for the defense. Setup. Like to play them both at the top, top energy. level. I don't know. Trying to see where the cipher is set up is. Trying to see where all utility is. Trying to see where the gaps are. I mean, they have three members of the defense. Casey has a player plays both raise and jet. But they don't, right? Narrate plays the raise when they want it. 
10 seconds left in this round on the head. Should be impossible. Yeah, Saucy should be able to hit a good flash, but they're planning safe on the other side of the pillar. He's the last one alive. Okay, flawless. Sentinels get the second, and they do so in flawless fashion. Jajima uh, plays both insane. Down, which is, yeah, I think it's easier very, very to learn out. Jet no guns out, if though. you know so Raze. I think learning Raze when you know Jet energy. is a lot more awkward. And we have not seen Because I think Jet can teach you some bad habits. <laughs> she lets you get done. away with and more. We've seen tons of footage on Sen. But even so, Sentinels have been so good on this map. The only loss they had, they already bounced back. Like the day after they lost this map, and already had made so many changes to what got punished. No, I think having a. I, feel like I think flexing him to controller makes sense. Game at this moment of time. So, yeah, energy. Yeah, they have the Blackbuster team. Yeah, they have all these star players, champions. But this is a tough ask. Good flash. Let's go. They've done such a good job of playing around these Viper walls. I know it's early, but you're already seeing the game plan. They're just not really willing to give up any space on A. Yeah. And you see the change of pace. Carbon Car player Martin. Yeah, I'm not saying it's not possible, but I'm saying it's not so simple. No you can't just be like, Dream One just has to aggressive. learn raise. Tens with a deep it's such there. like into the corner it's not that simple i would agree if demon one's agent pool was Sasuke. just jet and like chamber like a certain player now, what do you do as then we'd have a problem because on maps like split where you neither of those so are really meta for our advantage. comp we'd be in trouble but he can play smokes man down disadvantage, uh, disadvantages he's not bad on smokes fault line setup it's no value though flash around the corner there's just so many things that they can use to get out onto the site to take aggressive space. But this smoke, they're just playing on the other side. And we're like, do they have a race player? So Another gorgeous use of utility by tens. Spike it all falls down onto crashies. Sitting on the other side of a trip. Spike out of hand. A bonus for Sentinels. Sen played that. Like they, they took a trophy with D1 playing perfectly. like this. Not giving any first bloods, not giving any picks. To energy's contact but yeah i'm not sure about the omen i agree for their uh, i think astra is a lot easier to sell to me than the omen very very clean play right now from sen chaining utility together let's go peeking off of it having crossfires on top of all that they're a hive mind right now <laughs> love for the young gun Zekin's cracked on both yeah he's Very a raised man though reminiscent to what we just saw them attempt on a yeah, and this mid aggro opened up the lurk for marved on this a ramp let's see what he can do with it there is a cam there though watch her with my friend and she said if i could see all the player locations like the spectators can i'd be so good isn't that just facts though like they're not wrong he got stuck in between trying to figure out who he wanted to fight there yeah such a difficult situation maybe mark oh. i thought that was a collat i thought so too yeah. and he gets re-swung i mean zach can feel it and he knows they have a gun advantage so why not push the pace yeah a deep smoke john with much <laughs> to do down. spotted caught him 4k <laughs> taking back out onto the site though as vic gets the spike down oh this is aggressive from demon one tp's up into heaven Vic tucking. That's so good. This position is really good for Demon One. Yeah, Ooh, the timing Victor's plays so against him. Here. He's ahead of that smoke. The problem oh. is, right now, if they strike in this time window, he's by himself. Oh, spamming onto the second, almost hitting it. Oh, shit. They were divided. That's one duel and away from being Tens really close. His flicks with his aim, you know, like shooting people's heads, but not with the omen flash. I wonder what the lowest rank like would be to make it to that, radiant with wall hacks. Right off a of contact. If I'm being dead ass, didn't know he had probably like a like send in one. <laughs> I, I think if you're lower again. than that, even the with wall hacks, it was so close. You're probably gonna just gonna lose too many gunfights. Okay, you see the paranoia and tens on the swing. That 1v1 is so no important. Dodges, yeah. And Demon One, who I truly believe is one of the best players that I've seen take 1v1s in general. Yeah, for sure. I feel like in this series, he's been kind of lacking in that in that aspect. You can legit UAV call enemy positions every round. Pull him, pull him, pull him. 
have you seen those Spikes challenges? I've done them. Where you'll put a diamond player on the enemy team and they're actually playing for the other team. Their comms are shit. Their comms are bad. When they have all that info, they're not capable of giving it to their teammates in a clean manner. Do they fill in what was previously vacated? Like, yes, it's very simple for you. But we, we've done show matches before where, like, each team will swap one player and they struggle to communicate effectively to their team. That's exactly where Tens is. Has a paranoia in hand, too. There's no combo, though. There's no one that really to swing off of this with him because of the rest of the defenses have already pushed into garage. But the Tens got away with murder. Taking the best of Demon 1. And he's got a tuck tail. He's got to get away. Keep a close eye on Elsa so he continues to push the pace into main, into garage. What an awkward situation. <laughs> Shot has to be clean. Flash in his face. Tries to turn it and stay alive. Zek can now satchel forward with bolts oh, in hand. That and is open. crazy. The spam is just too much, though. He's stuck. Careful here. You have to deal with him. You can't afford Dude, to Dude, Ethan is so there. calm. Finally swinging out, getting to safety. We just ignore flank so Spike quickly, dude. Planted. Spike not planted. Finally, an attempt will be successful. Spike planted. One, two, oh, two. Oh, Tens gets another crash. He's left alone. Can he Let's go! Tens with three on the round as the crowd erupts. I thought energy almost played that near perfect. Yeah, they knew Zelsus was stuck there, but they had somebody holding him the entire time. And that opened up the picks onto other players trying to rotate in. Okay, NRG, when can we when can we feel it though? When can we huff? When can we huff the hopium? He's not. Because last game they were up. <laughs> Three one. Huff this. now. Again, They're going now to Madrid! Oh my god! They're gonna make it! Full steam ahead of Sen. And it looks like They're gonna really make it! Out, as they oh, should, a timeout. Slipping away. I'm just glad my dude didn't get hit in the crowd again. <laughs> He's going to walk away with bruises by the time this is done. I mean, what a start for Sentinels. 5-0. Yeah, they've showed so many different looks. Mine, Nidus, thank you for the hold. prime. They've showed, they've showed a mid hold, and then the next round, they're giving mid. There's so many things they're doing right now that is making it hard for energy to get a read on, on positioning and, and how they're set up and where the different players are. Even just having that sky showing presence in B main. And then all of a sudden you see Zelsus is in there. The timeout gave me space. a terrible sense of foreboding. <laughs> Sentinels are, are in so danger, you think? A five round lead. Full momentum. Tens oh, baby. Top. That's what I like to see. Meanwhile, for energy, nothing but a myriad of questions. Ohm operator. It looks like they are leaning towards this B side. Victor's map, posture is so begin. bad. Oh yeah, if it's so bad, how so come he's radiant? Area because of all the corners and cover that he can have. And here's that sky again in B main, but this time it's all faint. The setup is retake on B now. But energy checked it. They have all the info. Cover going out. This should be a good read from an RG. They're not going to clear. Him. Dog miss. They're not going to clear Zelsis. Oh, this is the wrong. He hears them. He sees them. Again, disaster. Oh my. Wait, they're cooking. And they've gotten out onto the Oh fuck off. Convert. Don't give him a guardian on split. We've seen this before. We've seen this before. Step away. Reposition. Crash, he's as old. Demon one can reposition. If they commit, the paranoia is there. No follow up yet as they're traded. And now the rolling thunder comes through. Waves crashing into the opposition. A little bit of buying of time as John QT plays his cards as perfectly as he can. The cam is still up. He's oh gonna find the timing! Gosh. He gets them both! Three on the round for the leader! Ethan left alone. Can he pull off this 1v2? Attention divided. Nine bullets left. 32 HP. Thank God. E I saw the world where Ethan won that, dude. IGL versus IGL. Oh my. That's so he close. Left. That is so close. Oh my God! Demon oh, one basically killed everyone, dude. 
and John, he's so smart to wait out that smoke and not jump the gun too early. That's what sets up the entire round. And honestly, to go to step back, remember, he was wise enough to take a step back from the fight with Demon 1. Just he understood, presence. yeah. He understood, forget it. I don't need to win this fight. I'm going to provide more value later on. Dude, yeah, John QT was, was not expecting Ethan was that wide. Did you see that? Game. Yeah, but John played that to a T. The timing was perfect. Pew, I cannot believe you did not take a my statement as a joke. For any sort I just of can't any fathom sort of success. that you did not find humor in that. Now look, we're missing the first kill. It might not come this round, but look at Marv. He understands that offers like the reposition, <laughs> offers like tens. Like the How is that not the most yeah, obvious joke in the that. world to you, dude? <laughs> He's so far up, but you see the respect that's being shown. Zekin's playing back in spawn. He knows that heaven may be a weak spot. A vulnerable area. Did that see him? I didn't. Missed the tone indicator? I said it with the tone. I said, oh yeah, if his posture's so bad, then why is he radiant? Like, come on. Come on, I even so said it like that. Out, out. Oh, oh shit. Oh my gosh. And finally, NRG seem to find some success. They seem to find some space. Yeah, exactly. I don't need a tone alive. indicator. I'm using tone. <laughs> How? How? He's out. And now John QT shows up. <laughs> what the again. fuck? Spike planted. Tens persistent in his approach. Relentless and reckless abandon. As he re-aggresses and repeats. Oh my gosh. Now with the shorty still. Oh my gosh, it's not right for him. It's gonna be a 2v5. Can Demon <gasps> 1 pull this off? Oh! Can he pull it off? An angel of delivery! Oh holy fuck! <laughs> Demon 1 played that really well. Tens is on another level right now. Tens is not on another level right now. He would have shot the op there. I'm sorry, but he didn't shoot the op there. He switched to shorty. He misplayed at the end. John QT's Phantom is different. This is all intuition plays and you can see on Chet's face. Back into the action, we go Mark already tagged. Oh. I mean, oh. fuck okay. this guy. Turns out Demon One is still good. This guy's about to drag his team to Madrid, dude. I swear. Andre, this has got to feel like quicksand, no? Yeah. I mean, nothing is working. He has no Everything armor. Falling apart. They're slowly being suffocated out of the map. I mean, they, they, no doubt in my mind, to anybody's mind, we thought that energy was winning that round. Oh, he played anti. Oh my gosh. Okay, he was spotted. <laughs> oh, he. Again, a little bit of room he found. Got him, he got him. He got him good there. Now, it was a 2v5 last time. I know oh, the, no. the chances are ridiculous. Uh, <laughs> for those of you listening at home, you really should be watching, like but it's 7-1. Wow. Sentinels are up 7 Energy on defense round. split. They needed it, especially. Yeah. And Demon 1 is, the last round. I mean, yeah. is looking I like Demon King 78 right now, dude. Like, you to take the timing right away in a scary round, way for Sentinels. There. That's Sentinels are up six rounds, but Demon they're One they're is not place. missing shots. And he even got two on that lurk, and then you have Demon One set up to to secure the round if everything goes south. But he couldn't close. I don't out. think he's gonna go down without a big fight. They had the strat. They they played it to a T, but the individual prowess of Sentinels just they want to close this map out. They want to go to Madrid. Thrifty. They can feel right it there. Why 78? Because he's 78 times stronger. And now NRG needs to string some rounds together off of that thrifty. There is an op online for them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Look like he wasn't even aiming at him. Just understands where the bullets are going to go. His razor moving so Victor fast. As well. A thrifty round heroics proved to be the difference maker. Cool. NRG still down six and op in the hands of Demon One. And you imagine that means we're in for a slower round. Yeah. And look at the look at the buy from Sen. A lot of light armor. It's like they were up 7-0, but every round has been so costly that 
Just that one round one from NRG put them back. They had to go for light armor buys. It seems like they also really Wait, Demon One's mods are streaming to his channel? Maybe. You guys saying I can let Zendikar host my watch party while I'm at Madrid? Honestly, Demon One was not ready for an op being posted up there. But Zach can just whip. Could have changed the entire game. All right, if I don't get a booth, I'll give Zendikar a stream key. Everything, but mail not cleared. And Marv's job here is just listen to the rotates, try to catch this Viper off guard. He's really far up. Yeah. Still has a trip that's keeping him at bay for now. He just breaks it now. Now they're wrapping vents. Oh, that's bad. That's oh, trouble. Oh, what? And he's out. Like a thief in the night. Screen down. I have to see that from his POV. Seeker's invested. That's going to give away a lot. John playing from safety. Seconds left. Now so pushing soft, forward. Dude. Yeah, this is so. Oh. <laughs> Oh no, oh no, they're waking up, well, dude. Normally, Ethan is for, feeling for inspired by Demon One. <laughs> but they just continue to push forward and demand the best out of each other. Ten seconds like iron left. sharpening iron. Oh, he hit that. Both pushing each other to their he literally hit that. The down. There's no flood. They're so weak. No armor. Less than 50 HP on both. Celsus is dropping down. John close by. Spike ticking away. No way. Crash, he's falls. Demon one with the op. Two shots to hit. First one. Oh. And Sentinels get another. Dude, they, that they like Celsus right kill on. was like some fucking matrix shit. Like a, like a centimeter? Maybe oh, less than a centimeter. That looked like danger close. But so smart from Send to double swing there. And honestly, just finding all these crazy kills. The awareness to spam the smoke just dude John QT away. is having a game and a half like right no now. He can't die. Oh man. No way. Dude, what? how? Zone, I'm gonna time you out. If you can't uh if you don't got nice things to say about people, let's be hush hush. <laughs> Look at this. I'm not the drama streamer who wants to talk shit about some other streamer. He thought John was going to keep moving. Yeah. I mean, that's so micro. It's so sad. And I, honestly, I think as, as I think over that replay that we just saw, it's really kind of indicative how things have gone. Haven't it? You see Crash, he's trying to like 1v4 his way out onto the site, yeah. getting his kills clean, <laughs> and then you got Zelsa spamming smokes on the other side and getting kills. It just, it really just seems like for to do it for him. Is falling their way. I don't even think energy is playing a bad map right now. No, except for Tarek that one round. time. <laughs> Bro, the, that's like why I stopped doing it. I did not happen. expect to get clipped so and shipped to his ass. To the to, to do crazy things like 10 I was just commentating on his, like, like he was getting years. so upset about it. And I just thought it was funny because he makes platinum players get upset all the time when he smurfs. I didn't realize I was big enough to get clipped and shipped staff. John he was quiet last <laughs> map it's just a playground for him cover going out so many different setups now he's back site at B how do you read into this double trips for him you know fortunately Tarek has to be the most level-headed guy on the internet Send. all right who should we start shit with now though he already moving away from the cypher site not trying to walk their way into John's crosshairs, who's been having a heater of a game. I think I could take Tyler one in a fight. Patience. He's not that big. Mid here, hold here from Sun. Which makes sense, too, given how much energy have tried exploiting that map uh, or that area of the map. Now they give it up. Perfect timing for energy right now. Do they capitalize? And I like this. 50 second mark is hit. All right, let's back up. Let's not give him any kills. We know a site hit's gonna come soon. All right, I was just kidding, Tyler, but I waited long enough that I can't That's be in the clip anymore. So, uh, we good? I don't, I don't want to fight. Another cam already up for John, so he has the aim. He has the B main line. Thirty seconds. Fall line left. set up to help take ramps. Oh, this is perfect for Tyson. Why do the casters call him Tyson? Classic tens moment. Like I get it, that's his name. But like, isn't that kind of weird? Oh shit! 
explosive moment. He had no and Celsius is just there the, the whole, whole time. time for free. Nine one in favor of Sentinels. And that should just he calls Demon One Chet. No, bro, but Chet is the coach. Down. That's NRG's coach. <laughs> <laughs> you thought they were Every calling. <laughs> You're so insane. dizzy. You're so dizzy. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you thought. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You didn't know. You didn't know. You didn't know. You didn't know. Demon One's name is Max, right? It's not Chad. No, he was concealed the whole time. It was all a bait. Back into action we go. Oh, As no. the round has already started. Frustration out of NRG. Team flashing now. The rollouts aren't even there. It's all falling apart, Doug. Plenty of cause for concern. Oh, John. He's so slippery. Honestly, I think Tyson and Ten sound quite similar. <laughs> no, that's not the point. The who has plenty of experience and was only joined by more experience now left head scratching and looking for answers and normally dre we would look towards demon one to be the one to be the spark to be the catalyst right to get things going again yeah, yeah you tell him Lee. it's okay to be confused is, aside from a couple of <laughs> Wait. In this series that he hasn't been there. <laughs> lily was it you uh, who said you got a picture with the, the is, certain pro playing. Great. And then it was like a completely it's different pro. Or was that new to Buddha? To. Yeah. That he holds himself to. <laughs> that shit was so funny. Second just stays. The disrespect is here. New to Buddha. Which pros was it again? Uh, that was so funny. From top to bottom. Because like they were pros that you wouldn't mech mess up. It's just hitting every shot. Every timing. Every spam. Oh, demon one. He's gonna play with one bullet. On. We missed the clip. There's only five seconds. This yeah. is just too I'm, much to ask for. Yeah, I mean, he's oh. not winning the round. Oh. oh, yeah, it was Cryo, and she thought it was Mind Freak. I mean, when you get a team like Sentinels, <laughs> the confidence that have to make she, these crazy plays. She took a photo with Cryo, and she's like, like I got right a now. photo with Mind Full Freak. <laughs> Second staying, going for the one. Jordan on the rope. <laughs> so Perfect good. Timing on the peak it was too. so good. Knowing the tents had a paranoia coming. You're standing. So insane. Nice shots from Demon One, but that's just too little, little too, late. too late. Yeah. Oh wow. That was Look crazy. <laughs> Dude, Tyson you know is cooking. They have four alts on the attack side. Pooch, I told her it was mine for <laughs> The desperate need for anything. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Lily was the one who screwed gone through this barren <laughs> How did you tell of her? Side on split. Freak. <laughs> it's just so hard. I feel like Senna just been. <laughs> even the same John region. Just been in the flow state of calling, changing up the setups, and everything's been working. And it's not even just calling this game. Like, Sachi on the on B side of the map, he flashed deep B main. Now he can take the line. Tens is holding mid, and Everyone's they have three members A. <laughs> Second is ult. Does he hold? Oh my gosh, he doesn't tag anything. But he saw so much util, he can dump down Victor playing in hell. Trying to find some space, trying to find some value. Damn, the timing there Duel for Victor is not it. To push forward, trampling towards elbow. Oh, John, John QT is a giga beast, dude. And the one on to Victor, potentially the most valuable, potentially the most impactful. Another spam. Demon one left alone. The potential last round of the half. Do you win the these? Of an 11 to 1 lead 30 seconds left oh he made a stop he's been heard oh. he's been spotted he's controller diff ignore that it's a 3v1 for sentinels switching sides all right sentinels you oh I'll, i'm gonna say it i'm gonna say it chat i want us all to try and jinx it for fun we only need two the other one was the rocket cube I mean, you can't make this up. We only I, I need two. Of how NRG would play on these maps because <laughs> I feel like it's been a while since we've seen Victor play. But it looks sweet. We'll see only two, guys. Question. Take it away, how hard could it be? 
in absolute trouncing from Sentinels as they have a dominant lead going into the half and the stakes only again, need could twos, not be higher just here. two for NRG in, to find themselves in this position Ender it's actually quite fascinating because well if they uh, end up missing Madrid I have, we have no EG representation at Madrid. Those, they were the champs. With EG losing earlier and only Ethan and Demon One still standing. Yeah. Those two players that are not black and white on your screen right like now. Back to the future. Better. No, but those two players. This is too soon. Why are you showing me this perfect roster? Better. Bring them own, right? back. NRG. NRG was a team built to dominate. Not here. It's too soon. Like, they, their expectations are sky high. They were the perfect. Here, and it looks like it may just be over. Yeah, we're yeah. only a month in. But it, it, that is dire for NRG's hopes. It's an oof. It absolutely is. And they're up against the Sentinels that no one really had the expectation yeah. of greatness. From. We this had Jojimo for this map. We went to a global event. It was more than 900 We had Bustio. We had Calm. This roster for the last oh, two years has bring had them back. Teams, has had players that you expect. We had Potter. We haven't seen that yet. But now oh. they're just two rounds away from their first international event, their first regional title, or yeah. their first chance at a regional final in almost three years if they could win here dude they're getting wiped right now themselves and for this organization tens won the very first masters and if he wins here again he'll have a chance to repeat it in madrid yeah we'll see if this is going to be the possibility the reality <laughs> a chance to repeat it <laughs> four years later in order to come back into this one and sentinels are right there let's go ahead and send it back over to doug and baby bear <laughs> it's not a repeat i agree 11 to 1. <laughs> madrid on the line we, uh, it's mean, a stretch back, it's a stretch not that long ago just go back to last year sentinels was it's a four, show it's three years later now. and now look at them 2021 right Picking up in reykjavik off season winning every maybe it was 2022 no, no it was 2021 Questions abounded last year. They struggled 2020 was the leader. They struggled big, uh, with having a caller. There were role issues. Big plenty. illness time. And the I'm not even sure if I can say it because I'm live on YouTube. Who knows? John, we'll be so safe. Good, along with everybody else on the roster. Yeah. He just gets timinged. And they were so ready for that. They, they four man swung him. He gets an unlucky timing. Honestly, to go back to a little bit more recent. Remember at the beginning of this That's year. That's bullshit, dude. It was Pancano who was in the works. Yeah. For them to traverse <laughs> all of that and now find themselves here. And Jordan, he he earned his spot. He had to earn it. He had to step up to the plate and be that guy. And when he had his opportunities, he delivered. And that's exactly what Sentinels are doing now. <sighs> Flirting with changing the landscape of North American Valorant. I mean, this is going to mean so much to them if they win this pistol. You know they're going to be seconds left. popping off on all cylinders. But Holy fuck! Oh, oh, shit! Does he go for more? Oh, shit! He's taking a breath here. The amount of drop jaws that I just saw in the crowd was ridiculous. I think everybody felt like... It was gonna be in Sentinel's hands, but Marv has something. Oh to shit! He's done it on okay. His own. Oh, he was ready to get, take the head off his teammate. Can he finish it? Oh, he's Wait given his second. opportunities. One shot. Oh, he's gonna rob him of it. Wait. We're just playing a mini game right now. There it is. There it is. I buy power as to give away a PC. And honestly, it's let's go. Good night. They're still down. So All right, big. Sentinels. Now we just need two. We only need <laughs> we'll two, guys. Again. Oh right? My gosh. Yeah, I've jokingly always said that the Ion Sheriff was like automatic headshots, but <laughs> I mean, that looked like truth there. Make sure you follow I Buy Power on socials where they're giving away a free PC every time there's an ace. And whichever one of you wins it, thank Mark. <laughs> That's chat. That's chat right there. Chat. For those of you confused, keep it as team in the game. I guess, yeah. <laughs> Single handedly. Yeah. Oh. oh, he's hot. The devil. He's just gonna put the game on his back. <laughs> and that's what you need. You need that pop off moment. 
Dude, but it's back it's, to back. So, I mean, it's late. Give him a phantom. Now this would be just something. This would require some crazy antics for Sen to bring this back. If the phantom is John Q T, am I crazy? Like I get it. Technically, Saucy should have it. But yeah, that's what happens when Saucy has it. Haven't we seen John Q T fight this game? It's not even a bad idea to save this if you're John. Seriously. Here. Yeah, sure. Nah, I disagree. I mean, you have a lot of room to play. You could throw it off. Yeah, yeah, go for it, but Yeah. <laughs> I don't think you save it. <laughs> Shameless. And uh that's your plug to buy the team capsules. <laughs> Still having fun with it. Even yeah, 11 3 comebacks have happened more than once. I believe <laughs> but it's okay sentinels only needs two energy gets to three only need two I gotta say, I just feel only like need two this entire series what i've seen <laughs> demon one i've only seen them with an off and a guardian, guardian. Yeah. he's all they get oh we could give him some more we only need two he loves that gun man this would be 11 one comeback no well actually now it would be an 11 three comeback but we would call it an 11 one comeback that is true but it's effectively an 11 three comeback right now can be that spark they need more than a spark that brings it together a whole freaking fire it's just such a large deficit they're staring only need two but they persist or at least attempt to try to defy the odds and those are some massive odds they're up against they have guns though ethan with the stinger crash she's as well just noise being cut across the board from sentinels i wonder here too how this moment how this position impacts sentinels and their play style yeah, we talk so you know sometimes about are you i don't know what do sentinels do playing? though yeah how do they you get there to too if sentinels peel back a little bit let off the gas a little i like what they're doing here i like how they took a control early they cut noise they contact back up mid they're showing stuff towards b to try to bait a rotation out kill them brilliant it. it looks Bears like they heard you instantly rotating oh marv knows to stay they got a paranoia. They ran into this. I don't think it hit crash. He's, he's got a full No, like energy have two on site. Oh. The satchel out onto the side. <laughs> nice shots land though. 13 seconds left. The spike's still not planted. Marv's still not cleared. He's going to challenge the orb. He's going to challenge the John QT is a savior. Get down, Mr. President. How much more can they find though? Crash, he's left alone. Can he pull this off? He's gotten the first and that's That it. is tough. Riot Games Arena, bear witness. The era of Sentinels. That's actually well tough. Sentinels kind of got lucky. One round away. One round. Oh my gosh. Yeah, he just knew. He held Mouse one down. He had no doubt in his mind. They knew that was the only way that they could. That's really well played by John QT, dude. Is it Mark one more round. Into that smoke and kills the bomb planner. For as much as we talked about Demon One and Celsius and and Zekin and Tens, it's it's John who has shined on this map. John QT is actually a difference a maker right now. Last map on that I a lot. I mean, this guy has everything. He frags, he IGLs, he bounces back. I think the most important thing though is he has the trust of his team. Oh, he spotted him. Sentinels haven't been able to do for a long, long time, for years. There. We talked about the dry spell they've been through. The addition of John QT to this roster has been everything. The nade is good. Now potentially putting oh, that is huge. Jeez. On this series, it's a one for one. Mark has a shorty from that distance. Will not connect. Crash, he's dumping you till Vic so far away. And they freeze. They hold. 
They reset. They can taste it. I mean, the bags are half packed at this point. 30 seconds left. Oh, they're so patient. And look, that causes energy to worry about a lurk. Yeah, but this long? This now, nade. committing the nade there. He's just succumbing to his death. Coming to terms with the fact that he's done. A 3v2 number still in favor of Sentinels. Oh, baby. And now quiet across the map. Play safe, come on. Ticks away. Ethan with the flash. Play your time. To make a play what? Flash. Not connecting as the wall goes up. Play your time. Oh, we Try don't have time. We've lost our space. Oh, Tens go kill. Having to reload. Where's the cover? There it is. Crash. World champ diff. Oh, he's so confident. Four bullets left. Switches weapons time. <laughs> <laughs> he's so different. Let's go. Let's go. They're going to Madrid. Impossibly the hardest route. What a moment. They got group of Sentinels. Death. Bro, let's go. Sentinels look so good. Bouncing back off of that last map. What numbers did John QT just put up, dude? What a moment in time. Then RG. So close. It hasn't Not loaded yet. yet. But that has to be the curse. I mean, he just a played a 58 ADR game on Ascent, too. It really feels like we may be at the doorstep of something special. <laughs> This squad went through a Dude, off he played like shit. The Play first two games, he was off. And game three, he was... He <laughs> oh my they god, yeah, 192? They have reason to smile now. Bro. Everyone in the stands. But think that the, the landscape of America's Valorant has shifted in a massive way. It's early, but there's a lot of promise. And yes, it's just been one tournament, but the poise is these guys have shown is impressive. We got to go back to the beginning of this. So let's look at Madrid real quick. Let's look at Madrid real quick. Because this is like full of. So this is Sen. So the only teams we expect were Loud and Paper X on EDG, right? Otherwise, we were expecting to see a Fnatic, a Navi. We were expecting to see an NRG. We were expecting to see like T1. And we were expecting to see like Billy Billy. And that's what we have. What a birthday gift too, huh? Oh, DRX? Did T1, like, get recomped? Sure. 18 and 7 for John to close that out. It's crazy. And honestly... FPX is expected? Really? Bullshit. I mean, I don't follow VCT China. I don't recognize any of these players. What a moment. He is. He's the truth. John is the truth. Him and Kaplan have... An unknown chemistry, or maybe a known one for those of, of you that watched Challengers when Ghost was around. Yeah. But now they're back together in full force on the main stage. Now they get to see how what? they perform up against international teams in Madrid. Sentinels has never looked better, and unfortunately, because of that, we do have to. Bid Billy Billy got to NRG. cooked. Dude, is China have some like secret players? There's still a lot of promise. There's still a lot to look forward to. Are there secret players in China? They were dismantled today from top to bottom. And that last map, I wouldn't asterisk. That's ridiculous. And if you're an energy fan, I mean, we got some. Okay, FPX are like a secret, secret org. They might, they might be really good though. I mean, they lost the EDG. They truly just need more time what comps are they running? To figure out what they're gonna do on maps like this, where the Astra Yoru Viper on Breeze with no Cipher? Huh? At the stage with the Yoru. Huh? Thank you very much, Read up. Huh? 
Yoru fade? What? Huh? Is first and foremost, happy what the fuck is FPX cooking? <laughs> you can't say that in front of me, man. Oh, you sorry, can't say I'm that sorry, in front of me. <laughs> But what a birthday treat and what a what a team they picked yoru on three of the four energy. maps you, you and it, it's a different guy playing them 30 days sentinels is finally going to a regional final again in 932 hey? days sentinels is finally going to an uh, uh, a global well we'll, we'll see them at uh madrid i guess <laughs> I mean, we had to save the organization at least once, right? So, you know, uh, no, but I love Sentinels. Uh, the guys and I, like, we've been working really hard. So okay, okay, like, okay. Like, you won. You know, I would Congratulations, like Sentinels. Finesse, but this will have to do. So, I mean, I'm pretty happy. We will see you at Madrid. If you guys want to watch the interviews and stuff, my stream is not going to be a good place for that anymore. It's time for two, three in houses. That's right. We're staying live for a little bit longer. We're going to play some games now. It's our turn. Our turn. If you're interested in playing, stick around. If you're not, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate you. Have a good night. I'm going to log into Valorant. We're just going to play open queue tonight. So all tier threes can enter. Okay. Okay. Huge Q clear. All right. Tier three subs, you just head over to the Huge Q channel and click join Q. The order in which you join does not matter. Don't worry. It's going to pick 10 random players. Well, it'll always pick me. So nine random players. Don't worry. If you join later in the order, it's not going to be a problem. People on Twitter calling 10s the best controller is sending me into a spiral. Bro, take a page out of my book. I have a lot of people who love me and a few people who hate me, right? When I see one person who hates me online, I feel like shit. So you know what I do? I just don't go online. I'm not on Twitter. I'm not on Reddit. Fuck it. If seeing somebody calling tens the best controller in the world is going to make you mad or make you want to write to them, close the website, dude. Find an echo chamber of people who think like you because this shit ain't like this ain't politics class. You don't need to expand your horizons. I'm just trying to have a good time. And now I'm gonna. I'm playing in houses with the boys. Let's go. I gotta fix my mic. I use this one. Yo, how's it going? Yo! What up? Let's go. What's good? Yo. The Sen W. I'll make Crazy. the. Crazy. I'll that make the party case. Oh wait, I can't show my screen while I put it in. <laughs> <laughs> All right, who are we waiting for? Who are we waiting for? Oh uh, yeah, you like 20 seconds. You're up. No, 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 I mean in the voice call. Oh. Uh, uh, Dyer's here, Zon is here, Sonic is here. Alt for SS is not here. And one of you is here who shouldn't be, rare. Rare, get out of here. It's my yeah. <laughs> <laughs> for SS. Join the VC. Where are you at? There we go. There we go. Let's get this going.
Lotus. Lotus. All right, good luck, good oh, luck. Good luck. Good luck. Defending PCs, uh, Lotus. Okay. What's up, team? Yo. Yo. We we're playing against Bike. Oh. I got a lot of high elo players in this lobby bad. Do we? <laughs> Why are you low elo zone? I mean, no. mid, mid elo. No, Same. it's like all diamonds and up. Yeah, like everyone is lobby. Right? Not too today. All right, what are we playing? What are we playing? Let's get ahead of him. I will play Cypher. Uh, I play Smoke, so Omen. Okay. Okay. What else we got? I've been playing Controller and Duelist. You've been playing Controller and Duelist? What did you say? I could play either one. What's your main role? Sentinel at the moment, but somebody else chose Sentinel. No, we'll play fucking Deadlock then. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we'll play Deadlock Cypher or some shit. Or Killjoy or whatever. It's lit. Hey, Thresh, where you play? Thresh? No, no, no. <laughs> what? Thresh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are you at? Uh, It's my first time winning a queue. <laughs> There's a party code in the, the channel. You gotta join. You got Mike. this. Well, what role do you play? What role do you play? Uh, I'm initiator. I bet. Bet. Which kind? Uh, I could be a recon or a gecko. We're playing Lotus. What have you got prepped on Lotus? Thresh, I feel like I'm going to ask you if you hear anything on the other side of the map, and I'm going to hear nothing during the game. But that's the vibes <laughs> you're giving me right now. <laughs> the comms are like the opposite of good right now. No, no, no. It's just, I got this whole cute thing. My bad, my bad. All good, all good, all good, all good. Yeah, it's the channel where we <laughs> voted for the map. Just scroll to the top. There's a message Turn I sent in it. Or I'll, I'll at you in it. <laughs> no, you don't. I mean, sure, you can vote that we won already. I like that. But you scroll up to the top, and there's a spoiler message from me. You click that, there's a code. Okay, okay, okay. All right, we're also visible from the enemy team. Are you I smoke meth? That's somebody on the enemy team. One, <laughs> one sec. <laughs> Yo, which one of you guys is I smoke meth? Not me. No, I'm dead ass. Who is it? That's alt for That's all for, for SS. I all think. right, Love we're that. gonna have to sub that guy out. I'll get you a new player. We're not Let's playing with that, and they should know better. I appreciate that. All right, we're grabbing a sub. <laughs> we're not playing with it. like that's against TOS. First yeah. of all, uh, I had to open the stream. Like, <laughs> all right, who wants in? How do I pick? Run a raffle, maybe? Oh. Everyone's just saying, let me in. Pen, fl Pen Flash, pick one. You be the fucking bad guy right now. Pick one. I don't have time for a raffle. <laughs> Pen Flash, pick one. Empty. Thank you. Pen Flash is a bad guy. Pen Flash is a bad guy. He picked. Not me. <laughs> Brother. <laughs> this guy literally just like, like, come on, dude. Your name breaks TOS. If you think I, uh, whatever. Like he's also level 15, no rank. Like what? <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> uh. Pen flash, you put MP on the enemy team, to be clear. 
<laughs> he says, damn it. <laughs> you were trying to make my team worse. <laughs> no, MP will follow every call I make without a second thought. We played a decade of League of Legends together. I like having MP on my team. We like always win. All right. All right, draft it. Yeah. That's yeah, that's what we're fucking doing. All right. Oh, my and now cold. I'm going to top it off with the best sauce. Hmm. What seasoning uh -huh. does this team need? Yes! I'm pumped! Yes! I'm pumped! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go. He's going to combo the with the deadlock nade. We need Woohoo Jing. <laughs> uh oh, am I gonna get duelist diffed? Okay, I am not going to match MVP. I'm not gonna match MVP. Say it with uh -huh. me, or else I will fucking flow state and like shit on everyone. I'm not gonna match MVP. <laughs> You're not gonna match I'm not MVP. I'm not. <laughs> Just think of worms. I'm following your guys' calls all around. Uh -huh. Match MVP drop 40 on them? I'm not gonna. No. It's just not fun. Trust me, it's not fun to be on the receiving end of a dude who's just smashing you for 13 rounds. Well, you don't think seeing the death screen is fun? SMH. It's not about that. Swift Potato Ninja, thank you for the $36.82. Pen flash is the coat, never the bad guy. What? Why did you? What a precise <laughs> number. <laughs> Ooch, can you buy Aries for at least five rounds this in-house? Now that's a challenge I like. Yeah, I can do that. Five Aries is, huh? Is it Aries is? Airi. Airi. We've got three air eye. <laughs> There's no way. <laughs> gotta be Aries's. It's probably Aries's. Nobody has ever had to say it because nobody bought more than one Aries except for the. Maybe it's just Aries. There was like a three day period where it was buffed and then they immediately reverted it because it was so toxic. I I missed that Aries. It was so funny. <laughs> it's way too good. I don't even remember specifically what was the buff they gave it. Let's um, do five different rounds, which you buy it. Sure. They removed the spin up timer. On the right. Air. Yeah, 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 yeah. I and think it's then... still a thing. I don't know exactly. I forgot. Valorant, Aries, Ricky. I know for sure when it was broken, they, they removed breach. the spin up timer. Oh, howdy, dude. I feel the headache already. Yeah, it had the no spin up timer. Yeah, and they increased the base fire rate from 10 to 13. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that was it. Was it. so high <laughs> DPS, dude. Yeah. Alright. I am setting it for C. I will jump uh, You want to hold this sensor yeah. by that you put by tree. And you're oh, going to put it into tree there. here. And you're gonna play this angle right here. You see where I'm standing? And when they come they're in, you jiggle until they pop the sensor and then you swing wide. Got it. Yeah, and you just control tree. I'm gonna control sight using your other yeah. one. Lost. Do I have to I thought you weren't gonna IGL. Fuck. <laughs> I'm gonna run it down this round. <laughs> yeah. Run it down with him, run it down with him. Deadlock. Throw Nate at throw Nate a uh root. Throw root. Throw Nate a root. Got it, got it. What happens? I'm already drinking, man. I entered I need to drink where I do my rank streams. What the fuck? I'm gonna throw one way deep. No Ray Raina uh, see? I'm rotating over. I only see, I only saw right now. That's all three. That's all five. That's all five. I'm taking my spot. I'm gonna control backside. They know I'm flank. Drop off you. Just me a little bit. One top side, top side, dead. Last two, uh, one, both water. One and one water. Band. 36 three. Last bend. 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 
Spike down. Nice. Oh, we're cool. at the habit of pressing voice chat. Let's I, go. I, uh, <laughs> they ran into my trip seven times. Jesus. <laughs> seven? You what counted? Seven. You kept it says, counting? It, it says on the right. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, that's messed <laughs> off. Who do you want to do the same thing? Push it. Sure. I'll throw right this you guys fighting for A? I'll throw the Yeah, I'll get a pre satchel. Watch this shit. Satchel out. No escape. Satchel out. Timber started there. Marking up C. Throwing we man. One from B. Bad. They're smoking. I got two assists. I was lit lighting them up. One enemy remains. One more. One more B. Last from B. Let's go. Nice. Weapon here. Come here. Where will they go? Over there. Yeah, wait, I, I lit those guys up. Hey, Ares is broken. Ares is really good. Eco round. I'm gonna play with you, man. I feel like they push this with their guns. Hmm. Alright, that's, that's they one. They might push a B. Okay, um. I'm gonna cross and I'm gonna sit behind this box. Just sound bait for me and then fall back. Alright, cool. I'll throw, I'll throw Molly if they try to push. Yeah, that sounds good. Just hold the line deep and then just fall back after one shot. Oh, They're sort of dead. Which one guy? I'm smoking. Oh, I'm in Alright, flashing. He jumps from C. I'm gonna walk behind him. Please come with me. Just walk, just walk. Let's walk behind this guy. I'm making noise for you. Nice, good kill. I'm rubble. Chamber's rubble. Oh, I can't trade you, bro. My bad. 102 chamber. Pepper's in their spawn. He's flanking right now. Oh. Nice. Good kill. One orb. One on the orb. Oh, yeah, one orb. Oh, it's for me. One both on Reach side. on side. Both on side. I'll call planner. Satchel out. Spike planted. Reach planted. Satchel out. I'm live. Me too. I have no tell. <laughs> oh. Last player. One back tight. One back tight. Uh. Really? Where the fuck uh, is Faye? They were double Kevin. There was Damn. Evan. Yeah, what the fuck? Got mine. Good round. Combat is a means to an end. And we are the means. Oh, hey, I can buy this. This is three. Let's block see. Yeah, it's just uh, get wide and hold the line. Hi, yeah. Nice. I'm leaving you, Gekka. Yeah, go for it, go for it. I'm staying here, actually. I hear one, like, near mountain. They one way to um, fucking see it. Our Omen TP. Oh, I should let's see. Like that, or... Our Omen TP is, let's see. Yo, Bacon, I got it. No idea. Alright. Should I open door and ult? No. Okay, I can pop door for you if you wanna. Over there. It could be like mound. He used to be chilling there. It's all you, little homie. One A, one A. I'm rotating. Not too fast. Oh, I suck. That's right. Wait, why did we I'm all in here. <laughs> I was trying to get info. <laughs> I thought they were all safe. I can get again. I can get again. I can get again. Oh, bad, bad. 30 seconds. Go back up a little bit. Crazy brother. Stuck. Wow. <laughs> wow. They're they holding an op outside oh, door. 
They have 20 seconds. Have They're going to have to have hit it. Have you seen Omen? No. Nah. I only saw if they didn't breach. Cover going up. 10 seconds left. Fade took the orb. Is that on all chat? Yeah. Spike they have no down B. Funny B. Oh, Grim was <laughs> A, heaven? What the fuck? <laughs> it did past. When Raina gets what started, it's fuck? hard to stop her. I'd like to avoid that, please. Or? Uh, I can buy you, Gecko. Oh, for sure. Please, what you're doing? I think they'll hit C off, but uh, C, honestly. They one way to C main. There. C. Yeah, uh, I have a wall bag off your contact on your trip. Ah, uh, that's. Maybe you got, uh, good luck. Oh, it's alright. I didn't know you were up. Wow. Oh, never mind. I'm sorry. They cut noise. They smoked on the uh, mount plant. Three, three C mount. Uh, didn't see breach or chamber. It's okay. Leaving, leaving, see, coming towards there. I'm returning. Yeah, I heard them. There. Hello, come with me, eh? No surprises. What up, eh? Face your 30 fear. seconds left. Opening door. Sensor drift. I'm stunned, heaven. They're running on sight. One close sight. I timing the drift. Good that lock's dead. Yeah, I'm on flank. Play slow, slow, play slow, slow retake, relax. Slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, no, I got all, I got all. Relax. I've got flank. I'm soaking through. All three sides. Wait, side. wait. Flood now. You till now. Spam. Fall out. Go, go, go. One enemy remaining. Nice. Yeah. I fucking, I fucking IG. I'll totally shit by that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll play classic this round. I'll play classic this round. So oh. use util, right? All right, let's take front A space and let's get a huge orb so we can have all. All right, bye. Okay. Uh, huge and deadlock. Do the nade combo. I'm gonna one way deep. All right, I'm gonna talk about my this right here. Okay, safe push. Press spamming on the line. Nothing C. Holy shit. Satchel out. Careful of B. One from B. That's two yeah, like that. I'm smoking out. I'm falling off. I'm low HP. They're on site. Ah, blind. Blinding. Nice. Bitch, you can't take my bandle, right? Oh, yeah. ah. Going up waterfall. They have an up now. Running. It's. In the Wait, can you take my vandal or no? Oh, uh, no, you're. Nightmare's over. Nice. One, um, one upper. I can smoke in the open so we can have, like, some space to walk out. Grenade! Last player standing. Uh, in the corner on upper. Oh, oh no. Call back. How am I the only one who got killed? How did I get two? So I got he's not coming because he cooked last time. Bro, I have to keep myself dialed back. <laughs> really, it'll be too one, one sided. Gonna... Actually, never mind. I'll just play C again. All right, this is my fifth Aries buy. I'm completing the Aries challenge. Let's make him dance. You want to play? Let's play. Nothing, see. Smoke me, eh? He's opping, Asu. Oh. Oppie, Oppie. There's Gecko Flash. 
Alright, oh, I fuck. Three, We're done. Two. I'm not swinging off it. I called it. I'm an idiot. They open flash them backing off. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, chamber is like in this the right side of the <laughs> yeah i found four i'm only three ah, i think that's One an acceptably rubble. stupid play chamber right? still attack spawn brother i suck Blinded. two and three last player standing Ultimate one more tree ready. and that's on the beach No I'm gonna play A this round. Okay. Fast. I'm gonna pick up C then. Yeah, let's play. Come with me, C. Uh, let's buy for next. Let's buy for next. Buy for next. I suspect. I suspect the hard C hit here, honestly. So I'm pretty C sure. I'm gonna buy Aries then. Uh, Dela, come with me, C. Can you put a sound sensor like on this box? Yeah. Somewhere close to me, yeah. so they can't just like rush me down. I'm yeah. gonna put a cam in the. Uh, uh that's a little too far back. It's gonna stun me when it pops. Just put it forward more. Is that a thank you? Reloading. Yeah. Breach for pushing B. I hear one like I'm smoking one. from B. We can walk at sea here. No, no, come play C. Play C link. Does he have targets? Just one or two. I know my smoke fall on C. They're not out yet. They're fade eyeing, they're coming out. One flank, one flank, one flank. 111 chamber, 94 fade. Thirty seconds left. Back Under chamber, a hundred fed. Spike planted. Last player standing. <laughs> Jesus. I'll be right back. I'm grabbing a drink. I'll give you time. They will scurry, and then they, they didn't die. pick you. That's wild. I'm playing A again. Did, Did we win? win? Yeah. Thank you. Did we win? Uh, no. Oh, okay, bet. What the fuck is? One orb. Three. I saw four. I saw four. One's grabbing orb. There's a trip pooch. Oh, damn. They dropped orb. Oh no, this one faded. Nothing there. There's 3A, 3A, 3A. 40 Oh, what? That's tough. Uh... Their backs will be towards at least one of us. I'm buying C again. Okay.
Aguas, keep your guard up. Eighty breach. We have not seen chambers. Sensor down. Ah. Oh, chambers okay, lobby. Right. Here it is. I'm running around to see. They might rotate to see off of the chamber pick. Grab the door. There's still one door. Smoke they too. smoked. Breach open door. I'm coming back. This will happen. Chad, I have to keep it on the bomb box behind. Back we need to play off the deadlock yeah, trip, dude. Moment. It's so intuitive. I have to resist. I explained it pistol round. No, okay. The rounds are so free. Nice try. I think Chamber's just holding uh, the B walkout and then rotating towards the C walkout. Pass a little bit. I'm holding long here, Thress. Yeah. Woo! Off on C. Give me the sixes. Nothing seen. Sensor down. They still have an Odin A. Ray to have an off on C. Crutch that lock. Just hold. Crutch. From B. Oh my god. I mean on top of rock. Oh, their op is A side. They have two ops on. Looks like they're coming in. I got revealed. Omen TP'd out. Here comes this party. Whoa, <laughs> shit. Omen out drop. 30 seconds left. Chamber's still rubble. Or... There's one uh, rubble. I'm waiting for you, Sephir. Spike planted. Yeah. And really me out. Last round in the half. Spend those creds before we lose them. Mm -hmm. Okay, help me fight for C. Can you throw the flash that flashes around? I'm gonna win my deep and then push up. Yeah. The they have an op holding this every single round, so just be wary of that. Yeah. One see. Odin A again. I saw two. Target spotted eight. noise for you, Omen. Yeah, we're gonna need like a smoke there. tire. Okay. Yeah, I'll do it. There's I'm pushing out C. Three A. Right now, one lock from B. Yeah. Somebody ran, uh, she's running C. Fade A, please. I made her. Yeah, they're running C. Hold with up. It's all you, little homie. Grenade. Satchel out. 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 Problem 
problem solved. Ten seconds left. Enemy seen. Spike planted. Last player standing. Target down. Omen's on your right. Yeah, Omen's in the No charges. Oh, oh that's right. Oh, shit. The Odin strikes again. Switching sides. I find them. I kill them. Simple as that. Do you want to just hit C since they only have chamber? Yeah. yeah. My camel spot his uh, walkout. You guys want to flash all right of this? Yes. What happened, I tell you? Not for sure, for sure. No one's speaking? Hey. No, there's no flash. Cover going out. I'll flash right. no Shadows trash. <laughs> How much you suffer? Yep. Three. Three, two, one. Back up, back up, back up. Yep. Yo, check flight. ACT. Check ACT. flight count. We're good. Nothing. We can play off. Two CT, two CT. Yeah. Yep. Somebody's there. What, bridge waterfall? I'm looking CT. CT one. There's one more CT. Like it's clear. Like it's clear. I can walk out CT now. That's all three, all three. 26 seat, uh, stairs. One door. Omen, backside. Enemy One opening the door right now. Landed flank. Last to side. Nice. Nice, nice. get around. Let's go! I can't see them yet. Let's do the classic uh, A push. I'm alerted. They can't really stop us. Yeah, if we need to. <laughs> Give him a taste I'm gonna of keep your cross. <laughs> I'm gonna cage cross. One flash. There's one more, one more. Stairs. Yeah. Breach is here. Nothing from C. Never come with me. Three. Right. Nothing three. Oh, one, one, one back tight. Oh. I'm looking drop. One enemy oh, remaining. Thanks. I hear him. Factor down drop for whoever has a stinger. He's grapple side. Nice. Okay, we got this snack. I got his legs. Can I Let's try go. to restart? Too long is for fun in house. That's true. Good advice. But I'll play classic only. Yo, whoever died last fun round, here. take my Aries. Bad. Okay, uh, okay, here, take bomb. With all contact from B. And then... Andale. Actually, let's take months. Okay, it's a little late. Let's take cool. months. Please get, get gold and then One, move back to no, B. Chamber push, chamber push, chamber push. Headlo He's crossed, he's crossed. Okay, can I have flash? He's got the flash? All right, but... Satchel out. Satchel out. Yeah, okay, grab board. No Reloading. All right, perfect. They smoke. We're going to open the door and then we're going to hit B. Right. Let's hit B, let's hit B. Get good kill. Yup, going to. It's all you, little homie. I'm playing secret. No one secret. Reloading. Reloading. Over waterfall. Reloading. I have marble. Wingman's planting. Over there. Reloading. Spike sticking. Thanks a lot. One flank. Oh, one flank. One flank. Got you. Bomb by now. Thrash is ready. I'll flash again. 
gonna hold close for contact. My waterfall. Cover going out. One enemy remaining. Oh, waterfall. Oh, yes. I didn't want to. I didn't want to concuss you. Going. Keep going around our spawn. Run, little man. With you, Gecko. Oh, go, good run. Uh, I was gonna ult for you at deadlock, but I didn't want to get you. It was really close. Mm. The battlefield changes with every play. Deadlock, can you lurk front B? Everybody else just goes Wait, see did again. The, did the first guy um, claim the hot dog, Nuda Buddha? The first guy? Everybody else come see deadlock, lurk front B. Go, action. Yeah, go late, go late. No, front B. then it's yours. What? Why is that um, Who's grab the orb? You can hold that site. If there's no mod mail, I'll pay you for that. You need a flash early. Flash. Wait, let me get orb. One's on B. I think I tag him. He's gonna tag him. <laughs> He's kind of judged. Oh, he died to my nade. <laughs> nice. You gliding? Let's get to Wait, for man. Watch my water. Yeah, yeah, we'll give it a reasonable time frame. Watch my water. I'm holding okay, CT. We'll give it a few days. Don't expose yourself to CT. And then we'll pay you to move. One B. Yeah, someone's there. <laughs> Two CT. Coming on door. You're better than this guy, Thresh. Kill him. Ah, 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 ah. One more CT, one more CT. Don't worry about Sight. Cypher's got that guy. Kill him and Thresh. Oh, I'm not him. Back side now. That's CT. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Right, huh? Flash, why are you trying to, like, hurt Nuda Buddha mentally? It's her fucking hot dog. She earned it. <laughs> also, Nudu Buddha, the please hot dog sign was sick. Can we make that a sticker? <laughs> Over there. Oh, I'm flashing instantly. Thank you for this. Shadows traveling. Satchel out. Oh, Holy shit, from B. That's from B. Oh, oh, I'm glad three, that's from three from B. Oh. Oh. Three, I think, sorry. Last player standing. No, we've had zero sticker slots forever, chat. We have like over a hundred stickers. Confused why Nude is so on about the hot dog. Lots of C, lots of C. Just, just playing A. Uh, they actually can be A now in the time they used to be wary. Yeah. We know more than we did before. Who needs to like how you have every piece of you go. Amber peak C after every like all of you almost died like died. It's wild. Where you guys want to go? Dream big, make it happen. Here comes. Huh? Satchel out. Satchel out. Wait, wait. Satchel out if you guys want to push in a little bit. Find the box, find the box. Nice. Uh, reaches. What well, reach waterfall? Let me ult, let me ult, let me ult. Okay. We can see. No, like you just said. Uh, I'm just gonna hold what I got. I'm kicking off of you. Reaching, reaching. Reaching, I'm gonna be CT. Come with me. I don't know. Wrong character. Reach, reach. I'm in CT. I'm with you, Cypher. One enemy remaining. Okay. Go get her, buddy. Oh, traveling. Oh, God. Probably saving his gun. The, the econ's terrible. 
He doesn't have a gun. Oh, he doesn't. He'd have to have somebody else's gun. Uh, on the box, on the box. One tap. Nice. Damn, Zon, you saved my life there on the chamber. You're a beast. <laughs> I don't know about those right. to hit him. Like, I can only see like the outline on the screen. Yo, get heavy armors on. We have a teammate who can only play classic. Like, we, our money will never be a problem. <laughs> it's huge fault. Are you talking about the one where the banana peels the, the peel at the top? Yeah, that's one no. of the first stickers. I was curious how far Nudabuda could take shit. You want to play? Let's Turns play. Out really he's picking, far. he's picking, he's picking. He's yeah. picking? Alright. Yeah. Splash him. He's wide. Nice. One more scene. One more, one more scene. Let's just take this seat. One waterfall. Take seat. Cover going one, one's waterfall. Blinded. I blinded. That's high, though. One enemy <laughs> remaining. Oh. <laughs> I love the sea cam. It's so nice. <laughs> See your house in there. He says laughing at the sticker usage chat. Use your favorite stickers. I like to come use when we push A. You guys want to bait it out? One stairs, Reyna. Cover going out. Bomb, buddy. Going Molly stairs. Oh, one on the right. Should I ult? Should I ult? I'm ult. I'm ult. One upper. Coven. I'm looking grab. Face your fear. Red drop. That's drop. That's one drop. Stairs, Reyna. Thanks, little man. Ooh. Ready, chopper. I'm on way and grab. Reyna's downstairs. You can swingers on you better. I'm just gonna drop. 80, Reyna. Last player. One drop. One drop. That's my fault. One main. Uh, NT. Oh god, you aim for the head before you click there, you kill him, Zon. Not even joking. For, yeah, I know. You shot three bullets before you died, so if you just shoot one at the head, like take more time, you'd be a beast. Yeah. It's an issue I'm trying to fix right now. I'm way too panicky when I get into a fight. Yeah, this shit is in houses, man. I'm gonna run out and die so I can watch you. And if you don't rush your <laughs> shots this round, I'll donate money to charity. And that's what's the uh -huh. problem because it means if you rush your shots, you're literally <laughs> taking money from charity, <laughs> asshole. Oh no. You got that? <laughs> no one's speaking C. No one's speaking C. You can you just walk up. Just walk up. Next. Uh, I got deadlocked. Man. Cross. I'll cover, I'll cover. Damn it. The face smoke front C. Wait one sec, I'm killing them all with my classic pistol. He's a CT side. Yeah, that's one CT. Bad. A couple of CT. I have blind if you want to push this. There we go. Alright, Zon. I am watching you now. Oh. One flank. <laughs> one waterfall. One waterfall, one flank. Where is everyone hiding? You liar. <laughs> He's pushing out B link. I'm not counting shots in the back, by the way, Zone. Understandable. <laughs> oh, too close to me. One enemy remaining. 
care about charity you fire a warning shot <laughs> you want more sorry buddy it's over so, i'm just gonna run up and die proceeds to kill everyone the classic not my fault they took the fights poorly i was a free kill he was actually trying to die i was <laughs> i'll i'll go dive b this round you guys wait there. maybe and then i can watch it on Sure. If you go too slow, it doesn't count either, Zon. You just have to try to aim for the head and shoot. So Nobody has a 100% right. headshot rate, man. Thank you. Satchel out. Team receive. Alright, hold on, hold on. That's smoke from there. There you go. Oh, wait, you got this. You got this. Alright, I'm dead. Kill confirmed. Cage triggered. Let's see on. Get him, wingman. One water. Yeah. You, Three down. Uh, One enemy. Nah, nah, nah. I know, I know. Nah, bro, you're actually you're basically kicking puppies with those shots, asshole. Slow it down, slow it down. Just die to this guy. One waterfall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Push one. I'll give it a zone. Yeah, and nobody else fight her. Everybody else die to her. Damn. Whoa! No! What was those first shots? You didn't even aim! She showed up on your screen and you clicked! Match point. Over there. What the fuck? I'm gonna ego this chamber from C. I'll do it with you then. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. Cypher could do it. I know Cypher's good. Kicking puppies is crazy, right? Can you believe this Zon guy? <laughs> I knife like this, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> I've had this issue since day one. He's I'm blasting puppies right now, right? Nice. Oh my god, I missed. Oh, that wasn't deep enough. One went uh, uh, upper. One's close from B. Bomb him. Planning. Off your feet! Don't mind not planning anymore. Keep it away. Just, just, uh, the fun begins. I should not have been there. Is door broken? One flank. One flank. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is door broken? One enemy remaining. Last one flank. Last flank. Flashing with you. Flashing. Does he have targets? Just uh. Oh, let's go. Attackers win. Let's go. Yeah. GG. We did it. We brought it back. Who would you match MVP'd? I played classic only for an entire half. If I match MVP at that point. Oh, get fucked. I did not. I didn't even team MVP. <laughs> get fucked. <laughs> You're literally spreading fake news, Robin Wobbin. Love it. Oh, cool setup. I, I don't know why I see Darwin's setup, but. All right, clear the queue. Reminder, if you join the queue earlier, you have to rejoin now. I clear it because sometimes people go AFK. Already in the queue. Okay, a lot of people trying to play right now. Bet. The sun was in my eyes. Yeah, we can ignore the round where I, I 1v1 to you with a classic. That was, that was cheating. Damn, we got the squad trying to play. All right, reminder, it will randomly select 10 players from this whole list. Anyone can play. Let's see who it picks. Oh, uh. Yo. Yo. Oh, yeah. Yo. 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 
Oh. Wait, I'm playing Helldivers. Wait, how do I leave this? Oh, <laughs> quit game. You're gonna leave your brothers on Helldivers? What the hell? I quit the oh, game. Is that, is that a kit? team game? Is that a team game? Wait. No, it's not. I was playing solo. Is that Hell the real divers. LF up team? I was, you can play it with friends, but I was playing solo. Is that BMX kid and we, hippo? It's a game about freedom, that? democracy, and no, liberation. I literally just ended it. Okay. Bro, don't you want to shit on me, though? Why isn't the lobby like, starting? Every time? Somebody joined who didn't pop the queue. Let's see. Da, 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 da. Sierra, did you pop this queue? I don't see you on the list. I. Oh, did I not? Damn, I thought it would only show up if I pop no, it. No, everyone sees it. it. Get the right, hell out of here. Okay. That's one solved. Beastles here. So yeah, that's Dingy. Oh, let's do team captains. Dingy versus Fivo. We're both Cypher players. <laughs> and Fivo uses the tag certified Cypher main, so it's only fair. Oh, shit. For real. All right, who are we well. missing? Who are we missing? Uh, Dr. Turnip, join the call. Oh, shit. There we go. All right, let's vote captains. Oh, let's vote captains. We got two cypher one tricks. It's gas. We'll see who's oh, the man. better cypher. I think we actually yeah. have three, including me. Oh, shit. There's three. Okay, well, Gage doesn't have Cypher in his username, so... <laughs> My bad. <laughs> also, you have you also have Cypher and Killjoy selected. Or, sorry, um, oh, true, Chamber true. Killjoy. So you're true. less. Uh, vote for Captains. And Dingy, of course, is a Cypher YouTuber. Wait, what? I didn't know that. Fucking gang. No, <laughs> Dingy, I didn't bro, know that. I've watched this guy to get better. Lock in, team. Okay, YouTube... Yeah, you can go. You can go look up all of his setups right now, and then you can counter strat him. Well, okay, because this is days, so. this is this is where I'm. This is where I get the advantage because I'm too lazy to make setup guides, so we oh, don't know all my shots. I like that. Uh, if your Wait, name is in the not reading? voted column, then that means you have not voted for two team captains, even if you think you have. Oh, click I haven't two voted people, yet. BMX Hippo, Brillo, Dingy, Kit. And five o. Five o. Yeah. Now it's just. Thingy. Now it's just five o and turnip. <laughs> oh yeah. I didn't realize I could vote my. So. Bam. There we go. I just fuck. All right. Uh. Mm -hmm. Shit. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna go, go off big number. <laughs> okay, weird. I'm get. I'm getting hit. That's wrong. I'm a yeah, big number strut. Oh, you get two. Yeah, snake drop. Oh boy. I get two. Hmm. Get who? The. I mean, Gage. does Hooge want to be on my team? Yeah. Big number. I wasn't picked last. Let's go. You guys gonna make me last pick? That's really fucked up. Just like in dodgeball. Oh, oh boy, boy I'm on you just me early. It looks like Dude, I'll try not to throw this scene on, don't worry. <laughs> yeah, are you insinuating oh, that the I other times again. you were oh, hey, not hey, trying hey. to not throw? Yeah. Uh, no. I was playing Brimstone on Bone. Oh, we're doing random. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Sunset. Uh, Sunset. That's a good uh, cypher map. That's a really good cypher map. Alright. Who do I play? Wait, so we go hippo and gauge and five up. Yeah. Are you guys a squad or what? Yeah. I mean, hippo and I are a squad. squadron. Oh shit! What are we defense? Yeah, we're okay. defense. Too bad. I look really stupid with my NRG no. card right now. I look really stupid with that, don't I, guys? <laughs> I mean, I've got the Fanatic card. <laughs> oh, At least yeah. NRG oh, I guess they lost 2-1. Fanatic they got 2 owed. Make... They didn't even make it. Well, neither you did see, NRG, just dude. Use... Yeah, need... well... In... Just use the default uh... disc, or use the default Dude, I'm so hyped. Me. We get Sentinels mm -hmm. versus Loud rematch. Best of five tomorrow. 
His yeah, loud fucking of, nobody's slap gonna care. sentinels on day one. Loud wins. We'll see. Yeah, I won't bet money on it, but Sentinels were top they wanted the rematch. <laughs> I mean, there's not really money to bet on anymore. Zendikar just dropped. Well, actually, no, Zendikar did Zendikar drop lost all five his points. million. He lost all his he points. He dropped five point seven million into the huge economy. So now the economy is just thriving because Zendikar dropped five point seven oh, million. Yeah, yeah. Bunch of into it. Voting for the opposite team. So now so many people have so many points, more points than they know what to do with. You guys ready? Always. Yeah. Seven hundred ping. Wait, five zero has seven hundred ping. Uh, it's the visual it, bug. It's cosmetic. It's cosmetic. It's not. I don't actually cosmetic. have cosmetic. It's cosmetic. <laughs> so who's? What am I playing? Don't care. I'm going to the bathroom. So I'm good to lock in cipher. <laughs> oh boy. Wait, wait, wait. What if I steal a sova? What if I steal a sova and he gets random luck? Wait. <laughs> yeah. I'm kind of feeling. Oh, my bad, kid. I guess we'll. No, you can go if you want. Oh, for real? I'm going. What if I hovered oh, the wow. sova? He already, can, it's gonna give it to go him because he's on the top. You're gonna see Wait, my dog shit open for it. Yeah, it's how yeah. it works. Yeah, first that literally ruined the let's for me, finding that yeah. out. I don't know if I take it from Hey, but I think you just go Yoru. Nah. <laughs> I don't want Yoru. Fine. My three notebooks came in today. I'm so pissed. Or I'm so happy. What? Fine, I'll play your W. <laughs> Wait, aren't these teams slightly like skewed in our favor? Yeah. Nah. I kind of like. Hey, Gage, have you hit a mortal? Who I know about? Uh, it's in three, so no. All right. Yeah. Hooj, I was debating whether or not to lock your Sova while you were gone. <laughs> I thought you said you gonna were lie. gonna I not troll. Uh, this watermelon guy came into my Valorant DMs and told me to lock Yoru, so I locked Yoru. Okay. Yeah, I picked you so I wouldn't have to deal with your your your. What? <laughs> Level one. Level one. Probably, Probably an EU viewer. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. this is NA. I, I cannot read. Yeah. All right, this is gonna be my second time on Omen Sansa. Wow. It's my first I'm just not realizing that these teams are a little on bit a unfair. Yeah. Why the hell I do this one when you teach me. I'm going deeper, Sam. Oh, yeah, they yeah, have We should trade okay, classic skins. Oh, wait, my wait, gosh. Wait. God, okay. So, uh, oh, that's why. I, ha Ooh, I have Hooch's stream open, though. We should trade classic skins for the memes. Isn't that my classic? Yeah, wow, it's in the one. garbage. Just like I don't just want like, that one. It's like the game. What do I do here? Do I like walk up? Okay, I'm throwing my TP to B. Yellow flash? through there, Wait, Cipher. Oh uh, yeah, I have flash. If you go elbow, flash I'm gonna be doing the one way. Time to jump. Time to leak lineups. What? Right. Watching it. I have flash elbow. Hey man, I'm just flashing. Nothing. Nothing what is that lineup? Yeah. It's not a lineup. I made it up. Elbow. So there two. There's two. Two elbow. Cloning. Neutralized. One, One dead. Four elbow. Down A. Reina I do. One med. I got one. I got Reina mid. In the elbow smoke. In the elbow smoke. Yeah. yeah. Out. One enemy remaining. Nice. Spike I'm double down. Sorry. Uh, wait, wait. Hippo, stay alive. Don't peek. Hippo, don't peek. Don't peek. Okay, Omen okay, died, okay. Arena. Uh, don't swing. Uh, don't swing until we're both clearly dead. Uh, Omen died, Arena. Hippo, wait. Don't swing. Last don't swing. Standing. What the fuck are you doing? Let her oh. 1v1 you. Shoot her leg. Pull to a close. Yup. Good. Good luck. <laughs> I think you guys are like equal HP. Shooter, bro. This shit's king. This is real life. Oh, let's go. Light. Easy. Light. <laughs> what, what was that? Why did everybody oh, stop? What's the background? Beautiful. What's the background on that? Why I just not? wanted to give Dr. Turnip odds. It's just 3v1. Oh. 
fair enough. I'm just realizing these teams are a little bit unfair. Exactly, which is why I yeah. turned it into a more fun conversion. Okay, so so are we allowed to buy? I think we, we should all save her. this round. I think we should all save yeah. this yeah. round, guys. Oh we should all save. Save? Oh, everybody full save. Full save, but I got you. Fivo's on 800. And then we're gonna buy five off. Fivo is on one thousand. Fivo is on. I don't know why. It says that forty. Thousand four. I just hooked on dude. I think B man. We'll never expect me to push our own. Okay, I guess I can just have five. Are you good? Oh no. Yeah, I'm good. If you mid, care. You got it. Yeah, I'm mid. Judge that respect. There's like a lot. Side for mid as well. No, I'm going to B. They're definitely hitting B. God. No, they're going A. Oh. Yeah, they smoked off the coast. Plenty A. Spike planted. The hell is Reno? Kyle's, Kyle's. Reno, Kyle's. Nice, Woohoo Jin. Let's double flank, full noise. Silva's back to I flash. I can flash your elbow. Scanning flash ahead. Elbow. Found them. Enemy spotted, A. Anyone else? Enemy oh. <laughs> One the enemy remaining. Find the ball. Uh oh guys, we lost the round. Clutch. NT. Got mine. Got mine. Who's it that was 50 ping? And then it. Ah, Sova. Alright, let's buy all up. Okay. Alright. Well, Kit doesn't have enough. You have to buy an outlaw. Close enough. Such. Yo, Yo mine's got a Everyone hold on. mid. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone hold mid. I got you right. Like tiles sure. are just straight up bot mid. Yeah, yeah. I'm down for some tiles. Okay. I got you right. I got tiles. Back. Poor turnip. Cipher can't be. Nobody's. No one mid is absurd. If we die to the A liquor, so be it. Here, they deserve it. Nah, I'm watching A, man. Nah, nah, nah. Stop You're watching A. Alright, oh, like my B. Dude. It is B hit. A B retake, five ops. Double yeah. hit. Whoa, well, four ops and now low. There they are. Deco. I got oh, random through a spoon. Spike planted. Yeah, same. Go. One mid. <laughs> Damn! One mid. No. Oh. Last player standing. <laughs> Bro, that dead just random two people through. Okay, spot. wait. We had some difficulties the first three rounds, but my thing's back. They got our ops. We just turned a little change. Guys, yeah, they have our ops. What do we do? How about we go five share? Wait, why do I have 457 uh, damage per round? I'm pulling up. I'm pulling up the uh, Johnny PK darts. Okay. Actually, no, they're gonna shock. Them. If you want, I have a very useless lineup on this map. Funny though. Sounds Nothing fire. useless. I'm crossing. Crossing. Shadows traveling. Cross together. Sever came on in. We should all walk up. That's all fun. Nah, I'm leaving y'all. Goodbye. Yeah, all right. Typical Yuri player. Revealing area. Trip. One bot mid. Jeff bot mid. Nothing A man. Nice bot mid. Oh yeah, my. That... 50 on Jet. Time to jump. We'll take what gun did you have? The sheriff. Yeah. Enemy tag. Oh shit. Okay, he's just holding okay. my TP. So I might have whiffed a little bit on the side here. Funny B. 92 on Cypher. Planner. Last player standing. Whoa. On site. One head glitch. This is our radiant silver man. Clutches. Sheriff 1v3. Oh. I'd I'd win that on low ping. Try something. <laughs> so true. 
I'm not gonna lie for a second, I thought you were saying I would not notice. Well, that too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Hooch, I'm buying a judge. I've got ult in one. You wanna both go tiles with our judges? Nah. Oh, alright. I'm going to be mid. Yo, I'm gonna, re I'm gonna play B side, but I'll recon your A main. Uh oh. Wait, 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 let's not leak the tag. Cypher cam on I B. Standing ahead. Oh my god. Apparently my recon lands elbow. Oh no, it, it lands Thank up you. on a roof and scans A man. That's OP. Oh, nice. nice. Go, woohoo, Jins. Did you just calm go woohoo gins? I said let's go. I got oh Cypher shit, on Cypher diff. Cypho. Cypho. Cypher differential, guys. I got Ren on B main too. I don't know how to use my nid. One is it enemy bold? remaining. My ult is ready. So I'm like oh. knife out running through mid right now. They're opping and spawn. spawn. Oh. I got one knife off. I got him. Nice. Why didn't you have really a suck. My ult's ready. Remember, wipe the prince from your All right. It's just good crime scene etiquette. This is a special message. I have my ultimate. Where should I go with it? Need a drop. Yeah, you're okay, you're okay, okay, can you buy it? Is... Yeah, I got you. Thanks. My Are you going to go, Obo? Oh, I'm going to do the one way. No. Yeah, dude, I'm like on the hardest autopilot of my life. <laughs> I'm gonna recon your aim in. But. Because I'm just cool like that. Get out of my way! Revealing area. Do I just try to prep my dash? I think I missed. Get A. I'm dead. I'm oh, ultimatuming oh, A. General site. Hit 4 I'm pushing you, pushing you! Oh, you I know what the exactly fuck? where you are. Ciao. On nice. site? I cannot believe you didn't come out of your ult as he was killing me. Nah, I bait my teammates. No, but that would That's be baiting crazy. me. Uh, I just bait them and don't kill them. Fake teleport. Spike planted. Planted behind the gen. Oh wow. Unfortunate. You're right. Bro, what's happening? Good damage, good damage. I tried to prep dash and then I pulled out a sat or I didn't pull out a satchel, I put out my nade. I don't even know what's happening. Alright. We're broke. It's okay. I have this fun gun. Dude, that was I'm almost rich. as cool as the time when you it's said, like no, do you have my back? <laughs> Pooj, that was almost as cool as the time yeah. where, 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 where you Pooj, asked, you do you have my it? back? Uh, yeah, I'm no, I can't. I'm darting back. a main this round. Yeah, you're good, you're good, you're good. One wing, the main don't stop it. Oh my god, it's A! There's one more deep main. They're joining in. Hello. Deploying drone. Doesn't see me. I didn't see anything, man. I knew it. I intentionally didn't clear the smoke with my drone, so they just wait. Oh my, can you come play tiles with me? Tiles, tiles, tiles. Flashing tiles. Hold up, hold up, I'm wrapping, I'm wrapping. One uh. enemy remaining. Spike down mid. Area. Oh my. Yo, are you trying oh, to hit them? That's going through him. It was literally going through them, I swear. It was like you're trying to miss them. It was literally going through them. They demand a fight. Well, I'm pretty sure I'm like thing. lagging or something. It's gotta be lagging. <laughs> okay, dude. Be the lagging. lag excuse. Oh. One tap. One tap. Alright. So I hit two headshots on that Reyna. Two headshots. My smoke mm -hmm. timings are terrible. Mm hmm. This one Bro. recon I learned for A main is actually kind of sick. Whoa. Wow, lineups. Cool. Mm hmm. 
You'd be lining stuff What's up. What's a lineup? I definitely Wait, he's just lining just stuff up. Oh, I forgot to. Oh, I'm cut. That'd be big. Perfect. Why is that? I'm no, hold on, guys. I'm gonna go for a knife kill. Take flight. Okay. Cypher's on. Yeah, three, two, one. Bad idea. Bad idea. It's all four. Cypher's tiles. Hold on, I got Cypher. Don't oh go. I got him, I got him. 54. Spike down A. I don't know, man. Cypher's going top. One enemy remaining. Cool. <laughs> I'm ahead. still 105. Likely as well. Elbow? Okay, yeah. I'll throw the rod. Don't worry. <laughs> No more. Oh, yeah. Bro, what just happened? <laughs> I thought he saw me, so I pulled out my gun. Not ready yet. I don't care if there are five this of them or like, fifty of them. Just a dream. Let's go. <laughs> Can I get a buy? Pretty please. I'm no, absolutely cipher dipping dinghy right now. Like if we win this, it's definitely five O being better than dinghy. Oh yeah, totally, man. You are Holy so hip -hop. much higher on the scoreboard. No hey, nasty flex it. Wait, I'm not allowed to shoot well? My bad. Hey, what? Okay, I don't have a gun Wait, here, Take my gun. Where now. are you? Yeah. Bad. My bad. Oh my god. Okay, no, now I'm gonna bait you so I get my gun back. Shot. Oh no, you're just a goat. Thanks for the gun. Yeah, Someone is he is a classic. No, he's a gun. <laughs> Die. Good shit. Didn't ping anything. Fuck, I need to die to turn him more. Give her confidence. What? They shot the clone? They're running out. They're on site. They're planning for elbow. At least two on site. Shit's over. Spike planted. Reload. Scanning ahead. Oh! Turn the smoke. I want you to cosplay Zon. Bohujin. I'm gonna tap spike and get off. One enemy remaining. My oh my, my god. god. Good stuff. Oh my god, is that. <laughs> spike with you. Is that EG calm? Yes. Oh Where's that going? God. I can't even see it coming down. Big something nice. <laughs> it's off to a new map. If, if you max bounce it off up. the ground, bro, that shit goes high. Yo, Hooch, what Vandal skin you got on? <laughs> a good one. <laughs> Do you want champions? Nope. I have that okay. one. Wait, what wanted. champions? The 2020? Or, or is it 2023 is better. Oh, no, 2021's the best champions. Nah, 2021's oh, worse. 2021 is li like objectively worse. I'm dead. There's three the enemies. Begins. I know exactly what happened. Uh, 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 so uh, uh, He's on me. Wait, what? You so probably need to change the cross there. Sucker A link. I don't know what I'm doing with this ult, but I'm gonna do something. Oh. <laughs> oh man! Oh, I hit Rain in '94 there. Give me a moment. I might actually be the worst race player ever. I don't think it's a crosshair. I think it's just I like was playing a different game and did not warm up with this. This is uncharacteristic whiffing from me. Uncharacteristic. No, no, I call it characteristic. Go elbow, elbow, elbow right now. Okay. I'm just throwing my rotational I'm TP. reconning for you, eh, man. Go kill. They always recon. I like being recon. Reloading. They didn't solo die there. Or Cypher Gamma. We're in a deep. One deep. I'm gonna let Dr. Yeah, Herdin kill me. I need to give him some com confidence. Over here. Yeah, I got Jeppy, man. Dead, 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 dead. Dead, dead. 
Wait, my trip killed him. I didn't even kill him. The trip killed him. The trip killed him? That's hilarious. Yeah. One enemy oh, remaining. No. That was definitely I'm a thing, dude. But we got a nice turn up. We got it. We got to give It's 1v5. We got to even the odds out, remember? Enemy spotted B. I gotta get myself in the middle. Why did you kill her? What? Last round. I don't know what I'm doing. I think he comes pretty clearly to go for the knife kill. I think that was pretty shot him, man. I feel like that's mod mailable. Low key. Oh. Didn't follow the comm. The hell. I'm going elbow again. I'm not going. I'm just living right now. I'm going elbow again. Nope, I'm blind. Hey. Scanning ahead. Let me keep jump shotting for me. I'm gonna flash over. Take flight. Can you break the drone? Oh, that's their drone. Oh, we're doing. Oh, oh, it's their drone. <laughs> okay. I know exactly. Ooh, player 40 standing. elbow. I broke the drone for you. One of them was in flash. Cypher like diff. Cypher diff. True, true. <laughs> Ooh, unlucky. Oh, no no Cypher diff here. That was clean from him. Wait, six, six. We gotta Switching clean sides. it up. Nah. I just don't know what I'm doing. Nah. Okay. Boy, raise. I need more lineups. You wanna do something dumb? I don't, yeah, sure. Bat. Okay. Double satchel okay. in the market. All blinded. I'll try my best. I'll I'll smoke you tall mid then blind market. Let me rebind my... There we go. Bro, what is this lineup? What are you looking oh, at? Oh, I have one. I have one from right here. It breaks the trip in market right here. <laughs> this is such a dumb lineup. I'm gonna move you with my satchel, by the way. <laughs> Can you move me? <laughs> No one crossed. No one crossed to my lineup. What's the hell, man? Sacred tip red shield. Standing ahead. Move. Reconning top mid. <laughs> Cover going out. <laughs> one in there. Decoy reloading. 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 Ouch. Cutting through. One enemy remaining. Oh my god. What? <laughs> no way that just worked. No way that just worked, right? Wait, you're good. Oh my god. Oh, I'm lining up the wrong thing. Oh, wait, gifted. You saw the that. Bottom right? of the diamond. No, I didn't see it. Who saw, who saw the fake clone? Who saw it? Raze. I think you respected it. I was not seeing seconds. anything. The bottom oh, okay. of the right diamond. I'm sorry. Wait, who gave fight. the duelist bomb? I'm full running on the site, bomb in hand. Oh, all this the supports are on the other side of the map. This is like unacceptable. Yeah. As a duelist player, I should never have the bomb. Shadows traveling. I don't know what to do now. Let's just Boom. get Me either. Nothing top mid. Wow. Cool well, recon. Epic. epic recon. Here, I'm gonna give him the bomb. I got the spike. Yeah, I'm gonna give him the bomb, guys. Okay, I gave him the bomb on hey, right, Don't worry about it. Now. Okay, I have the go to flank. No oh my man. god, <laughs> red like a bull. Obvious setup, bro. Red like a bull. Oh my god, there's another one. I got another one. Oh my god, there's another one. Did they just all go ahead? They were all behind the box. Inside. Oh my god, that is so funny. I'm too For sure. They just kept popping out one by one. Alright, gifted. Where do you want to double satchel? Double where? Oh, where do you want to double satchel? I'll blind you. I don't know how. I'll go mark it. <laughs> Mark it, but I'll blind you. I'm gonna mess up Lujan's lineup again. No, I've perfected it. Cover out. Out. 
Yo, who choose? Look at me. Oh, no, I'm reconning top me. Oh my god, I'm dead. Oh, I'm gonna get look, at, look at me, who choose? <laughs> this is like so precise. What a shitty lineup. Oh my god, I'm big at it. We get like a Yoru flash. Black egg. Oh, I have two shotguns. One, two, two. How can I kill her? The BP, man. One more CC. I'll drill. Hold up. Yeah, I got oh, it. One BP, man. I got it. I'm 10 health. On top boss. One enemy remaining. Nice, good trade. Bless the BP. Night, night. Revealing area. You guys on 200 pig. Alright, we can't lose. Even it out. No. Get out, you shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Never had a doubt. <laughs> Everyone calm down. <laughs> what? I'm very calm. Yo, I've got a lineup for calm. top mid. Let's smoke top right mid. Here. Everyone walk yeah. up. And then I'm going to shoot the it. god lineup. And you're all going to pop out with my dart. Oh, bad. So Wait, smoke top mid. Smoke, do not peek before the smoke blooms or you're trash. Talking no, to you, Hippo. Yeah. What? I would never. S oh. Smoke top mid. Uh, I tried, I one tried really down. hard to peek before it blooms. All right, you guys ready? I'm darting. Oh, oh dead. Get ready to pop through the smoke. Here comes the dart. Okay. Boom. Go, go, go. Oh, I'm hit by a troop. Yeah, go to A. Oh. I got you! Yeah, go I got you! Find us! Just go to A! Just go to A! Fuck that guy! I love my teammate aids me. No! We have numbers, you idiot! Thank you! Now you'll rule! What? Deserve. What? Deserve. What? What? They play off me, 5 a Mods, what? give Hippo a weak timeout from Hujin House. This doesn't follow the call. He says knife him, I knife them. I say you rolled, he doesn't do shit. Uh, what? I have my brain off. My bad. That isn't fun. There's no other trip. You here, don't need brain I'll on follow, to follow the call. I'll follow every call you say next round, Too no late. matter what. You're an L teammate. L teammate? So be it. No. One enemy CG. remaining. Last player standing. Nice. Good shot. Thanks, guys. Why a timeout? He's committing the cardinal sin. I'm mid rounding and he's responding with no. <laughs> it's the cardinal sin. Oh. He mid rounds, I, I say you. yes, chef, every single time, all game, because I'm a good teammate. Right, I'm just, guys, uh, I'm just I'm a really little really 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 for us. Okay. You're a bad teammate. I'm just messing around. No. So, Silva, I'm just, you know, I'm sorry, Wahujin. I, I know who you can show this trip. You want, yeah, you want me to shock it? How about we all four run down B main, shock the trip, and explode? Okay. Okay, and I will run out on the side like a good Yoru man. One just dashed down there. I am ulting. I believe Cypher is on the side. Oh, Axe side Sova man. with Odin. No, I know exactly. Really goofy for a fight, sorry. Playing drone. Mark it. Cutting through. I'm smoking mine. Yeah. Really, he's hiding behind the box. Yeah. Right. Our spike carrier is oh, dead. Oh, flank. Spike Dude. down B. Uh, uh. Bullseye. Last player standing. No, he's shorty diff me. That's a ping differential on God. Not cope. One sec, I gotta learn a lineup. <laughs> oh my hey, god, this guy look at mid game. Mid oh, this is B man. This isn't is, is this not an L teammate move? Left. So it's a W teammate move, man. He's getting better. Wait, wait, if he wins the round it's a W teammate. W He's teammate learning. uh move. Got it. Revealing area. <laughs> no wait, mine's first. Ten seconds left. 
Oh. Uh, <laughs> G, G. I mean, it did find both, so. That's the new tech. You alt tab for the lineup, learn it real quick, oh, really? tap back in, and play for the clutch. So real. Swobo, could you sell a shock, please? Yeah. Thank you. See, Hippo, I can goof off and follow the com. Alright. It'll never happen again, Mr. Wahoo. I'm gonna smoke it'll your top mid. It'll never mid. happen again, Mr. Wahoo. I'm smoking your top mid, and then I'm immediately ulting into their spawn in a funny place, okay? Done. Okay. Done. I'll recon Here, this top is called mid. the bomb peak. Spike dropped. Nowhere to run! Oh, they're just ulting. Scanning your head. Go get him. Cutting through. I'm so good at this game. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, there's a trip top mid. Wait. Last player standing. Oh my god, right. everywhere. I don't even care. I killed Dingy. I think That's I could CP'd Market there when we killed Cypher. For my shadows, they will hide mm. It's okay, it's okay. Mm. My GP was worth, don't worry. I, I hit the other 80. I feel as if we go A. Go A, but... Do you want a flash? How do I get on this box? Okay, well, Hoochin, what, what kind of call do you have for me? Oh, I, mean, you have to I don't one have one anymore. Is it one though? Can I only I had a vision at the time. My bad. And you, you, you spat on it. They removed that, Hoochin. My bad. Yeah, they took it no, out. No, I'm trying to jump on this box. One sec, guys. They, they took it out, that. bro. Wait, one sec. Let me jump up. I'll get it's it. It's in the game. You're just like... Kind of girl, bro? Wow. All right. I'm not gonna flash main. Hey guys, help me. So he's oh, he's a he's feet, feet. oh my, oh my god. god, get I got one in the back. I got one in the back. Cypher 80. Man, I was just standing there menacing. Cypher 50. Cypher 130. One bot mid. Oh my god, I suck. I'm flanking. Reyna is Cypher's bot mid. Shock dart. I was smoking five. Rain of flank. I'm gonna smoke right here. Nice. One tap. But I'm playing. No, 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 no. 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 Yoink. Cypher's <laughs> me. Bro really <laughs> just said, yoink. I'm gonna hit 80. One side. Cypher diff. Cypher diff. Okay. Look at these cages. Go get them off the bomb. Last player standing. One enemy remaining. Last 80. Oh, nice. oh my god! Let's go! This guy's radiant! We are strong because we are together. Don't forget That's why that. I yoinked the, the, the vandal. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. I think 5 0 could have clutched that too. <laughs> Alright. It's is, just the I way you The maps do don't feel interactive enough. I liked the jump, made it feel more 3D. That is the craziest take I've ever fucking what? heard. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. Oh. Smoking your tongue, man. Wait. <laughs> I don't get that, bro. Oh, that's Nobody gets that. that. That's Getting the weirdest ahead. take I've ever seen. Can you shock the trip? What's she up, eh? Yeah, give me a moment. I'm pretty far. Yeah. Right, I'm oh, sorry. Wait for you. Apparently, it's sitting There's in one smoke. B. Shadows traveling. Yeah, I got one top man. One still weird in man. Trips. One still in man. I'm gonna drone for you. There's a oh, there's no trip. There's no trip for my team. I didn't even market. break it. Can you break right the trip? Here. It's close to me. <laughs> it's still alive. Wait, huh? Right here. I'm in the dark now. He's caged up. Like I'm droning. I know exactly. Spike down, B. Oh, oh I got oh, a lineup for that. 75 silver. Yeah, There's one left side side. No red side. I have the spike. Two on fire. Two on sight. Oh, I just GP'd into them. Last player standing. Spike down, B. Thirty seconds left. No, take them, bro. I'm one for one on raise hold. No, two for two on raise hold. Out of charges. Let's make you three for three. I don't know. If That's a high ass. We're gonna have to orb farm the shit out of them. I have Yoru ultimatum in one. I'm going to take the orb B main. 
No, that's mine. I'm getting that orb. <laughs> no, I'm getting that orb. <laughs> no, no that's my orb. orb. No, that's my orb. No. It's actually All right, not fine. Orb. I'll get the orb on A. But it's my orb. Swing top mid again. He's out. I don't know. Wait, I just lagged out, but I'm alive. No. Lag. Out of charge. Gun. Uh -oh. really different in close I'm the better player. I think my trip hit his body. I'm swinging your CG. One enemy remaining. I'm the better player. Flawless. I full ran killed both of them. I feel like for this Next last point. round. I saw the display. I don't know what kind of cringe stuff do you guys know. I, I my train of thought. All five A main. All five A main. And we're okay. instead of going elbow, none of us are gonna go elbow. We're all going main. I'm flashing. So at round I. start. I'm, I'm also flashing. flashing at round start. I'm flashing. I'm camming. I'm throwing a flashbang. I'm satcheling into both. Flashbangs. I'm not gonna tell you guys where I'm, I'm throwing it, but I'm throwing it. Prepare your eyes. Oh. Okay, we got Cypher top. We got yeah, Cypher A link on the right. On the right? I just heard Cypher camp. Yeah, right side. Keep going, keep going. Cypher? Uh, it's cancelled. So I'm gonna ult it. He cancelled, cancelled. Yeah. Luckily, flank. Good trip. Oh, oh my god, all three. All three, all three. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait, don't fight him. Holding, holding, holding. Holding, holding, definitely holding. Hold the line, hold the line, hold the line. One enemy don't remaining. Fight don't holding. fight them or Do hold the line. All of the above. Still holding. No. Ahead. Mid. Fight this guy, fight this guy. Wait. Yes. Yes. Yeah, GG. GG. Let's go. We did it, guys. Shot shot. We won. Let's go. <laughs> Dude, I want two to row in the in houses. It's a new record. Yeah, wow. some game. This is crazy. What a cypher diff. 5 0, you did it. That's what I'm talking about. You did it. I got Let's go. On still. Let's freaking go, guys. Defenders That's win. Freaking go. Defenders That's win. What's been good? GG's dingy. Unfortunately for you, our team had the better cipher. Our team just had the better cipher. <laughs> oh, this round was tough. <laughs> I think uh I think the trap play, you can't have the Cypher Util shown until you get a kill. What are the turnip 1v1 stats? Uh, four and three. Respectable, respectable. All right, what time is the match tomorrow? Uh, VLR. Do, 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 do. They don't even show it there, America's. Lab vs. Sentinels, best of five, 2 p.m. Okay, bet. Trying to do this super hard cam, kept being late to the util, that's tough. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go raid. I'm gonna go rest for variety in the morning, and then we have the best of five watch party. Where should we go? And we should go to T Dog, right? support a QOR will single-handedly give the tier two scene some viewership peace out everybody thank you so much for coming to the watch party hope you guys have fun and playing in the in-houses appreciate you guys catch you tomorrow morning peace out peace out